Everybody, and welcome back to the highly anticipated 11th episode, I think? It's your highly of, anticipated 11th of, episode. Of Eberron City of Towers. <laughs> oh, there's always a wolf somewhere, for some reason. <laughs> that, uh, um, the Sharn Wolf. Yeah. <laughs> the, wolf of, the Wolf of Sharn Street. <laughs> That's what it is. Um, oh, you know, you know, Leonardo DiCaprio. Uh -huh. De apostrophe Caprio. <laughs> like, Leonardo is up there doing blow and doing <laughs> <laughs> blow. <laughs> little stuff up in the sky with the tanes. Leonardo DeCaneth. DeCaneth? Leonardo oh. DeCaneth? I've I'm got a, little... a new Eberron yeah. NPC. Oh. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a little scared of whatever's happening in the chat. I clicked just to see the stream and uh, what? for a moment. And someone, the first thing I read was beer bot as an infant would be a toaster. And I have no yes. context as that, to what is context. happening. That's the context. The brave little toast. Colton's here. Yeah, 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 I was going to say, Colton's here. Colton, yes. Uh, after Colton, uh, after, a, after a long a period of not being able to join us, is finally able to join us again. Hell Welcome yeah. back to the table, Woo. Beerbot. Uh, very glad to have you back. Woo. 
Um, I don't think there's anything else. No, to just say. jump into it, Jack. Right, I'm excited. So, we want to play. Yeah. Okay. Sweet. Well, then I'll uh, get into the recap. So last Tyler left rebuilt Rena. Uh, yeah, so that's true. Uh, that's, oh, that's, that's, that's also good. Yeah, we've we've uh, taken some stuff from the remaster that was released by Paizo, and uh, Tyler has completely rebuilt Rena. Um, so some things are different. Yeah, so some things are different. It's very, very exciting. Some very cool but stuff. A lot, of, a lot of the same. Some are different. Yeah, it's still the same old Rena that we know and love, but with some new new features. <laughs> <laughs> Some new, some <laughs> yeah. she's got some new guys. Oh my god! Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah, with the new Pathfinder up to <laughs> she, she took the fifth uh. level feet. Teats. 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 No, that's the difference. Yeah, no, those are much sadder and droopy. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh damn. Also, what about toots? Uh, toots. I guess one thing Sparts. we can't say is we did level up at the end of last game, but I don't think that was necessarily on camera. You no, said that. You're right. Was it level five? I can't even remember. We were level five. Did we level up at yes. the end of? Okay. Yes. yes. I know you said level up at the end of the game. That, I, I, that. Okay, that's why I couldn't find it anywhere because it was off oh, camera, and then we yeah, didn't play for like a month and a half. <laughs> yes. but, um, so. You know, it happens. It happens. Um, well, anyways, yeah. Without any further ado, take it away. Yeah, let's do it. Back into the recap. So last we left off, um, the group was trying to find a, uh, our, our Storm Tower 6 friends, were trying to find a solution friends. to unpetrify their favorite boy, Aram. Um, the, the road was uh, long and windy and involved immolating a man, but eventually the group <laughs> met up with Nightshade, an alchemist and member of the elusive and dangerous aberrant marked assassins guild known as House Tarkanon, uh, a former, a former organization that Sev belonged to prior to his joining of the Storm Tower Six, mm-hmm. and uh, it was a tense standoff with Nightshade at first, as she uh, revealed to the group that uh, Sev had betrayed House Tarkanon and killed two of their members while on a job. Um, but the tension was quickly diffused by the arrival of uh, House Tarkanon's leader, Thora Tavin. She informed the group that she would be willing to. Pro- provide them with a concoction that could free Aram from his stony prison. Uh, but in exchange, the Storm Tower Six would have to infiltrate a secret House Jorosco research and development facility underneath uh, the Grand Hall of Healing, one of the major hospitals in the, the in uh, Middle Central Sh- Sharn, um, and find um, one of their lost operatives, a, a halfling named Fillion, as well as an amplified version of the drug known as Dragon. Blood, which is known to uh, enhance the power of magic users and dragon mark wielders alike. House Tarkanon is interested in acquiring this concoction. Um, so the group came together, put together a heist. The Grand Hall of Healing was infiltrated by uh, Sev and, and Rena. Shenanigans were had. Um, uh, the, the rest of the group prepared in different ways, and once uh, once it was around midnight, the group. Uh, infiltrated through the roof, down the laundry chute, put on uniforms belonging to the staff of the House of Healing, and successfully, inf- uh, n- not only successfully infiltrated the secret R&D facility, but also managed to raid the payroll safe in the administration <laughs> Hell yeah, we uh, did. wing. Um, That's our payroll. I hope somebody wrote down how much gold that was, because I completely forgot. Um, I think that you didn't give us an amount. I feel like that was also the truth. I think so. You I'll just said you later. got it. You don't know how much it is. Yeah, because I wrote uh, get all. I was supposed to come payroll, up, take come all up with that in the last month and a half, and I completely forgot yeah. about it. All so I, all I have written down in loot is three potions of healing. I would have. Yeah. So you guys did nick some potions of healing. Yeah. Let's just call it. Uh, you guys got. You guys got uh, three hundred gold <gasps> from the safe. Whoa, 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 whoa! Hang on. Nobody fucking start taking that. <laughs> taking that? I think you. I have, have it. it. My three hundred gold. <laughs> I will I will diver, disperse. Just make sure that's on me. Anyway, sorry, go ahead. That's okay. Um, then the group infiltrated the uh, the underground, uh, or rather under tower, I suppose, uh, secret House Jorosco R&D facility. Uh, located Fillion being guarded by a House Jorosco nosomatic chirurgeon uh, known as Dr. Adi Yaren de Jorosco and his, uh, his small squad of, uh, of armored constructs. What? Sorry, go ahead. Hey, Emma, that's coming through uh, the speaker. Uh oh. The, oh, the stream. Uh, the stream. The stream is. Uh, rather under tower, I suppose. Uh, <laughs> We're hearing ourselves. Yeah, oh, wait, speaker. that means probably. No, it's just because it's open over there. Give me a sec. Well, I mean, it's probably looping. Oh, I think, I think, I think, she, I think she fixed it. Okay. 
Hey, hey, mark off your bingo cards. Queen Emma fixes the stream. All right. <laughs> Thank you, Emma. Well, it's also Emma's fault, so. <laughs> it's all right. Hey, Emma can do no she, wrong. If she fixed right? her own mistake. That's yeah, true. Right? That's true. That's true. Sorry. That's okay. Um, the group, after a uh, harrowing ordeal, managed to defeat Doctor uh, Doctor Dujarasco and uh, freed Fillion, as well as plundered the uh, the R and D facility for all of uh, all manner of classified files. They uncovered a variety of uh, secret projects. Uh, there was a project Sweetwater and the attached project Venom, uh, which resulted, which was inspired by a uh, terrorist attack by the Emerald Claw that Stick confessed to perpetrate. <laughs> um, There's was a fucking video I got there of you was with a, all your war crimes. There was a project <laughs> Juggernaut, man. which was a, a joint House Jurasco and House Vidalis. Venture that uh, was attempting to uh, use magic to produce uh, super soldiers for the Five Nations. Um, that project was discontinued as well. Um, project Kyber's Blood was discovered, which Ooh. is the uh, the enhanced dragon's blood um, serum that the uh, that the House Jurasco was able to uh, create. Um, they through Kyber's Blood, they also found the means to tamper with Dragon's Blood, introducing certain uh, reagents to it that would allow it to produce effects on those who consume it, such as petrification. Mm. And it was uh, it was told, it was uh, in, Dr. Uh, DeGerasco emphasized that the information should be passed along to the Boromar clan immediately. Um, and additionally, Rena found um, uh, a project as well, the project Whose, whose name I'm not remembering at the moment. Oh, um, it's the it was Project Among uh, Us 3 yeah, It was Project Project mm -hmm. Among Us, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, project Amogus. Um, no, it was a uh, Project um, Project Good Spring. That's what it was. Uh, project Good Spring, mm -hmm. where um, uh, an apparent health drink that was um, <laughs> used by uh, created by Jurasco and houses Jurasco and Galanda, um, but uh, from water from a. a Spring that was connected to a, a manifest stone to Thalania, aka the Feywild, um, or Thalanus, aka the Feywild in Eberron. Um, but after some, after the control group uh, started pr uh, having some strange uh, voices speaking in their head and urging them to do all the evil things that they should never do, um, the project was quickly discontinued. And uh, Rena decided to drink some of that stuff. I drink the forbidden juice. Yes! So Rena drank the forbidden Gatorade. <laughs> drank the Among Us potion at 3 a.m. in the no! R&D facility of House Jurasco. Somebody in the Discord and posted Walter White being like, No, Rena, don't drink <laughs> the Among Us potion at oh 3 a.m. The Among Us potion. Um, and um, we ended last session with um, a, a sinister voice in Rena's head saying, At last, as Rena blacked out. We're just in the other room. Yeah. Here. Yeah. It's <laughs> <laughs> just. Uh! <laughs> uh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. <laughs> oh, the I see. It's the Bethesda fall. Uh, uh. Rena, it's dark. Uh oh. <laughs> you stand beneath. Actually, I, hold on. Let me let me put on some different music. Actually. You, you put on some different, you're not in this right. scene. You put on some different music, we'll please. Do. Something, something <laughs> uh, sinister and, and, and fae-like, if you can. Please, thank you, I love you. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> you got a boss. Um, are you gonna play Carmilla dancing again, or? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's dark and sinister. Yeah, let me hit you with that. <laughs> um, you stand beneath the dark shadows of tall trees that stretch high into the dusky sky. As your eyes adjust to the low light, you find yourself standing in the midst of a great garden contained by thorn-bristled walls. It is full of fantastical flowers and preposterous plants that you could never find on Eberron. Dimly glowing chrysanthemums that hum in the twilight, fly traps whose maws could ensnare horses, thick beanstalks that could climb all the way up to the sky, and more. Butterflies and bees colored like the night sky flip from flower to flower amidst masked gardeners that pay you no heed. Your entire surroundings are of a slight painterly quality, as if someone took a storybook and brought it to life right before you. And at the center of this story is a woman leaning on a staff, the upper half of her face obscured by the hood of her black and purple robes, smiling at you. We meet again at last, my dear. Welcome home. She waves her hand and reshapes a nearby garden bed and its contents. Stock and root become chairs, and a large toadstool flattens its cap into a table's surface. 
There is so much catching up to do now that we've finally gotten in touch. I guess so. Have a seat, my dear, as she heads over there and um, leans her staff up against the toadstool table and, and mm-hmm. takes a seat herself. Um, the whole time she's moving, it's, it's like the hood has like stayed in place, completely obscuring the upper part of her face, but she never loses this persistent and somewhat sinister smile that stretches across her face. I, I just kind of almost nonchalantly just kind of mm. join her. And uh, as, you, as you sit down, uh, your arm starts to glow as Puck just emerges from it and immediately heads over to the woman and kind of curls up in her lap. And she says, oh, Puck, my darling, welcome back. Thank you for bringing dear Rena back to me. Oh, good boy, good boy. What the fuck? So, how are things? Going, I suppose. Things are happening. You've borne witness to some incredible stories, I must say. That whole business with the steel skins mm-hmm. and the giant queen, uh, all that manner of betrayal with Dask and the Boromar clan, mm-hmm. this latest twist regarding House Durasco and their tampered drugs. Ah, I could, I, I'm entranced. You are doing so well. My dear, do, do you not remember me, truly? Yes. I, I, yes, I, I, you remember, I, or or yes, you don't remember. Uh, <laughs> that's, that's, that's a very two two big different yeses. I mean, <laughs> bigly different. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, why did I say it like that? More of the do not remember. By I have my assumptions. It it's been a while. Of I've been in. You've been in that I've terrible char- city. I've been in Charn for how long now? Oh, 20 years? It's been years. So many years since you've last come home, since I last sent you out into Sharn. Oh, I missed you dearly, Rena. Well, allow me to... Reintroduce Enlighten, yourself. yes. <laughs> allow me to enlighten, uh, enlighten you as to my identity. That asylum must have driven you a little mad, poor thing, that you would forget me. You may not remember my name, but you will remember the stories of those I've inspired. To the five nations of Corvair, I am Sora Catra, who laid the sleeping curse Braylon, who laid the sleeping curse on Braylon's prince. To the dwarves of the Mrorholds, I am Lady Narathun, whose magic cursed Doldrun's son into eternal sleep. To the goblins of the long lost Dakani Empire, I am Hijal, the treacherous dirge singer who lulled the Emperor's son into a cursed sleep. I am the mistress of forbidden knowledge, the giver of gifts, the witch in the woods to whom you turn in your darkest hour. I am the Lady in Shadow, but you, my dear, may call me Mother, for it was I who gave you life. That makes sense. (laughs) Everything's starting to ring a bell now? No memories, but things are making sense. You have been separated from Thelonis for a very long time. And they don't tend to do well when cut off from their home. Yeah. You have a very mortal air about you, my dear. It's, it's concerning, really. You should get that checked out. <laughs> <laughs> How does one do that? Well, you're here now. True. Maybe this will help. Um, perhaps a little, a little bit of R and R in the in Thelanus will do you some good. And don't worry, you are, your body is quite safe on Eberron, and uh, your friends, uh, they will not even realize that this has happened. Mm-hmm. Such is the mm-hmm. nature of this place that is such a casual connection to time. <laughs> yeah. You could spend years here, and I could just send you back in a moment, if you so desire. Hmm. I don't know, I'll have to think about that. Of course. It, I, I forgive a mother for doting on her dear. <laughs> I've just, just been so long. Um, and uh, as she uh, as she like waves a, a, a hand, this um, this this sprite that uh, appears to have like bat wings and a little <clears throat> bat head like flies down with like a, a, an impossibly large tray that it's carrying for its size of like tea and sugar mm-hmm. and, and and you know very ornate and beautiful uh, cups. Um, and she says, uh, tea, uh, tea, sugar, milk? 
All of it. Yes, excellent. And she I prepares have, it for you. So, mortal <clears throat> thing, I have found that milkshakes are great. Milkshakes? Milkshakes. <laughs> I have don't you, believe such have a thing. Have you had No, them? such a thing does not exist on Thelonis, to my knowledge. Mm. The last time I made milkshake, I could make milkshake, I cursed an entire village. So maybe it'll be fun. Maybe that's why you like milkshakes. Maybe, but I don't think that's how it's done. No. Oh. Well. It's more you take the milk and then you cool it and shake it. I think. I don't know. I didn't I haven't watched them make it. Why don't, next time we meet, you come back to me with a recipe for this milkshake? We'll do. Uh, I, I must confess, Brenna, as, as happy as I am for this reunion, there is a purpose for you being here. Okay. Um, What's the purpose? Well, it's about your friend, Maggie. Oh. Yes, I know that the history between you two is a little tattered, but I am in need of your assistance regarding her. Uh, the girl has, through some means, either magical or not, disappeared from my sight. I can't pin down her exact location. I know she's somewhere in that terrible city that you've now called home, but exactly where, what she is doing, I cannot tell. <sighs> she has disappeared from my sight and has yet to fulfill her side of the bargain we struck all those years ago. And if she fails to return to me to abide by those terms, a terrible curse will fall upon her. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Do you have any idea of where I can start? Like I said, it has eluded my sight. She is somewhere in Shard. But I have a feeling that through you, this story will work out. Your path will eventually cross hers, and then perhaps you can convince her to remind her that she owes your dear mother a favor. For it was I who gave her you all those years ago, a friend in that terrible asylum. I don't know how kindly she would take to that. Well, you can- the last time we interacted. Well, you can remind her that uh, if she does not abide by the terms, she is cursed to end up like all of these poor drudges as she gestures to all of the masked gardeners mindlessly tending to this garden. <laughs> <clears throat> so? I'm not asking you to to change change her her fate entirely. I just think you should bring to attention, remind her that she owes me this obligation, or otherwise she faces a steep penalty. And I do not want to curse her, but if that is if she refuses to let me help her, I have no choice. It is my story. I must curse those who break ties with me. I'll see what I can do. Thank you, my dear. And uh, by the way, because uh, because this is such a, a joyful reunion, I do have a gift for you. Oh. Yes. Um, if she. I, if I had you, I would, I would have one. Oh, well, there's always next time. Yeah, that milkshake yeah. recipe. There, there we go. There we go. Brilliant. Okay. Um, she, she cackles like a witch, um, and uh, <laughs> she, she um, looks over. You, you look and. Last time you looked at like the this like garden shed that was in the mm -hmm. corner, there was no window or there was no like mirror or anything on it. Mm -hmm. Now there's a mirror that is just like suddenly there that you did not see yeah, before. Of she reaches out and she uh, these 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 like withered hands that uh, have these like long claw like nails on them as she uh, takes her hand and just squeezes it and then the mirror completely shatters and all of the pieces fly towards her and then you get to reform in her hands into uh, a wand. This wand that is made entirely of almost like fused together pieces of, of reflective glass. Um, Whoa, and she, um, as she had like floats in her hands as she like proffers it over to you. And she says, this is a wand of shattering images. For any prying eyes that would seek to do you wrong, this will come in great hand. No pun intended as it has passed from great hands into yours. Very true. This would come in handy for all the stuff we've been doing, too. Yes, you've been getting into quite some serious scrapes. Uh, and for you, Puck, she sort of picks up Puck as he <laughs> hangs there like a cat. Uh, she says, I have some new gifts for you as well, for you to bestow on our dear Renna. Take good care of her, won't you? As she gives it a little smooch on the head, and Puck, like almost like 
there's almost like this like ripple that like rolls through Puck uh, of, of just like energy, uh, like all the way from tip to tail, and uh, and suddenly he like shakes and gets down on the table, and you can feel you yourself have somewhat mm-hmm. changed as well. Yeah. That there's new powers and, and different abilities at your disposal than what you had before. Mm-hmm. And um, Puck paws over to you and mm-hmm. kind of curls up in your lap this time, and uh, the lady in shadow smiles and says. Now, my dear, I'm afraid I must send you back to Eberron. I am exerting a great deal of energy by con- maintaining your connection here. And it's time that you return and find your friend before something terrible happens to her. All right. I guess I'll be seeing you tomorrow, Mom. Of course. And if you ever want to come back again, you need but drink that accursed liquid, and you will see me again. All right. All right. I'll have a better spread ready this time. You kind of caught me by surprise, this one. A very pleasant surprise. But a surprise, nonetheless. <laughs> Is there anything else I can do for you, my darling? Uh, I don't believe so. Well, if I'm, anything comes to I'm, mind... I'm not going to get any of my friends into a deal with you without them. Oh! Pfft, that, that, that is completely fine. Although, if they ever did want anything, I'm more than happy That's to true. oblige. That's true. If you ever find yourself in need, just come to Mother. She will help you. I will. Oh, good girl. She kind of like pinches your cheek <laughs> with these cold hands. Yes. <laughs> um, and uh, she says, now, run along back to Eberron and uh, continue to bear witness to magnificent stories. Yours is already turning out to be far more interesting than even I anticipated. I'll keep, I'll keep going. I'll keep doing <laughs> good it. Good girl. Now off with you. Goodbye. Mommy loves you. And uh, <laughs> as she blows you that kiss and this like, this like, <laughs> this like kiss with wings hits your face. You're suddenly back in Eberron. You've just collapsed to the floor. You're like on your hands and knees, um, and uh, you're, you're just you're back. And Puck is just sitting right in front of you. Uh, Severin, you I think you were the one who bore witness to Rena yeah. drinking the cur- cursed liquid as uh, the bottle is kind of spilled on the ground mm-hmm. next to you. Um, not like completely spilled, but like you know, like when you spill a bottle and mm-hmm. it's like halfway yeah. spilled. It's kind of like that. Yeah, you managed to get a little more back in there, and, um, and there's a whole there's a whole six pack of those, by the way. So there's like oh, okay. five, six there's five, five full yeah. bottles there. Oh, okay, the, the so we can all talk to Starcatcher. <laughs> Why? Uh, technically, the Lady in Shadow. I, I want to well specify then. that when I said that she's Sora Catra, she's Sora Catra from like a story standpoint, not not that she's actually Sora Catra. Okay. Uh, the fair. Lady, the way that Fae work in Eberron. Okay. They're they're like iconic. Um, <laughs> They are iconic. They're, are, they're like iconic <laughs> representations of like fairy tale tropes. So Rena's patron is the Lady in Shadow, not Sora Catcher. Oh, thank God. Cool. I would... Not the Sora Catcher that is known. Not the Sora Catcher that is like, yeah. Uh, she's like Sora Catcher in stories, not mm-hmm. Sora Catcher. Oh, that's cool. It's like a manifestation of like her legend. Yeah. That's well, cool. Does that's the pretty juice cool. taste like 7 <laughs> It tastes, wow, I'm so glad you're here. It Welcome tastes back, like Mountain Dew Baja Blast. Oh, give me, give me, give me, give me. Or sorry, not Baja Blast, not Baja Blast, uh, Voltage. It tastes like Mountain Dew Voltage. Oh. Oh. What about Mountain Dew Cherry The cherry c- Citrus, citrus Red or whatever, yeah. Citrus Cherry? Yeah, no. Um, but yeah, you're back on Eberron. You still feel that same thrum of new power mm-hmm. flowing through your arm. And the wand? Oh yeah, the wand is in your hand, uh, in your uh, in your prosthetic hand, whichever one that is. I can't remember, but that one. Right hand. the right hand. Right. Yeah, you 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 look down and like on uh, in the one <coughs> hand is like the spilled bottle, mm-hmm. and then in the other, mm-hmm. like grasp tight, is your wand of shattered images. Uh, I'm gonna send you the, the yes. link, the stats for the Thank wand of shattered image. Thank you. Of course. <clears throat> Get that into my character sheet as soon as possible. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Uh, but yeah, Severin, uh, you watched Rena collapse, That's and, uh, <laughs> and suddenly there's a different wand in my hand. Drink some Gatorade and then collapse, and it's just <laughs> like... Blood sugar was too low, I think. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably going to have walked over and done a little bit of a nudge with his foot to make sugar. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, she's not, like, on the... Yeah. She's, like, on oh, her hands and knees, I'm on the ca- yeah. like, 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 she, yeah. like, like her legs gave out, but she was able to, like, catch herself. So he's gonna walk over and just kind of. I sent it to your messenger. Perfect. You okay? Yeah. yeah. Uh, should be Stands right up here. Like, mm, to mm. not drink things that you don't know about. That was fine. Did not expect I'd ever have to say that to an adult, but here we are. It was fine. I just, well. <laughs> what can I say without freaking you out? <laughs> 
Um, that drink actually, um, allows me to talk to someone. So I was in a conversation for a while there. That's why I passed out. But, because I was no longer here and then I'm now I'm back. Okay. Mm hmm All right. I will... Okay. He's just like... <laughs> the Severin was too stunned to speak. <laughs> you want to try some? Absolutely I'm, not. I'm, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. No. Mm -mm. I have survived without drinking things that I don't know the contents of this long. <laughs> Fun on his water? Sorry. I, I heard not Thalatus and I'm just like... <laughs> what? Definitely not. No, I'm okay. There you go. Um, it's all yours. Keep it away from Xerapis, I guess. Maybe oh. Stick's cat. Good. <laughs> from M. She's like, what are you doing? <laughs> You're not supposed to be here. <laughs> <laughs> Lord. And only eats dead things. Yeah, I don't think yeah. they have a problem. Yeah. Uh, okay. okay. Yeah? 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 You're not gonna... What? I don't know. Suddenly turn evil and try and kill you? Okay. All right. Um, yeah, I'm really specific. As you guys sort of wrap up that conversation, Killian yeah. uh, comes around the corner. Um, he's holding one of the, the files that you guys took, um, and he says, Hey, Severna! And he sees you two kind of like awkwardly looking at it. He's like, uh, Everything cool in here? Yes, no. <laughs> Should I be concerned? Okay. Um, <laughs> hey, you might want to take a look at this. Uh -huh. um, he gestures you over, and he has. Oh, by the way, sticks a war criminal. That's what. That's not what. Uh, that, 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 that's not what Venice says. I'm just that's not what Fillion that. says. Yeah. Fillion's <laughs> hey, friend is fucking war criminal. Oh. Uh, I, no, he doesn't say that. He doesn't. I thought Rena said that. Like, like that's no. fucking amazing. I'm, um, I don't, was Rena there? I don't think no, so. No, I, I, think think it was just, I think it was just a Xerophis stick and roar. <laughs> Roy yeah. standing up that. from the floor saying... <laughs> <laughs> He's like, hey guys, I thought... Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, Fillion comes mm -hmm. up to you. Um, uh, mm -hmm. Join us whenever you want to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and you guys can all take part in this too. I, mm -hmm. I know I'm focusing on these two. <laughs> I just figured we weren't here. Yeah, uh, I mean, you, you, I mean, you guys can be present if you want to be. Sure. No, How do I become present? Azarephus walks into the room. <laughs> oh, I'm, so I'm done here and I come over here? Yeah, I, I okay. <clears throat> what are, you, are we going? What's going on? Soon, yeah, give me a sec. Uh, I just drink the forbidden juice. Yeah, talk to Rona about that shit. Talk. Forbidden juice? Mm -hmm. You found forbidden juice? Well, it's been in water, I guess. What kind of water? Tavanus water. That's you found what? Yeah. Do I know what that is? Um, you'd know. I think you'd know that Thalanus is like you found. Is, 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 you is found the, fairy like bong the, water. Basically, that. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Can I have some? If you want to talk to my mother. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> really? Godmother bath Your water. mom. He like picks one up. He's like, "This is your mom." No, 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 it's no, 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 water. no. Back I didn't know you this. had a mom. I didn't realize either, but yes. Wait, well, I have someone who. Hey, you drink fairy bong water. Gave me life. So. And his Arifus's mind is like, he goes and it's like, this has got to be the craziest shit ever. No. Are you gonna drink it? No, 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 no. She's fucking insane, dude. All right, we're gonna get her. Oh yeah. By the way, if that if you did drink it, it does make you pass out for a moment. <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> like, yeah. I'm, I'm keeping this one. <laughs> oh, I'm serious, I'm oh, like nice. this. By, by the way, I lift the wand. She give me this. So, you got that from the bo from the water? The bong water. From my mother after drinking the water. Severin, did you see this happen? No. Whoa, that's crazy. Yeah, she's probably just seeing shit. Okay, well, uh, we're uh, we're good now, right? <laughs> um, affiliate says one sec. He says uh, he says take a look at this, y'all. Uh, I found an additional file that was hidden in the back of the uh, the juggernaut uh -oh. stuff. 
Um, and he, you know, he he he, he thumbs through the usual stuff. You know, joint Vidalis Jurasco uh, operation, experimental program, exploring the potential of mage breeding technologies to create elite mage bred commandos for the Five Nations. It was discontinued uh, seven, eight years ago. Um, and um, uh, but he found he found like an an, an addendum. Uh, section. It says, discontinued as of 990YK, mage breeding successful, but subjects emerge with little mental capacity and intense rage, retaining subject 4X-3 for further study and p potential reactivation oh, of, of the project. Then he, he says, they've got, a, they've got a file on this subject, too. Um, and the file says, subject 4X-3, Briya, B-R-Y-A. Ancestry, human. <laughs> Sex, female. Pronouns, she, her. Age, redacted. Nationality, redacted. And then there's oh. some notes at the bottom. <laughs> Subject 4X-3, given name Briya, is the only viable product of the fourth and final experimental unit of Project Juggernaut. Though 4X-3 does not suffer from the same persistent violent psychosis that afflicted the rest of her unit following mage breeding processes, the subject exhibits lower than average intelligence, struggles with socialization, and is prone to occasional fits of violence and rage. Despite this, 4X-3 boasts proficiency with most forms of weaponry and can execute complex tactics and stratagems with ease. As of 21 volt 997YK, so 12, 21, 997. Subject 4X 3 has been transferred from House HQ in Vedicar to the Grand Hall of Healing RMD complex in Sharn for additional tests. Dr. Adi Yaren believes that some undetermined biological or magical factor unique to 4X 3 resulted in the success of her mage breeding. Um, Fillion says, This Briya is in the next cold storage room. She's in some sort of uh, magical stasis. I fucking hate Tarasco so much. So I'm gonna go check we, it out. Do you do you think that we should take her? Are we here for her? No, we're here for him. Oh yeah. And the uh, and the dragon's blood, which I'm sure you got a hold of. Well, why are we still here? I I, I don't know. Are we gotta go break out this weird uh I want person to. that they Okay. Not in the brief. <laughs> Who's gonna carry her? If she goes fucking nuts, are we gonna kill her? Someone's already walked into the next room. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I mean, Ren, I got her magic juice. Just let, just let him, <laughs> just let him be. <laughs> the magic juice. I think Azarephus will go over and, and walk up to Severin and stand in front mm -hmm. of him and say, hey, yeah. for real though, um, what are you doing? I'm gonna go check it out. Right, check it, all right. Well, cool, more power to you. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, why? What, what is this? Uh, you know what this is? I have a feeling Jurasco got a little too trigger happy. Mm. Uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They made a person into a weapon. Wait, House Jurasco went too far? No fucking <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. It was. It wasn't like I was surprised. Just a general statement. Jurasco doesn't ever know when to stop. Um, <coughs> they experimented on a lot of people. Uh, this is probably one of them. Okay, well, um... What do you want? Nothing, I'm just, you know... If I have to put her fine. down, I'll put her down. I, I'm fine. not worried at all. I really, I just, I'm just curious. I, I, I genuinely, I was just curious. Okay, because <coughs> I can tell you the truth that I had to deal with these experiments, too. That was, I think yeah. that's maybe what I was getting at. I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah I can kind of put together why Rena drank the weird potion. Um, <laughs> this is not really <laughs> clicking. I don't want to know why. I was pulled in the last war to be part of Dark Lantern ran Suicide Squad. We were a bunch of apparent marks. Jurasco had the idea. They wanted to see what we could do. The amount of poking and prodding and blood drawn and the shit I was thrown into at 16 years old. Yeah, shit sucks. Um, yeah. yeah, I get it. I didn't know that. Sorry. So are, are you... I'm curious. What, gonna save this person? Is that what we're doing here? I'm just asking. Yeah. Hopefully. Yeah. Um, well. If we can, then why not? It's one last person to Jurasco. It's one boot against Jurasco. Sure, sure. Yeah. Maybe a possible ally? 
Yeah. Um, go ahead. Uh, he's gonna kind of shove past. And... Yeah. No. I, yeah. He's he's not even standing in your way. Um, and he just kind of walks back to the rest of the group. Just says, oh, "It's important to him." <clears throat> I said Nana got her magic potion. That's yeah, exactly. I would let you guys have the same things. She she let you have let's just get out of here with him and make sure that the exterior is safe to get out of here. Show me Captain America. Sure. <laughs> uh, for that, for that, I do want to ask, Azarifus, mm-hmm. are you leaving behind uh, incriminating evidence that implies that Dask did this? I think you did. Yeah, yeah. I left yeah. Oh, you've already done that. Yeah. I have left behind uh, uh, da- uh, Dask. Nolchunks. Nolchunks. Yeah, I've, I've left Nolchunks behind. God. Understood. Don't you I just want to ask no that flaps. clarifying question yeah, before yeah. we uh, no. we we carry on. <laughs> he double uh, checks. He's like he's like maybe we should go secure the exterior. Where are my null flaps? Uh, <laughs> like, all, right. all right, we can go. The null um, pieces. Uh, Seth, you walk mm-hmm. into this um, cold storage room, uh, and the only thing occupying this particular uh, this particular cubby is a a large tank. That appears to have uh, a a figure that is suspended in some sort of magical fluid. Mm-hmm. Um, this woman that is inside, uh, you know, it has a little uh, like emblem on the top that says, you know, subject four x four x dash three, Brya. Um, is this uh this this woman with like with tan skin, um, very muscular build. Um, she is, she, you would guess that even though she's sort of floating in this suspension right now, you would guess that she is probably um, about six foot ten. Um, her body is covered. Mother. <laughs> in, is covered in what appears to be um, surgical scars. Um, places where uh, uh, Jorosco and Vidalis assumedly uh, put in perhaps magical implants or, or uh, through mage breeding processes gave her these scars. Um, she's wearing like the Eberron equivalent of like a sports bra and like pants and uh, shoes, uh, basically as she's floating in this suspension. And she has this like shaggy black hair that's sort of like like floating a little bit in this suspension and her eyes are currently closed. Mm-hmm. Um, there it appears to be a console next, like a, dra- a dragon shard powered console next to the tank. Um, that does, you know, show uh, vital signs and read out. It appears that she's in good health. Um, there is a, um, there is a, a release button. Okay, yeah, <laughs> you press the button. Boop, boop. Um, the, uh, a, a chime sounds through uh, the cold storage and says, um, uh, uh, warning, releasing subject 4X3 from containment. As Do we all the, hear uh, this? As the uh, yeah, as uh, you watch, <laughs> Seven, right, should, Seven, oh. as you watch Severin, as this as this this liquid suspension uh, she's uh, she is floating in just sort of drains out the bottom, and she like slowly is uh, like standing, uh, goes down to a standing position. Uh, she appears to have some sort of like breathing apparatus over her face um, as she's in this suspension, as she's just standing there uh, with her head down. Um, the the tank. <laughs> Like hisses open as as the glass just like retracts up, and um, her eyes immediately fix on you, and she just throws it to the ground, and um, she appears extremely agitated as she she isn't violent, but she she is looking around, hyperventilating, appears to be panicking. Yeah. What do you do? Uh, Severin would he's seen hyperventilation. He's hyperventilated himself. He knows how to deal with this shit. <sighs> um, he'll. Move very slowly, very carefully. Uh-huh. Arms uh, up, hands open, and he's gonna say, "He's used to start counting from one. With your breath, <coughs> helps you. Great. Okay. He's gonna start. He's gonna start counting, very slowly. Okay. Um, roll me. Actually, you don't roll me anything. I roll for you. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I don't like this. Please roll well." Can we talk about how this lady is as tall as Beerbot? <laughs> I think this lady might be taller than Beerbot. About the same height. Oh, sick. It's going like this. <laughs> the sun's Just going count. down. The sun's going down. <laughs> I'm going to die at 16 now. Um, as you, as you like start counting. Severin is now paced on the wall. Um, Make a new character. As, um, sh- as, as you talk to her and you count, she looks 
very spooked and bewildered by this, but but it seems that you do sort of manage to slow her breathing down a little bit, and she sort of takes in where she is, and um, she says, Dr. Adi? Nope. Where is he? Uh... It's a good question. Uh... <laughs> That's a good question. If Dr. Audie is not here, are you my superior officer? Sure. What happens if that is? Well, do you have orders? I have the code. Um. I don't think. <clears throat> Sorry. Um. Well, we're getting out of here. I don't have any orders right now besides uh, your escape. Escape the facility? Yes. Uh, not yes, violently. Um, you know, quietly if you can. What's your, what's your capabilities? Um, she says, um, I am subject 4X-3, Raya. Mm-hmm. Um, I am capable of executing complex battle stratagems and are pro- proficient in multiple forms of weaponry and otherwise execution of enemies. She says, but um, Dr. Adi doesn't think I can do math very well. It is an area in which I'm attempting to improve. You know what? It's okay. Not everybody's good at math. No. Well, we'll get there. Um, and he's just kind of good at motion. Just follow me. Uh, I have allies. Uh, they're friendly. Is your mark out? Yes. I think she looks at it and she says, you are dragon marked. Yeah. I have been told to obey all orders given by dragon marked heirs. Okay. Yep. We'll, we'll, we'll get to that. Understood. <laughs> He's gonna walk out. So current sit rep, evacuate facility. Quietly, yes. Understood. Or passively. Understood. Um, and, uh, she... Looks a little nervous. She says, I have never been outside before. Gosh. Well, um, it's nighttime, so it's not going to be very bright. But uh, one step at a time, because we're also currently underground. Um, he's going to walk out of that area. Mm. And he's like, I'm not dead. I've got a <clears throat> very um, lady behind me. Briya walks out and sees all of you and Severin, she immediately pushes you against the wall, grabs your sword, and draws it, and she says, allies, should I neutralize these allies, hostiles? Allies, no, they're they're not hostile. Oh, Jesus Christ, she got a pet. Not the first time. Holy shit, these are allies? Yes. <laughs> She's taller than bear she, mine. she takes the hand <laughs> off your chest and she About throws the up the sword and catches it and hands it back to you. She says, apologies. <laughs> Greetings, allies, allies of Superior Officer. My name is Brian. Are we, Sev? Are we good? Yeah. Put the fuck out of are, you, are you, Beefcake? Are you good? My name is Brian. You will okay. address me as such. <laughs> yes, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> so I need a weapon. Dive. You got two really big ones right there. I would prefer something with a blade or perhaps a blunt instrument. Mm, I don't know if I trust you enough to do that. What about you, Severin? I am. Superior officer? Yeah, I don't like that. He'll hold back his sword and say, for now, I guess. Um, she uh, takes it and, you know, swishes it around a bit. Very apparent she has skill with the blade. Um, and she says, this will do. And she <laughs> sort of holds the holds the sheath in I one like hand that. and has the, has, mm-hmm. has the sword in, but keeps a hand on mm-hmm. it. Um, Fillion says, well, fuck me. All right. <laughs> uh, is probably just very quickly is like, so, we, what are we doing? Are we keeping her? What's going on? Well, we're going to escape first. Get out of here. No, no yeah, more. she's just coming home with us. Oh, she most gonna, definitely. She's going to kill all of us in her sleep. Oh, because Severin's a superior officer. Right, Severin? <clears throat> I fucking hate that. <laughs> Be nice to me, then. Okay. <laughs> um, Billion says, yeah, we better get the heck out of here. Um, there is a there is a secret tunnel that leads out into the sewers um, way for Jurasco big wings to get in and out without having to go through the Grand Hall. Uh, it's how I infiltrated in the first place. Yeah, lead the way. Uh, what was that? Lead the way. Oh yeah, he does. Um, 
and uh, it's it's uh, kind of near the waste disposal. You have to pass by the gelatinous cubes. You can see Doctor Doctor Jodorowsky is uh, currently being eaten alive, or, or he's not alive, but his his flesh is being slowly disintegrated by um, mm -hmm. these things. Waste Bri disposal. I go, as we're walking, I look down and I go, stick, look. Into the gelatinous cube. Into the, yeah, go, he's cleaning it. Gross! Uh, gross. Briya looks down oh. and says, Dr. Jurasco is no longer alive. No, he's You dead. are my superior officer. Man. Fantastic. Chain of command. <laughs> it's like they're talking in the background. Azaref is just laughing and saying, like, <laughs> <laughs> Um... And you guys uh, are led to this this passageway as as Dillian, uh, uh basically uh, opens up a console and uh, the part of the wall hisses open, um, and you guys make your way into the sewers of Shore. Yay! Leaving the House Jarosco R and D facility behind. Uh, you guys smell that? I'm yeah. Trying not to. Do you know what? Uh, do you know what? Uh, it smells do you know what like Roy's dad used Jarosco. to tell me? Roy's dad, whenever we had to clean the latrines, he always said, smells like good work and hard money. I always thought that was funny. Hard money? Yeah, it's kind of like, yeah. I don't know if he was all there. No, he said that all the time. <laughs> oh, really? To you yeah. too? Mm -hmm. About anything or just shit? Uh, mostly shit. It was oh. his, like, joke. About oh, okay. I thought, I thought it was like funny. hard work. <laughs> hard work. Good money. Oh, I will remember this. No. Oh, no. And you bet you should. You do not give me orders. No. Who gives you uh who gives you orders? Him. And you are to follow all of his orders that he gives you? I have been ordered to follow all direct commands from Dragon Marked personnel. So if another Dragon Marked personnel showed up, you would have to follow those orders too. She <laughs> Please don't break her. That's not compute. I do not know. Oh, well, that oh, is shit. interesting. Something to think about, then. Only one at a time. Yeah, let's one maybe keep time. this at, uh, I think, I let's, think, I think Sev has this under let, control. Let's try to not break the brain of, yeah. um, the big lady. I agree. At least God, not, do you guys just miss Beerbot for, like, no reason at all? <laughs> 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 I do. <laughs> I just, um, man, he makes me feel so as sick. You, as Fillion <laughs> leads you into the sewers. Um, he, he just hugs you and just go, hey. um, Speaking of. You have been standing in the down. sewers for about an hour now. <laughs> um, waiting, for, waiting for the party to rendezvous with you. Uh, he you, probably looks. Because there's other soldiers here. Uh, well, yes, yeah, so you, you, you probably arrived a little early. Um, and uh, probably had Mara keeping you company as you two just talked about stuff and you know the different uh, upgrades that she was able to make to your <laughs> to your right, to your systems. Right. And um, uh, eventually, she would say like, um, uh, "There is a party of three approaching from the west." Three. Um, she says it may be the House Tarkanon agents. Wait, is this is this like the on time for the rendezvous? The, the, yes. Well, this is this is yeah on time for the rendezvous when the other House Tarkanon uh, agents We're were supposed, supposed to meet up. up with you, and ideally the group was going to meet up with you right. guys as well. Mm. Um, You're getting budget X Men. I do want to warn you. Budget X Men. Budget X Men. X Men. I, I don't know about budget X Men. It's definitely not the X Men. It? It's, it's definitely <laughs> not the X Men. Because that's uh, that's copyrighted. Um, <laughs> did, did, did they make that joke in Deadpool? I think they do. Anyways, um, yeah. So, who's uh, approaching? Um, you look to the west and you see three figures sort of emerge from around uh, one of the corners of the of the sewer. Um, <laughs> you see, um, leading the way is a uh, a small halfling girl in layers of tattered rags with like four different rats peeking out from uh, from under them. Um, Severin would have told you that this this person this person is named Zay. Um, Zay. Zay. Z a e. Z a e. Um, Zay. Z a e. Z a e. Z a e. Z a e. Yeah. Um, and then behind her are two uh, two humans. One is uh, appears to be a hooded man who, once he sort of steps closer to you, and you can uh, you get a better look at him. It looks like his skin is rotting, like all across his body. Um, and then another one is uh, a human woman whose skin is not rotting. Um, she has like dark curly hair and a black and purple aberrant dragon mark that is sort of like Whoa. a burn around her eye. Um, the um, 
the the man with the rotting skin looks at you and says, "You beerbot." Yeah. You don't see any other warforged in the sewers like this, I'd imagine. You'd be surprised. Yeah. No, I wouldn't be. Um, I know, I know one of you. At least. Um, Zay just looks up at you. Doesn't say anything. Looks down at. <laughs> the rats also, you know. Yeah, the rats are all looking at you too. <laughs> oh, very interesting. And um, the the woman says, "My name's Koina. This is Zay, and this is Rotting Bow." Rotting Bow. Bow. He says Bow. Just Bow is fine. Gotcha. <laughs> yeah. He I like shoots a look at Koina. I like the man with the rotting skin. <laughs> That's fine. Well, That's his like Western name. Yeah. They, uh, <laughs> they should be here uh, any minute now. 60 minutes later. It probably yeah, goes hard cut. Like, like hard cuts to like 15, 20 minutes past yeah. Yeah. Uh, when they're probably getting so, when they're probably on the way out. <laughs> and and bot sighs. He, he looks over and he goes, Well, any of you have a plan on how to get my friends out of there if they've gotten themselves stuck? If they've gotten themselves stuck, we would head over to. Um, where Fillion infiltrated and hope that maybe we can find a way to get inside. The entrance was secure last we checked, but perhaps things have changed if your friends are causing a ruckus in there. Oh, they definitely are. Oh, we're not. <laughs> after, that, after hearing about that steel skin <coughs> business, I'm sure that you are all very good at causing a ruckus. Val yes. sort of says with a sneer. Unfortunately. Um, um, and uh, as you uh, sort of finish saying that, you, uh, you, you hear Mara say, I'm detecting movement. Party of, she's, uh, she says, eight? To the south? That can't be right. <laughs> there are five of us. How many people were we sent to get? One, right? Oh, sorry, not party of eight. That's not, that's not the right number. Party of, party seven. of seven. Thank you. No, we got a rat on us. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> party of seven. We were, we were party of seven. Wow. Um, we were one, right? Should be six. Fillion should well, be with them. Well, we were sent to get, yeah. That's, uh, well, think they've taken a prisoner? Uh, uh, maybe. I wouldn't put it past them. You got any good hiding places just in case? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, in yeah. Point up, point up points into the, the <laughs> flowing river of sewage right next to you. I mean, um, I can't smell shit anyway, so. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow. Well, it's good enough for you. We're just going to see beer bought a merch. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. Eyes. I thought, I thought <laughs> what you were saying. Apologies. I thought what you were saying was, do you know of any good places to hide whatever prisoner they have? And then she was like, yeah, throw them in no, the fucking river. No, so, yeah, I was no. Saying, um, she would be like, where somebody's in like a bunch of blood and then they like, rise out of it. Yeah. Um, yeah. She would be, uh, so she'd be like, good hiding yeah. spots. She says, yeah. we can hide around the corner. Uh. Although I, I get the feeling you're not too good at hiding. No offense. No. Um, <laughs> you no. guys hide. I'll be uh, the distraction. Understood. You see Warforge down here all the time, right? <laughs> um, Co Koina and Val walk away and sort of cre creep into the shadows with Zay. And um, uh, Koina's like, it was one time, Val. It was one time you ran into another Warforge. He says, shut up. <laughs> and uh, and um, Beerbot, as you sort of stand there, there imposing, um, just menacingly, um, Dude, you watch as uh, coming around the southern corner is uh, your friends, the Storm Tower Six, as well as a halfling and a giant woman <laughs> behind them. You see, you turn into a giant world saint <laughs> <laughs> going no, no, no. through the sewers of no, Shard. No, 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 no. My very serious Eberron game. Yes. <laughs> Look, I'm at the corner and I turn and, and I go. Ah. Right, you, see, you see Beerbot. You see this imposing What metal other Warforged stature. would it be? <laughs> uh, apparently they're all over the place. <laughs> <laughs> That's definitely <laughs> true. Hey, I'm just making sure I don't know who I can trust funny. nowadays. I haven't heard about the uh, giant Warforged in the sewer? No. Well, now there's apparently a giant Warforged and a giant woman in the <laughs> sewer. Yeah. It has actually been a minute since I've seen Beerbot. So I think as Aerophis walks over and kind of just like punches him in like the arm, and he says, you've missed quite a bit. <clears throat> there's a big lady. Yeah, Is this yeah. Warforged an ally? Yeah. Yes. Understood. And the three individuals lurking around the corner. Also allies. Yes. Who? Hmm? <laughs> Which ones? Oh, uh, Zay. Uh huh. Uh, Koina. Koina. K O Y N A. Koina. And uh, I believe he said to not call him uh, Rotting Bow. Fuck. Um, <laughs> at the mention of their names, they emerge from around the corner. Friends? Um, That's our friends. Um, friends? And, uh, Can allies? They, they all look at, they look at all of you, and they look at Fillion. 
um, <coughs> Philly uh, approaches them and they, um, you know, exchange uh, exchange greetings. And then all, uh, then Zay is, you know, just staring at you, Severin. And then uh, Koina and Bao just sort of like give you a withering look. And they say, so you managed to get out alive, huh? Barely. Hmm. Sorry. Looks like nothing's changed. Yep. Who's the big lady? It's Bria. 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 Thank you. I assume, I wrote it down. Forgot how to say it. Uh, <laughs> her name's Bria. All right. What's the deal with Bria? Coin I asks. I uh, about Fidelis Drosco joint operation. Ever the bleeding fucking heart, Severin. Azarephus. <gasps> that girl's got rats. That guy's yeah. skin is falling off. Yeah. So much for dragon marked house. Of <laughs> Brutal. Um, I mean, you're not wrong. <clears throat> I mean, that one has a dragon mark. I have a question about face. that, actually. Is it rude to ask why your skin's yeah, rotting off? Koina <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. chuckles. You know, yeah, like, Bal. She's like, tell him, Bal. Yeah. Um, and um, he says, Would you care for a demonstration? I yes. <laughs> love one. Um, he uh -oh. walks up to you and punches you oh, in the fun. chest. Yeah. Um, and you feel not just the pain of the punch, but this shock wave of pain that radiates out through your entire body Ooh. as you take uh -oh. uh, six points of bludgeoning damage okay, okay, and okay. Uh, 13 <laughs> points of negative oh, damage. Oh. Uh, I'm resistant to negative damage. Hey, there we go. What okay. the fuck? Why are you resistant? Or I guess it's what, it, what is it now? Radiant and volatile? I don't know. Um, whatever it's called. Uh, in the necrotic. <laughs> necrotic, sure, why not? Um, that is. Well, he does. Azarephus, look, they so have the dragon mark of seven? punching. And uh, <laughs> it would be reduced to, what did I say, 13? Mm -hmm. uh, it would be rounded down, so six. I see you've not. Um, as, and as he, as he strikes you in the chest, no. you watch as like, uh, these, uh, these marks, this mark on his arm like, like radiates with, with power. It looks a little similar to Severin's. His is more of like a sickly orange sort of hue, whereas Severin's is, yours is like, kind of like a deep red, mm -hmm. right? Hey, what the fuck, buddy? Whenever he asks for a demonstration. Are you gonna punch the wall? It's not the first time he's- uh, Walls can't feel pain. He, he asks, oh, and he does this on purpose. <laughs> oh. Okay. No, Briah looks at you and says, are you sure these are allies? Uh, hey, yes. Stick. Yep. Yes. Give her an order. Uh, no. Just say, hey. <laughs> just say, hey, um. Shut up, Just say, hey, you, sing a show to you. So Give her sorry. an order. She has to Is that why your skin rots off? Because you get punched that hard? Because I have an <laughs> um, mark. Um, I don't Sorry. think she knows about It's okay. That. Well, I mean, I didn't think you could punch his fucking I, I, and chest. I don't think, <laughs> I don't think, I think I broke the rib. <laughs> and uh, and no, I'd no, also no. argue that we probably shouldn't be taking advantage of that. Well, look, we all need to know, you know, the limitations of it. I, I'm just saying, it's like a. It's like a how about like we test it out when we're, in the, when we're in the comfort of our own home? Yes. I'm gonna and not seven. struggling to breathe. I'm going to get behind you. I'm going to be like, <laughs> yeah, okay, stick. hit him with the bones. Make his bones no, hurt. No, I'm not going to make his bones hurt. <laughs> Come on. No. Strike back. No, we're allies. Yeah, do the poison the no. well thing. Yeah, yeah, do the Shut poison up. the well <laughs> thing. Val puts a oh hand God. on your shoulder <laughs> and says, I'm sorry, little one. I should have punched Severin. Yeah. That would have been a better demonstration. I would have been able to enjoy it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That was pretty cool, though. I don't think you should have actually done that. I think Sev's new girlfriend would have had something to say about that. I am not Severin's girlfriend. I am Severin's subordinate. <laughs> That's how they say it in the Kalinta place. Oh, <laughs> Hang on. Azarephus also says, God, I wish that were me. <laughs> <laughs> Um, All right, let's get on. Yeah, Val and Koina just are like, okay, we've we've so, got to get out of here before the watch decides to take a patrol uh, in the sewers. You know what's even weirder than Turkanon? Yeah, I can see that uh, you're no stranger to attracting very colorful company. So. Yeah, it's why hey, you're friends. Hey, excuse you, we are not weird. We're freaks. No, no, <laughs> they, they called us colorful. And that's true. That's very true. We got we got blue. We got red. Green and red. So, Severin, yeah. what is, what is the deal? Silver. With um, Val? Over I don't know. He's Can bad at you no, all the time. Not. <laughs> you know what I mean. Look, man. The big lady? <laughs> I found her. Specifically the having to follow all the orders thing. Oh, she's like a, she's like a soldier. Yeah. <clears throat> 
a winter soldier. <laughs> <laughs> he kind of leans in and goes, but I think, like, brainwashed. Yeah, it's real fucked up, man. <laughs> There's no way around it. You know how Got a file all about it if you want to take a look-see, Fillion yeah. says as he holds do. up the file. He'll yeah. hold it out to you. Yeah. Um, same information I, I shared. This was a, a joint House Vidalis and House Jorosco operation where they were trying to use a process known as mage breeding, uh, which is typically used for animals and beasts to give them, um, you know, uh, stronger qualities uh, like enhanced strength or um, uh, like a particular effect to take place. In my Eberron, um, House Vidalis mage breeds cows to produce particular flavors of milk. Yeah. Um, so like you have a chocolate milk cow. <gasps> that is so awesome. Uh, in Keith ba- and in Keith Why Baker's Eberron, and also sooner. mine. Oh, sorry. <laughs> this is why House Vidalis is the coolest house. Also the worker. That's how they but, make um, milkshakes. That's it, that's it, that's yeah. it, that's it. Uh, they have a milkshake cow, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the cow's just vibrating. Oh, yeah, the I do. Like, <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, Keith Baker has said in one of his games as well that, um, they, they mage breed chickens to have eggs that are either just normal eggs, uh, and then they have chickens with uh, eggs that are all yolk and eggs that are all white. Oh, that's wow. cool. <laughs> that's cool. I know, it's super cool. Uh, but anyways, they tried to do that on humans, and uh, it didn't turn out very well, apparently. Yeah. Um, however, it would seem yeah, that no this Briya milk. character, subject 4X-3, is the only like viable <laughs> product of this entire uh, of this entire experiment. Okay. <laughs> and even then, she has noticeable, uh, noticeable defects like, um, it, you know, lower than average intelligence, difficulty with right. socialization. Um, but she does have uh, advanced skills. You guys are the fucking worst. You made a whole video about this damn shit. <laughs> I'm sorry, Grace said the funniest thing ever. <laughs> what did you you say? said it doesn't work very well on humans, and I went, dang it. And Grace said they couldn't make chocolate milk. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, give the science like 20 more years, they'll figure it out, they'll figure it out. It was, it was they're like, <laughs> Yeah, they're just like, what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, alright, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It was Vidalis um, and what other house? Jorosco. Jorosco. Mm-hmm. Um, the, the nasty half. Well, no, 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 no. Jurasco is halflings. Vidalis are humans. Um, right. Jurasco has the mark of healing, and they specialize in um, like pharmaceuticals and things like that, and, and healing as a business. Uh, House Vidalis has the mark of handling. They specialize in like animal husbandry, mage breeding, livestock, dairy, uh, all that kind of stuff. House Galanda is the nice. The, the other dirty halflings that made the the, the Baja blast that sends you to, the, to <laughs> Mother Gothel's garden. Um, but. Uh, Anyways, um, Roy and Jordan are clearly not biased. <laughs> yeah, so that's what, Jesus. That's what uh, that's what you see about um, about Brian. Um, uh, b- before you all proceed, um, Bal and Koina produce from their pocket um, a series of like strips of fabric, and they say, um, and Bal says, in order to keep our hideout's location a secret, we must ask you all to put these on. Has it changed since I've been there? You can keep yours off, Sabrina. What is it? Sorry, it's a blindfold. Oh, it's just a blindfold. In, in my, in Are my you gonna head, lead all five of us in the dark? Yes. In, in my head, I'm gonna go. Uh, Six you, of us. Uh, are you gonna be able to tell where this place is? Yes. That's wonderful. <laughs> um, he'll put the he'll put the blindfold on. You know, and he'll say in his head again, "You don't need to let them know you can do that." Understood. <laughs> nice. Um, are we? Al- are we? Are they trusting us to put our own blindfolds on? They, when you do, they will come around and make sure they work. What are you gonna poke tiny <laughs> holes? <laughs> well, I was definitely gonna tie it loose. Oh, oh no, it fell off. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know what? Uh, Roy, I can roll a stealth check for you. Yeah, you uh, Roy would definitely they, they uh, roll. Uh, Roy put it back. Let me double check and make sure I don't have any like um, bonuses to doing shit like. Um, to blindfolds? What, to blindfolds? Uh, yeah, I'm a blindfold expert. <laughs> what are, you, are you trained in, like, BDSM or something? Uh, yeah. No, I, I thought there was a... Why does it sound like blindfold expert would Lore be BDSM. Like in this game, Lore BDSM. <laughs> uh, Lore Pathfinder is, uh, is fantastic. You do that. It's fantastic. Uh, no, uh, well, experience. It's like, where it's like the sex skills book. Uh, oh uh, yeah, uh, the uh, weird like non-official yeah. like. Um, yeah. I don't know if s- experienced smuggler uh, uh, go. Uh, My God, counts uh, here. It's that would be more similar. for like concealing items, not really concealing the fact that you can still see. Gotcha. You know, so yeah. I- I'm gonna have to say no on that one. Yeah. Well, roll my stealth in. Anyway. Alrighty, you got a plus eleven. That's yeah. still pretty good. Still pretty, pretty good. Um, 
you do it in such a way that you know it's it's a little droopy. You can still kind of see. It's like, or, or you've, you, I think what you've done is you've stretched it like so taut that you can kind of see through the fabric. So like yeah. you get like a dim view. And um, as you're done, and you're like, yes, you feel a hand in the front of the of the blindfold, pull it and snap it back into your eyes. Uh, as Bao looks down at you and he says, "No fucking tricks, boy." Tavin warned us about you. Um, Look, as I, as he puts I, on your blindfold for you. I don't um, want to disappoint. Point, and I kind of fucking had to, right? Right? Um, Koina says, right. it is pretty cool that you tried. Uh, and Val's like, <laughs> oh, look at you, Roy. You got quite the reputation. I don't think, think, I don't think he needs much encouragement. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, you, only, uh, you only rolled a 14 on that stealth check. I rolled a 3 on the tie. Oh. Um, <laughs> not Roy's finest hour, but I no. suppose the stakes weren't very high. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> the, well, it's the, it's the, what's the, the tail of the Riz. <laughs> 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 um, so, Sometimes you got like nat 20 plus 11. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've, sent um, a, I've sent a Hero Forge that I made of Briah into the chat as well. Oh, no. I don't have Hero Forge. I was going to make Hero Forges of all the different House Tarkanon members. I didn't get around to well, doing that. Well, I'm also going to um, drop that in the Discord. Totally. Link down in the description if you want to join our Discord. <laughs> this is exactly how I was imagining her. That is super weird. Mm -hmm. This is the one time where I looked at a character and went, yep. Well, yeah, oh, that's yep. what was in my head. Mm -hmm. Wow. She God, looks you're so like, good at descriptions, uh, Jack. Thank you. The guy from uh, No Country for Old Men. <laughs> <laughs> oh, does. my God. <laughs> Heads or tails, call them. Oh, fucking Christ. And the first thing I see when I look in the Discord is is this. And it's Patrick <laughs> looking down yeah. the street at a beer bot. Yeah. <laughs> there, oh, there's fuck. some funny memes in that the Discord good. so far. You guys are great. Um, so, um, what ends up uh, happening at this point is you all have your blindfolds secured. Yep. Um, mm -hmm. And the uh, three members of House Tarkanon, or sorry, four at this point, uh, because it's uh, Zay, Koina, uh, Fillion, and Val. Plus Severin, who's no longer a member, but you know but. you're honorary, and you already know where the thing is. <laughs> wow, so. honorary. Um, yes. May I interrupt for one little funny haha? -ha oh, sure. I will be done. Sure. I posted the image, and immediately as it sent, the first two emoji reactions on the Discord were rings. Just two rings. <laughs> <laughs> they were immediately. Like, <laughs> yes. All right. Sorry. No, I I'm love done that. Now. I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad people like my <laughs> violent super soldier. <laughs> <laughs> we know um, what they like. But. Uh, Big um, what, 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 what ends up happening, Severin, uh, mm -hmm. in, the, in, the, in the following events is something that you're very familiar with. Mm -hmm. Whenever, if there needed to be outsiders brought into the, the House Tarkanon HQ, what would end up happening was, the, uh, you know, they would be brought to the sewers blindfolded and then led, led on basically a much longer than necessary tour of the sewers <laughs> so that anyone trying to memorize, like, the pathway from mm -hmm. where they're at to get to uh, the entrance to the, the hideout cannot possibly keep track. Mm -hmm. um, so you guys walk for probably 20 minutes through the sewers, this humid and smelly, gross place. Lady. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Um, At least there's mm. not sewer smells. <laughs> Guys, I got the that, sewer candle. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say, are we? <laughs> you gonna get the the smellalizers from yeah. Sorn? Yeah, yeah. 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 You're mm. the orange blossoms. So you're like, mm. 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 smell like mm. shit. Poo. <laughs> Um, hard work. Yeah. <laughs> Good money. That's a bro. Oh yeah. Um, they. It takes some doing, but Briah finally puts on the blindfold. Um, ah! It looks like she and Bal are about to throw down at one point. Um, but I think Severin would probably <laughs> step in at that point. Um, Bal, you know, he's he's egging her on. <laughs> it would seem. Um, Anyways, you are all led through the sewers for longer than you thought by seven of the other Tarkanans. A winding path that finally ends as you are guided up a set of slick cobblestone stairs. You find yourselves free from the humid <laughs> stickiness and rank stench. <laughs> you guys good? Yeah. <laughs> you good, Jordan? <laughs> okay, sick. You find yourselves free from the humid stickiness and rank, rank stench of the sewers and instead in a, a space with comfortable warmth and a somewhat dusty smell. The Tarkanans allow you to remove your blindfolds now, and surely enough, you are in what appears to be a basement. Uh, and the Tarkanans waste no time ushering all of you upstairs. Mm. Awaiting you at the top of these stairs is a lavish manor with sleek tile floors, ever bright chandeliers and <coughs> candelabras, and marble columns, uh, whose walls are occasionally uh, adorned with the, uh, the uh, occasional painting, bust, or tapestry. Uh, it reminds you somewhat of the Tame Manor, but it's more, a little more barren. There are no bustling <laughs> servants, no visiting guests besides yourselves. The whole place is eerily quiet. Mm -hmm. And Sev, 
The manor has always been kind of a quiet place mm-hmm. in your history of the organization. This time, though, it seems emptier than usual. Mm-hmm. You're all guided into a dining hall where Thora Tavern, Nightshade, and two more tar cannons are sitting at a long table, sipping from silver goblets in silence. Thora stands and approaches Philian, taking his non-withered hand in both of hers, and she says, welcome home, brother. Thank you, Storm Tower Six, for returning Philian safely. Do you have the dragon's blood and its documentation? Yep. Who has got it? that? I believe Roy had it. <laughs> yeah, sounds right. I'm trying to think. You had, I believe, the Kyber's blood. You also had the file on it, as well as the recipe to uh, how as to how you can make it. And what, when they say the documentation, what are they meaning? Uh, they uh, they would probably specify that they want uh, the operational files and if a recipe is available, that as well. Um, Roy is going to try and palm the recipe and hand them the file. Understood. So mm-hmm. I imagine that you don't really palm the recipe. You've probably already hidden it on yeah. your person. Yeah. So you just sort of hand over the stuff. Um, I'm going to roll a deception check for you, Roy. Um, Do you have a... I mean, you have a, a trick for that? I mean, well, I mean that is kind of experience. Well, that's a stealth roll. Never mind. Huh? Nothing. It's... I got nothing. We're good. Okay. I mean, they're similar modifiers. Frankly, deception is higher for your stealth than your stealth. So. Oh, well, you just, just yeah, because at this point, he's not trying to hide it now. Yeah. He's just trying to lie that he's it's already not there. Yeah. 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 Um, Thora takes both of both the uh, the Kyber's blood and the. Uh, in the file, and uh, she opens it and pages through it, and she says, hmm, very good. Everything appears to be here. No recipe, but Nightshade can figure it out. Um, as she hands off those files to Nightshade, and she says, head down to the lab, store these safely, and bring up the basilisk oil. And Thora, or uh, Nightshade stands up and takes the things and then gives you all a, a, a nod and you one more withering look. Um, <laughs> as um, as uh, Thora says, well, it would seem our business is done. But is it though? But is it though? But is it though? Uh, I, I, you know, it's funny you ask. I was curious about the giant woman with you. Oh, I just sort of meant that, like, we could work together in the future, perhaps. We usually do our best not to associate too heavily with outsiders who are not involved in the family. However, you have all proven yourselves somewhat indispensable. If we require need of your services, I will contact you again. Um, and some of the other Tarkanans, some of them in there don't look like they care too much about this. Some of them give her like a confused look um, as, uh, as Bal says, you really want to entrust more work to a traitor? And Thora says, well, they help, he helped us this time, didn't he? Yep. Perhaps this is a path to redemption, Severin. And, and you know what? Hey, if you need a place to catch a drink, <laughs> do you have storm come, drink. Your business cards now? <laughs> you, you can leave the rats. We don't need those there. Um, but uh, come by. Say looks a little disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> she, like, like, sulks in the corner with her rats. Oh, yeah. um, uh, no, they cannot. Um, and uh, Thora says, "We don't have any health God, what's, the, what's the thing from from uh, American Psycho? Like, is that oh. Helvetica? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, whole point lettering. Bone. He yeah. stayed up all night. Saint Markovia's yeah. bone. <laughs> Saint Markovia. <laughs> That's that video. Yeah, I made, it's a like, TikTok you made a while ago. ago. I thought it was really funny. Saint Markovia's um, bone. <laughs> so I was, I was, I was like joking, like straw as as." Christian Bale. Patrick Bateman. Yeah, Patrick Bateman, yeah. Thora would, add, uh, she invites you all to take a seat and drink some wine as you wait for um, for uh, Nightshade to come back. I think Severin would wait stay, two stay. seconds and you go, why is this so quiet? We'll lose more members? Um, oh. Lillian, <laughs> whoa, Thora, Thora. Here we go. Um, he makes good choices. Um, Thora doesn't really react too much to the question, and she says, um, many of them are away on assignment currently. We've been busy lately. And, um, Fillion sort of sighs, and he says, Thora, are you really not going to tell him about the son of Kyber? The what? What? Th- uh, Thora looks over at Fillion. 
and then um, I basically everyone looks at Fillion, and he says, "What? Someone was going to bring it up sooner or later. He was going to find out sooner or later. Better we fill him and fill him in now." Look, look, I I know anytime anybody uses Kyber, it's always a scare word. Thora sighs and she says, two weeks ago, mm-hmm. the manor was, actually before she starts, she would look at all of you and say, leave us. <laughs> um, where is safe to go? Um, she says, Koina, take them. <laughs> and uh, I'm just gonna look at Severin just says, to make sure. All right. Okay. Nice seeing you again, ma'am. You too. You guys have a ball pit around as, here? <laughs> ball Do you all head out? Uh, your would kind of turn a in ball as he... Pit. She says, take So, no. so <laughs> these, these types of situations kind of, even with former allies, for some, for one of us, kind of set off alarms in Beerbot's head. Mm-hmm. So as he turns, he would kind of just look to Severin. It's kind of like a, do I leave? All right. And then he... I, I did the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> It's funny, you're like, leave us, and all of us went, You are like, Severin, are you getting ready to get gunned down in the, sh- in the streets here? It's like, I die. He's not going to get gunned down in the streets, he's going to get gunned down in like, this house. Is, it, is this the end of the mob movie for Severin? Or? Where's, oh, yeah, where's, where's I think everybody Brian, Brian uh, stick, uh, stick does not get up. Brian is sitting right next to Severin. Or actually, Brian isn't even sitting. Brian is standing behind Severin. Beer Ball also works set. Hey, Brian. That was an order. Given to us by uh, by these fine people there. Just putting that out there, Briah. It's fine to leave. I'm good. Just come with us. We'll talk. Briah, stick, stick we'll with Roy. He'll Briah. not corrupt you completely. She says to you, "Whose orders should I follow in the meantime?" Beerbot's. <laughs> Understood. <laughs> oh man. Oh come on. Beerbot is not even nearly as clever. As oh, you should definitely not. No, have but I understand what Briah. it is <laughs> to be in that situation. We Beerbot was or? a soldier, so... I, I stand next to Beerbot and I go, so do I. <laughs> I was also in the army where I was sort of a slave. I could be a very intimidating person. All right, Brian, let's head out. <laughs> <laughs> As Renna, like, ushers everyone away. <laughs> <laughs> um, and Koina leads you all uh, basically to, like, a parlor. Where you're, uh, where you're all able to sit down and you know, there's coloring books. Yeah, there's, well, there's coloring books. I was going to say, I'm going to uh, try and you know, connect four. Oh, thank <laughs> God, I'm that old dog is back to the like, the whole time. I've got to figure that out. Distract <laughs> Raya a bit. I'm going to like be telling her stories, just cool random stories, okay. <laughs> like a child, I like I a child. That. Just I love like that standing there, like on guard, and you're like, and then, yeah, and then, exactly, and then, and then, <laughs> and then the woodcutter's daughter awoke the sleeping prince, and she's like, what well, that is. Can, actually, can I try to tell stories False. about <laughs> the lady in shadow? No, oh. about Jack was so for it. People who had been like believing they were following the right thing, but they were actually following the wrong thing. Ooh, Excuse you, am I the wrong? No, 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 no. no. I, I, that they should that, that they should be following their own. I see. Is this I fucking see. Play about yeah. us? I'm trying to like yeah. a little bit of deep I'm going to roll a little uh, a little diplomacy check for you. Do I'd it. say. Do it. Um. Um. <laughs> as you finish your story, uh, Baraya looks down at you and she says, "All of those stories are made up." <laughs> None of them are real. You do realize this. <laughs> and you do realize that all stories have an origin. Just because this one might not be 100% accurate doesn't mean it hasn't happened. That is the nature of Thalanus. I do not know much about Thalanus, but I know that I exist to follow orders. That's what and you that think. Will, that will not change for a, a long time. You were, the, you were the natural one. Ooh. Really? Yeah. Could I use a hero point on that? Um, <laughs> but, well, damn, um, I already did that sick burn, but sure. Uh, you, you have your inspiration, I guess. Uh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. All right. Uh, <laughs> damn. <laughs> um, Brian looks down at you. Fuck me. And keep this looking is so down. funny. No, no. I he want you to have down. kept that. First part, okay. but okay, okay, I like that. Yeah, that, I like that's that. how I like to use She's it. It's, like, it's still happened, and but you, you kind of talk your way around it, and she says, oh. "Do you really think that there could ever be a time where I could do what I wanted?" Yes. 
Beerbar is an excellent example of that. I was created for war. My people are now free. Yeah, we're sort of like experts on going our own way and doing our own shit. You, you've lucked into the right crowd, really. I understand that it takes time to break free from those chains. So you can follow our orders until you have ones of your own. But know that we want you to have ones of your own. Please, you're hurting her two brain cells. <laughs> um, <laughs> Rubbing him really quickly. She, um... She's taking in everything you're all saying, and then she, um, she, um, looks, looks like she's about to explode, walks over, and punches a hole through the wall, um, and, and, and just takes a deep breath and starts counting, counting from one, like Severin did, um, and, and it seems to calm her down a little bit, and she says, I'm gonna go I, up and kind of, I will think on what you've said. <laughs> And if you need, uh, it looks at all, uh, everyone else is there. Because if you need anything to uh, let out frustrations, I'm pretty sure I'm the only one in this group that could take a punch from Pop. you. We can spar some time. Oh, is that a that promise? Is the strangest oh, come I should on I have mention. ever heard. <laughs> it's a, it's a, it's a hope. I should also strangest come mention on. to you, not, not only beer bot. But seven and six as well. Seven and six is being so much. <laughs> what? Here, do you need something? You're thirsty. Yeah. I don't. So understand. much has changed in a single day. I understand. It will take me some time to think on. Of course. This. If you want, you can always talk to me as well. I'm all right. I'm a good listener. You're a good talker as well. You yap proficiently. <laughs> <laughs> I have never been told that in those words, but I like it. Proficiently yapping. Proficient. She smiles. <laughs> um, I, got, no. I got a smile. I got a smile. Playing go fish. It quickly disappears. <laughs> this is Uno. <laughs> and on that note. <laughs> um, Do you have any they walk away. twos? No, I have go fish. Uh, <laughs> Thora looks at you. Well, she looks at Thillian. Um, then looks at you and says, two weeks ago the manor was infiltrated by a man who possessed the most powerful aberrant lark I have ever witnessed. He called himself the son of Kaiba. Huh. He had come to rally the aberrant lark to fulfill their true purpose, waging war on the dragon marked houses that have tried so hard to wipe us out. Build a world where those of us with aberrant marks would no longer need to live in the shadows, fear, persecution, and death. His words struck a chord with some of our more passionate and bitter members. And ever since his arrival, more and more of our family flocked to his cause. I am still debating whether or not there was any merit to these words that he's saying, or whether he is actually what he appears to be. But what you see in this room, save for Koina and a few others, we are currently all that's left of House Tarkanon. Oh, At least the House Tarkanon that we founded. Shit. All that hard work for nothing. Fillion says, well, it might not be for nothing. If this son of Kyber really is who he says he is, it wouldn't be the end of House Tarkanon, it would just be the beginning of a new chapter where we take a more active role in our destiny instead of just hiding in the shadows. Yeah. Thor looks at him and says, surviving in the shadows. I don't know. I... It's kind of convenient. My thoughts exactly. But what if he is telling the truth? What if he is some blessing from the dragon below that has come to liberate us? And I'm the one who stands in the way. We needed that seven years ago. Now? I do not know, Severin. All I know is that half of our family is down in the cogs with him somewhere that I don't know the location of. Preparing to go to war. I do not know when. I do not know how. But if his fervor matched the fury he will unleash. I shudder to think what might happen. 
I fear for our siblings who are down there with him. Yeah, I, I read all the books that you pushed at me. You know what can happen. Um, <laughs> fuck. I'll look for him, I guess. You do not have to do that. It's not your responsibility. I'm curious now. Just because I'm not dark-headed anymore doesn't mean I don't care about everybody. Half those... Half the kids, I... I was the one who found them. Or you led me there. Yes. It's not fair to... leave them. So. If you do, do learn anything, let me know. shit we ever came up with. Well, we didn't have much choice. Prove, it's proven to be effective, though, until now. Any rats we send down to the cogs seem to never find their way back. Because they know all of our tricks. Yes. That is what I'm afraid of. I fear it's some ruse of the government, or perhaps the Twelve, or maybe he really is exactly what he says he is. I'm not sure which one terrifies me more. Yeah, well, I would love nothing more than to see the Twelve fall. But with where, with who we are now, what we're capable of, we're nothing compared to Halas Tarkanen and his cohort back in the War of the Mark. The Marks just aren't as powerful. They're more prevalent, but they hold only a fraction of the power they used to. Yeah. But you know all this. Um, as she takes a big sip from the goblet that she has in front of her. Um, doesn't look like she's slept well recently. She says, but that's the long and short of it, and good timing too. As um, the door opens and Nightshade walks in and she walks up to you and <coughs> funk, puts down a flask of this, it almost looks like cement, <laughs> um, like liquid wet cement um, on your, uh, 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 right in front of you. Yeah, a little heavy. <coughs> Actually, no, it's not heavy. It's actually kind of light, surprisingly. But it has, like, the consistency yeah. of, like, wet cement. Um, she says, there's your basilisk oil for your statue. It's not <laughs> mine. I think it sticks now. Well, whoever whoever it is, it's not going to be a statue much longer. Oh, You're welcome. Good. Yeah, you always do great work. Love you, too. <sighs> Gotta love this guy, huh? She says to, <laughs> to, to Philian, he says, he's a good kid. Mm. I don't know if I can forgive him for what he did, but he's a good kid. Might help us with this Son of Kyber business. And Nightshade says, oh, well, great. Yeah, I'll throw myself into the cogs just for you, Nightshade. Don't worry. You Last are such a sweet talker, Severin. Will be how much She's you still my heart. <laughs> she says, can I go to bed now? She says, yes, you're dismissed. Um, she says, I don't have anything else for you, Severin. You're free to leave with your friends. Sounds good. It was good seeing everybody who was left. I hope one day that we will all be together again, one way or another. Yeah, it'd be nice. And he's gonna get up, kind of push the chair in, because mm -hmm. he's just like, no, you. <laughs> <laughs> this is weird. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You're like, usually yes, I would go up and go to bed right now, but uh, <laughs> I need to leave. Um, and and uh, go find. Yeah. Um, uh, Thora would tell you that they're in the parlor. Um, you would probably walk in um, as the group has like talked down Briah from punching the a hole after punching a hole in the wall, and uh, Sev and um, or sorry Stick and uh, Azarifus are trying to decide which card game it is they're actually playing. You know, two different languages. <laughs> yeah, I don't know either. Of or is that a part of the game? Where'd you find this game? It's Uno and Go Fish. They're I guess you could play together. Go Fish same? with the same card, but some of them are in different language. The numbers are different. They're all so the same box. Zay and I did you swapped the decks. <laughs> Why did you do that? Piss off the all, but you know. Put it back, put it back. Before he punches me in the chest again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, new fear unlocked, getting punched in the chest. <laughs> By that guy. Yeah, in particular. <laughs> also, before you ask, it was... Uh... Oh yeah, we should probably also okay. get out of here before just, they realize just leave it. the hole in the wall. Honestly. 
What are they gonna do? Uh, I mean, Coin has been watching guys the other time. She was like, honestly, it was my least favorite wall, anyways. <laughs> Maybe. You what can... am I gonna do? Yell at the super soldier? Maybe you can <laughs> renovate it, make it like. Like, open concept. Like, like, take down the wall and have it be, yeah, an open uh, Or you could put a I've wall been, I've been trying to convince Thora for years that we needed a more open concept here. Well, but you have a start. Well. They, maybe you don't need to convince them anymore because it's already half broken. So do we need to put the blindfolds back on to leave? Yes. I stand, I stand up, dust myself off, and go, thanks. <clears throat> well, we get, um, oh. we uh, free our boy. Yeah. Why'd they put it in a cup? <laughs> <laughs> it's not okay. <laughs> You said a cup. Did I? You I, said a cup filled I meant with to say cement. A, I meant to say a flask, but whatever. I was. A, I imagine like a wine glass. Yeah, it's a. It's a. No, it's a. It's a. It's a big gulp. When <laughs> 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 it's gone, a lid. Pinkies feed it. Yeah, Take it's your, a Blinkies big gulp. Actually, is what it is. Take your empty. She's like, I ran out of the juice. good, uh, the yeah. good uh, iron flask. No, yeah. I don't want to use. Nightshade pushes them all to the side and goes, "Here we yeah, go." This, it's one of the Blinkies uh, promotional reusable cups. This will get them. This will get them. <laughs> the blink dot on it. Fitting. Yeah. Not wasting the good china. Exactly. It's the one with, uh, it's the one with post year Malone on it. Raising Kings uh, Cubs. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> right, great. Thanks. You need to blindfold us our way out of here. Yep. Um, so, and uh, well, Koina and. It was nice standing near you. What? Because you were just standing there. Yeah, Koina was just sort of so, watching you guys. So, so. Um, I was she like, says, Who is she talking? Yeah, it was good, uh, good babysitting you guys. Exactly. Yes. I'd say come by any time, but, but uh, mm, I don't have the authority to do that. Exactly. We also don't Perhaps know where this place is. you can come on by. Ooh, where are the business cards? How many of these do you have? I, that is not a pertinent question. Just take it and come <laughs> um, by. I, like I think the answer then is. Oh, you're open, uh, on, uh, you're open on Mars. Money. Great. <laughs> <laughs> That's Bo. <laughs> <laughs> what? He like, tries to get into the light. It's from uh, America's Arc. Like cool. Uh, and she'll sure. stick it in her pocket. Um, her and <laughs> Bal and sticks. Zay um, and Fillion come back. Um, they make sure all your blindfolds are secure. They drop you off in a random section of the sewers in the middle of the city. Uh, and then just sort of leave. Um, and uh, they say to Seb, you know, you can let them know when they can take their blindfolds off. Take as long as you fe feel if you need. Oh, I'm so tempted, but it's okay. As, as uh, they <laughs> walk away and... Just in circles. <laughs> um, and you guys are basically back at... Uh, to me is like, Beerbot, we've been going in circles yeah. for the past hour. <laughs> Beerbot is like, yeah, Mara is like, this is the fourth time we've taken this way. <laughs> uh, also, speaking of that, in his head, of course, I don't want this to get out to Targanic. So you know where that is, right? I do. Okay. Thor Tavit's Banner is in Dragon Towers, hiding in plain sight, it would seem. House Targanic is hiding among all the dragon marked. If, well, I'm just saying, if you had asked everyone, he would have just said. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> he doesn't care about so, us knowing. Yeah. How do you bring people back? How do I bring them back? Like, if you were to sleep with someone, how do you. You stayed there, right? Yeah. <laughs> you just, like. <laughs> <laughs> you just can't blindfold you first. Yeah. I feel like he's like, <laughs> as, no. as someone's like removing the blindfold, and he's like, what? <laughs> I, it's, put, put, puts the blindfold back on. <laughs> yeah, he's someone like, at a tavern. Who is he? Like, oh, we gotta go back to your place, or I'm gonna have to blindfold you. That doesn't. I don't think that would. Uh, it's called a kink. Oh. Sometimes the the blindfolds just stay on. Kidnapping kink, Roy. I don't have one, but I'm not here shaming anybody. You think, you think if Seb has a king, Seb's then checking. Seb should do whatever yeah, yeah, yeah. he wants. Well, Seb's walking into bars well, going, who's got the kidnapping king? With <laughs> oh, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> you gotta get my fault if you wanna come home with me. Would that mean that Seb has the kidnapper king? Uh, what the fuck? Well, I, again. I, I will leave you here. I, no shame. I didn't want it to lead to this. I just wanted to know. <laughs> So that's a I've, good question. Have you ever brought anyone back to the, to the Tavern Manor? Why do you like to know, Weather Boy? Hey, I'm the GM. You can tell me. Oh, God. oh God's involved. Look, stick. Yeah. God's like, oh, Sev, level would be here, buddy. <laughs> He'd watch me. Dol Dorn. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, man. Oh, okay. I'm going to assume that the general discomfort and, and confusion is probably answered. All right, I'll drop it. Uh, to be completely honest, uh, I was too busy helping Thora run the place. So. Oh, oh, too busy. Did other people bring too people busy, then? I don't or? question the shit that they do sometimes. Okay. Um, anyway, can you take us home now? Yeah, we're cool. 
I don't know where I am. Stick has a statue to blindfold. <laughs> yeah, I do. Um, you all managed to okay. You all managed to uh, to um, make your way out of the sewers um, and after a bit of a sojourn uh, back to Kalistan. Doesn't seem to smell much different than the sewers down here. Uh, funny enough. Ah, good fresh money air. And hard work. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> it's good work and hard money. <laughs> it's good work and hard money. Um, it's important. He said it a lot. Uh, and uh, you all, by the time you all get back to the storm tower, it's probably <laughs> about two o'clock or two thirty in the morning. Um, oh. You guys, um, uh, you know, you guys have a, you, you know a night shift set up where uh, some of the Broken Bridge brawlers, you know, keep an eye on the place and. They welcome you in. Some of the firebrands have been, um, you know, looks like it looks like Minzy and some of the other firebrands have like set up almost like a watch on Aram. <laughs> Minzy's like, I don't know, maybe oh, he might wake good. up. <laughs> you never know. Um, but uh, Aram a just appears to have been know. set up in like the back <laughs> corner of, of. They've sort of like put him next to a table. <laughs> it looks like someone might have put like a like a little paper Blinky's crown on him or something. Oh, hell yeah. Really funny. They've given um, him like cards to hold. <laughs> <laughs> um, and uh, I think Minzy, um, the, the the firebrand that first told you about Aram going missing, um, has like fallen asleep at the table that he's at, and she wakes up and she says, "Oh, boss, is you back? Hey, did you did you get that thing to help Aram? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's fantastic! I, I mean, I mean, let's do it right now." And uh, and who put a fucking crown on his head? I don't know. Oh, it's pretty funny. Oh, uh, <laughs> that was that was me. I, I thought you know. It's festive. Oh, I thought he could use a little. Pick I me guess up. the next time, you guys Here's are in a near death state, we'll all just sort of fuck around with you. Is that what's what going on? Oh, chill out, uh, Roy. It's Roy. funny. <laughs> hey, boss. I, I didn't. I didn't mean nothing by it. I, you know, it's just something. It's an inside joke. Take you know, it off. Inside. Okay. She hops up onto the chair and takes it off and hops down, um, and just says, "You, you can fix him, though, right?" Yeah. He's like I best, don't know. He's like my best friend. Maybe we can't. Maybe he's stuck as a fucking statue for your amusement. What's wrong, Roy? It does. You're being more agitated than <sighs> Look. Your usual agitated state. We charged out of here, mm-hmm. hell bent for leather, mm-hmm. not sure whether we were gonna be able to wake him up. Mm-hmm. I don't appreciate people fucking around with my friends. Especially my friends who sacrificed as much as that man has for my benefit. Right, but uh, all of us fuck around with each other all the time. I, and l- they listen to be friends. Listen, boss, I, I, I'm sorry. You know, no, no more tomfoolery, all right? I promise. <laughs> and if we're going to leave him in charge, he has to have the respect of these fucking animals. And if they disrespect him when he's nearly dead, then he can't do his job. And if he can't do his job, then we have to fire everybody and hire people who can do their fucking work. You've, uh, I think can Severin just, Yeah, he's thing. handed just, to Stephanie and said, do the honor. I don't, I don't know how to use that. Uh, uh, there appear to be, there appears to be a written note <laughs> to, to the cup. Unfortunately, um, it's at the bottom. Hey, so you pour it out. <laughs> <laughs> she, says, yeah. she says, um... Applied she says, apply, uh, she says, apply this entire, like, entire uh, salve, like, um, across his, like, head and shoulders, and, uh, he's and he's he should be, he should be unpetrified within a few minutes. Also, 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 fuck you, you. Yeah, also, fuck you, Severin. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, do it. Oh. All over the shoulders and the head. Y- y- yes, sir. All over there. Um, <laughs> as, uh, as she, <laughs> as she, like, pops up, <laughs> pops off the lid, and, um, she, like, she says, how about do I, Don't mess she, up. We only have one shot at I, that. I know. I know. I got it. Uh, and uh, she will uh, take it and sort of like dip her hand in, and, like pull out in like chunky scoops and like put it on like his shoulders nice. and his uh, and his and his head. It's it's like chunky, but it has this like very like viscous quality to it. So like yeah. as soon as she puts it down, like uh, like the chunks mm. sort of remain, but the uh, but like the liquid sort of just, like like flows like in, through every crack and crevice on on uh, oh this perfectly God. sculpted body of Aram, um, <laughs> you know, if you know, you know, yeah. um, and, uh, and, um, as, and his um, perfect the body, right <laughs> yeah, um, and as the basilisk oil is applied stone. by Minzy, the stone encasing him begins to melt away like ice under hot water. In but a few moments, Aram is freed. 
And when he is, he collapses onto the ground and gasps for air as he's, <gasps> oh, I'm gonna fucking kill you! What the? Hello. Welcome back. Howdy. What? Oh, my fucking head. I could barely see anything. What? What? What happened to me? Last last thing I remember, I was I was in that bastard's apartment, and he, and I was walking out, and he, and I drank that you shit get, he gave me. You got trapped in carbonite. <laughs> I got trapped in. What? You got turned to Touch stone, there. Oh, that fucking Vince, I'm gonna kill him. He, he's already dead. Huh? Like really dead. Wow. I set him on fire. Wait, what? Oh fuck. Yeah, I, I, that did happen. Oh. Sending a message. I see. Uh, of course. He um sits up on like back on his on his he's like on his knees at this point instead of sitting on his heels and uh, and um he says, ah oh, shit, I, I you guys have to go through a lot of trouble to get me out of this. Not at all. You mean that? No. No, a lot of trouble, but, but... Oh, it was gonna happen anyways. We've been in more trouble. Yes. It's not, it's not steel skin trouble. We gained a lot from it. Yeah, that is true. <sighs> we gained her? Oh, yes. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> she <laughs> says, I am Briah, Severin's subordinate. <laughs> Speaking of that, Thank you, Bouncer. I mean, um, I, I, I do need help in the nights. I don't, you know, I already don't sleep. Bobby, that sounds bad. Yeah, we'll figure that out. Uh, it's not the same. Aram, when everyone else is cleared out, why don't you come and talk to me? Uh, yeah, sure, Roy. Um, Principal's office. You got it. Uh, he, like, sort of tries to stand up and his legs are a little wobbly. He says, Christ, I feel like a fucking deer. Um, a baby doe. Don't, mm, don't him. remind oh. me. Um, Shut up. He says, a stick with you guys? I can't. I'm right here. Hey. Yeah, Hi. Hey, stick. Severed will kind of grab his sorry shoulder for, and kind of bring him around sorry for the, right uh, next to Aaron. Oh, hey, there you are. Hi. Uh, sorry for the, sorry for the scare. Um, all, all of you. I, uh -huh. I, uh, Stick can tell you everything that happened in the past day, too. I don't know. Uh, yeah, Time. sure. Um, Fun. Hey, hey, boss, can I come see you when my vision's cleared up a little? Yeah, Roy. You can totally give him that allowance. Because he's kind of infirm <laughs> at the moment. Look, the talking to I have will wait. Whenever you are ready, come and find me. You don't have one? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um... And uh, <laughs> on that note, yep. with, yeah, with that, I mean, Aram's back. Mission Woo! accomplished. Yeah, we did it. Uh, no, we will probably go to break at this point. Oh yeah, sure. Yeah, for sure. Wow. For sure. Um, <clears throat> you solved my Aram puzzle. Yay! Good job, guys. I, I don't think Azarephus was there for any of that. Oh, Sorry. I think <laughs> just wandered off. I was bed. not interacting for like no reason. No, I think I think they got back. They they Roy, he was like, haha, that's funny. And then Roy was like. Yelling at everybody, and he was like, "All right, <laughs> he just left." And then sure. he's like, he, I mean, "Aaron will be fine. He doesn't need to be there for it." For sure. Um, so yeah, they are. Um, we're gonna so go yeah. to break. Um, before we do that, though, I want to give a big shout out to our patrons who are supporting us over on Patreon. You know, I know you really would love to give a shout out to them. Arcane Arcade. But I would also really like. Oh to no, no, no I'm gonna give it to you. I, I know, I'm getting I know. it ready. I don't want to give a shout out. I think we should not say anything. Wow! 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 wow. Hot take. Okay, all right. You heard it here first. Well, <laughs> Tyler hates Gilbert. patrons. I hate people. More like Patreon. Exactly. Uh, the, uh, and, <laughs> and your, your dumb pink names in the Discord. Whoa! Whoa! whoa. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Them's fighting words. You're gonna well, start a gang you know war what? in the you Discord. Know, you know I love you. <laughs> Go ahead, Jack. Read out all our right. beautiful patrons who support sure. us over on Patreon. There is a list of game. all of the members of House Tarkanon that have joined the House of Kyber. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Uh, or, or sorry, the Son of Kyber. Uh, Jay Kessler, ever on the road to Strix Strixhaven to study by the Witchlight. Uh, Whoa. Look, Lil Piggy Dentsu, uh, Tar, <laughs> Tar, amazing role player, role play enjoyer, one two tempo boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats. And boots and cats. Dirge tossing Carlax head to play with scratch. Oh, <laughs> damn. Uh, Puss E fart. <laughs> <laughs> Man, some bangers at the start. Orchitech, prop dead EP during stream. Damn you, mechs time zone. 
Uh, get some rest. Said he got a consultation for bottom surgery. <laughs> OMG, they're going to surgically turn me into a bottom. <laughs> uh, ligma possibly related to balls. <laughs> <laughs> I am living. I killed him. Bingo. <laughs> Uh, illiterate Moogle, Captain Dadbot on a quest to... Is that a to, bingo? Sorry, Captain... That's bingo things sometimes. One of the bingo things is the, the Patreon name's Brent Jacob. <laughs> yep, it um, is. <laughs> Captain Dadbot on a quest to your mum's whisker biscuit. <laughs> Nexus, how much vat could a vat child vat if a vat child could vat vat? Droid buyer of plastic crack, destroyer of his wallet, cyberrock underscore seven, Joe Scamo, it's Gwen, trans chumba, listener of VODs, watcher of podcast, Brittany Anderson, Leon Kennedy's milkers, how much does Jordan charge for mustache rides? For mustache, what? <laughs> <laughs> for how much does Jordan charge for, for mustache rides? rides? <laughs> oh my god! Hey, yo! All right, well, uh, 1,000 notes, 1,000 screams, mortal strings cut short, reverberate her soul, indignation, decimation, a red line through black ships. Sheesh! Wow. Dave the Grand, Joshua Cordell, Lego Builder 899, Moonbeam Appreciator, Nolf Says D's Nuts, Kate 12, <laughs> Reading advertisements, looking for a good time, meet a little planes, Friday night, written by Ben Jackanoff. <laughs> wow. <laughs> little planes, that's an everyone reference. Uh, Arena the Forever DM, Tax Collector, Dana the Late Moving Flo Fruit Loop, Winter Stella, ML Wolf, Brittle Dragon, Lady RB of the Drive Through, Protect Trans Homies, Sick Joy, J Guy 77, Rory Sinclair, Shista, Side the Owl, Sandman, Tree Man, Got True Polymorphed into a Chair. Austin Stoll, Damn. Why Do They Call It Cayman When They Oven the Cold Blood of How Hot Eat the Guard? Uh, Redbeard, one sack, one load. Death Wolf, Majestic Whalecorn. Next, XP to level three vid. Chad and DM meet Soycerer. Uh, small Town I Care, The Pinky Life, Life Pinky Tha. Pure Osmium, Bob said hi, who made his name overly long just to make the cast read it for no apparent reason other than his own amusement. Nice. You didn't do the thing you usually do. Usually when we read that mm. one, you always go like. Uh, it's normally oven the cold food. Of yeah. Oh, food. you're right. That yeah. one I read really fast and I go blah, 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 at the end and Craig goes sold. <laughs> <laughs> Reptilian Daedra, I'm sorry, the underrated comment from Grace during Strix. Phoebe went near the wall of fire and she said KFC. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my god, Grace. The Diabetes, Mystical Combat, Big Hoss, Skate the Goat, Augusta Ada King, Countess of Lovelace. Breaking Thorin, a twig blight wrapped in bacon suddenly jumped out of me. It was a ham bush. Yeah. Oh, that's funny. Dormammu has pathfinded into Eberron to ask the age old question where is the Dorngen in Eberron? Oh, uh, that's no. a great question. Mm. We should think about that. Yeah, we should. Um, that's the finale for this game. The Dorgen. The Dorgen. Uh, you'll Is find, your character still yeah, in Tamor there? Yeah, Hall, yeah, for sure. Uh, Argus Fallen, Alice Lilybottom, Shuriken Sean, watching the gang jailbreak an Eberron Spartan super soldier. <coughs> Shut up. Hell yeah. Uh, Hell yeah. <laughs> Martin, but would you be there if I was going through something? <laughs> <laughs> no. Absolutely not. I hope it sucks. That's, that's, oh. I'm just kidding. I, I, I would be there for you, buddy. Uh, K. Zachary Neese, Duncan York, Zach, says, Jacob, wake up like that Akira meme with the Patreon names. Leave me alone. Alone. The Pinky Life, Life Pinky the Gah! Yeah. Uh, Fancy Arthas, <laughs> Res Storm, Mimi H, Will Pratt, possibly related to Chris Pat, Pimpin' Hood, Mama Love and Papa Joy, and Josh Travis have all, Woo! Have all devoted guys. themselves to the destruction of the Dragon Marked Houses. Really, though. All Good right, job. thank you guys so much. We'll see you in a few minutes.
and, and welcome back. So, we uh, left off with Aram getting unpetrified. Yay. Um, the crux of the conflict of the last couple games has been resolved. And uh, now we're somewhat back to business as usual at, uh, at the Storm Tower. Um, this, uh, this next segment is going to take place over the course of a, of a couple of days. Um, so we'll start with uh, Roy. Roy, you wanted to talk to Aram as yeah. soon as he was available. Um, I would say the next morning, after Aram's gotten a little rest, um, he, would, um, he would come and find you, and he would say, you, uh, you free to talk? Yeah. I assume we're like in Roy's office. Yeah, maybe. yeah. In or his, his little workshop. Like yeah, he's probably for sure. Probably well, office workshop. slash workshop. Um, I assume Aaron sits down. Yeah, and, he'll um, take a seat and looks a little nervous, but also has a face like he might know what, what's coming, but yeah. he just sits there. Roy reaches into his desk and pulls out a vial of dragon's blood and tosses it on the table. And says, you know, Aaron, if you want to kill yourself, there are more expedient ways to do it. Listen, boss, I wasn't... I know it's dangerous. I wasn't trying to kill myself. I just know that, I don't know, word on the street is that shit, I don't know, make, make you powerful, amplify your magic or whatever. I thought I'd try a nip of it, see what it did, because lately I just feel like, I feel like I haven't been doing enough, you know? <clears throat> and I just wanted to see, and boy, did I suffer for it. So, I, I'm real sorry. I don't have anything else to say but, but that. I was stupid, and uh, it ain't gonna happen again. I know enough guys who went over and fought, and they come back, and they self-medicate, and I am not here to judge you for that. Some folks gotta go to sleep, and the only way that takes them there is to dream a little. But this is an organization, and I don't want junkies running my organization. You can't shoot like Sev. You can't shoot like a Zarephus. You can't bring people back from the dead. You don't throw fucking mugs at people. You're not a seven foot tall robot. Your power is your heart, Aram. You joined up with this crew when you didn't have to. And they took your fucking arm and you're still here. I'm sorry that you felt like you needed this junk to feel powerful. Well, I mean, not like it's your fault. You're all just uh, more skilled, more uh, experienced. I don't know. We were running around with the firebolts. I mean, it's more like a game than all this. You know, just do whatever the Boromar clan says and nobody fucks with you. Then Dask showed up and the steel skins and now everything's so much more complicated. And I wanna, you know, I wanna stick up for the people that stuck up for me, you know, so. I mean, I guess my heart's the only way I could do that. Shit. Do what I can, I guess. What I mean to say is, if you need a break, take one. <laughs> because shit is real. And it is hard. And if pushing yourself means that you try this or try something else, I, I don't want to push you that hard. I want the Aram who signed up with us when we were nothing. That's who I want working my, my guys. Um, Aram kind of adjusts his posture a bit and he says, uh, I can do that. I can do that, Roy. Thanks. Give me a shake, he says, uh, you know, you're kind of a hard ass, but you're a good guy. Thank you. I don't think a lot of people would give a street rat like me a chance. So. All right, get the fuck out of here. Yeah, you got it. Uh, 
<laughs> he, 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 um, he like sort of says, just like, why did I say that? <laughs> as, he, like, <laughs> as he like walks away, um, uh, and uh, you know, he leaves, of course, the tainted dragon's blood behind. Anything else you'd like to do, Roy? Um, eventually, I need to touch base with Ilsa about the uh, the thing, but that can wait. Okay. The uh, the recipe. Oh, for the Kyber's blood. Yeah. Got it. Yeah. Okay. Sounds good. Sounds good. Um, you're a bot. You and uh, I mean, I mean, you spot Briah sort of just <laughs> standing easy. around in the storm <clears throat> tower. Um, Looks like she's actually like standing outside of Sev's like I don't know I don't know if Sev has like a room in the place but uh we does doesn't isn't well, is there a bot kind of thing? Yeah. Um I think more than anything. Yeah, what would you do with Briya when you're not at this I think tower? he's he doesn't know what to do either. Uh it's well, last time he's had to lead people half you know, they die. He's like, Oh, I oh. don't like this responsibility. Um so I think he would have kind of just said stick with Beerbot. Okay. Beerbot, Briah follows you like your own shadow uh, every time <laughs> Severin is not around. Okay. Which yeah. is often. That works. Um, just goes. Usually she doesn't really say anything. She just <coughs> okay. sort of follows you it, on it, your rounds. If rounds, anything, then, you know. yeah, since, I guess since Beerbot's kind of become the one that's heading up the charge when it comes to making sure our defenses are good and mm -hmm. stuff, mm -hmm. uh, Given that that she admittedly is good at various strategies and working things out combat wise, mm -hmm. he's probably using her almost also as a sounding board to be sure. like this because this yes yeah. no like yeah kind of almost like a mm -hmm. extra for hand. for certain scenarios In it that, looks like she she might be getting some like overload um, and and is getting a little frustrated but for the most part like if it's if it's pretty simple and direct and. Um, and even like a little complicated tactically, mm -hmm. she seems to help you do that. Yeah. Um, so um, some of it might be intentional, just as like a little way to push. Sure. Yeah. Um, and as the days go by, I mean, you could, you're able to push her a little further, but um, always aware that that uh, you know push her too hard and she might she might blow. So um, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm, uh, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> But she Sorry. just, uh, you know, she just hangs out with you for no. the next couple days. Okay. Um, at one point, he's kind of, I guess, looking around the bar. Do we have, we have, like, kind of some open space around yeah. the tavern. Yeah, right? there's, like, a plaza that the storm tower's in. Wonderful. Yeah. That's honestly perfect. Yeah. He, uh, <laughs> he, he, I think he looks to, uh, to her and he goes, you know, I think... He looks around at most of the people that have been hired and kind of like set as, as I guess, like various guards and stuff, right? Mm -hmm, the, mm -hmm. the various, um, sorry, I've been out of this game. That's program. okay. So the various yeah. gangs that we've yeah. brought along yeah. Yeah. and that are there guarding. Um, he goes, I think most of them are probably new, honestly. I don't know if any of them's ever actually seen a real fight. We could give them and demonstrate in the plaza, I suppose. Are you challenging me? Uh, spar. Non-deadly. Non-lethal. Understood. Weapons? Uh, he looks at his hand. <laughs> you got something like this. It's I do not have a weapon attached to my hand. Right. Sorry. I should specify. <laughs> something blunt would be fine. I can knock any dents out pretty easily. Um, she... Would you guys have given Briya a weapon? Yes, at a certain if available, point? absolutely. <laughs> you guys have weapons available. Probably like probably like a like the D and D equivalent of like a light hammer. That's like, okay. that's a weapon. Yeah, yeah. the light a, hammer. That's literally a weapon in the. I think it's I think it's probably a, a weapon. Uh, yeah, that probably yeah. like it here. It's a light hammer. <laughs> sure. Perfect. Um, I imagine you guys also She's give her some maybe ill-fitting armor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because you don't have you don't have armor I, sized for giant I, woman. Sorry, babe, you're really big. So it's like. We, we custom made giant good. woman armor. I'll have to talk to you about that. Oh, oh, okay. I think I know where this is going, but yeah, but uh, oh. but okay. 
I got gotcha. you. Big lady armor supplier. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Big and tall. Yeah. Big and tall. <laughs> well, that too. Yeah. There's various options there. Um, but yeah, I guess right. all that. And, and Beerbot would kind of gather everyone that's not actively like watching a post around. Mm. And the intention of this is going to be like, <laughs> educational. He's going to be like, all right. So uh, I'm not good with all the speech stuff, but um, I mean, I guess just try to learn from watching. Uh, how many of you have actually been in a fight? Um, <laughs> hey, Stick is here. Stick is here. <laughs> Stick doesn't have an active duty at the moment. Um, but uh, I uh, have. Yeah, right. Wants to, um, yeah, I'm, 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 uh, I think I'm like uh, sitting up. Uh, feel like you know uh, more more than you anticipated. Okay, ra- raise their hand. Some of these guys were involved in the fight against the Steel Skins and stuff. Right. Some of them are green. You know. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So you know, like, I'd say he, it's about it's about like forty pulls, sixty. Like the green, the the ones that are more green, he kind of pulls yeah, them up. Green to the recruits front and for like sure. Has for them sure. Watch from the front for sure. And uh, he's gonna pray that this doesn't scare them off. For sure. But, uh, yeah. However, you wanna. Um, I'm gonna say you know this is gonna be um, this is gonna be like a victory points contest kind of thing. Just like whoever rolls the highest out of all the coming checks and saving mm-hmm. throws, I'm about to ask for. If you if you succeed if you beat your opponent you gain a victory yeah. point whoever has the most victory points at the end Perfect. will be the winner so is that what it's called in Pathfinder uh, it's a subsystem I think it works a little differently but that's just what that's I'm how we're, that's right what we're now. gonna do today yeah because yep. it's just easier for me and I don't have to pull up the rule book Perfect. so um, oops sorry power strip um, <laughs> so um, we can start with um, <coughs> let's do let's start with an attack roll okay just using weapon. Yeah, or you know, whatever. Yeah, whatever uh, weapon you have. Let me pull up her stat block. <laughs> All right. Okay, I got a twenty-nine. Got it. Um, you, you get a victory point this round. You did okay. roll higher than her. Um, next, we're going to do. Um, let's do a, a fortitude save. Fortitude. Uh, I need to do the math. Sorry. No, that's uh, okay. 13, 17, Start off. 18, plus 4, 22. Okay. Um, roll again. Oh, ho, 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 ho. whoa. Tanks, 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 um. tanks, tanks. Uh, I think you're a little off center from the camera. Plus I think you're 18. a little off center from the camera. Oh. 18 this time. Uh, 18. Yeah, um, I rolled a five. Point goes to her. She uh, she she is more uh, durable in this sense. Um, <laughs> reflex save. Oh, oh, fuck. <laughs> uh, okay. Keep well, in mind, you do have an inspiration coin if you I want. Do. To use it oh, on this. I, not on this though. I'm not going to use it on this. That's a 19 on the die. Wow. Uh, 21. Right, he's not going to re-roll that. Uh, he's like, I rolled a 20. <laughs> 12, so 31. Yeah. Okay. Victory point goes to you on that one. Um, then let's do um, the, the the saves of the three that I didn't mm, redo my math yeah. for for the level ups. Let's so. do an intimidation check. Intimidation. I'm good at that too. Don't I scare know. the girl away or the other little guys. Mm-hmm. Sixteen. Take the okay. like. She gets the point. All right. She's scary. Then. So it's we're two and two, <laughs> two, and two at this point. One, one more. This is going to be the deciding factor. Mm. Um, let's make mm. this. I can. An athletics check. I got a plus 14 to that. <laughs> if I take my coin, if I use my coin, do I have to use the new roll? You think you use that? Oh, you have to use the new roll? Well, the way that I if do it is if you, you use the coin, it's a re-roll and you have to take the new roll because otherwise there's no reason to right. not ever have yeah. advantage. Yeah. I think I mean, it's like if you've good. rolled, you... To me, how I rule it mm-hmm. is you, oh, fuck it. If you roll, you could roll lower than a 10. Roll. I could use the coin beforehand. Then you did. Dirty 20. Dirty 20. Okay. It's a, it's a hard fought <coughs> battle. You you had a feeling that she would be a tough opponent, Mirabod. I don't think you were quite ready for the mm-hmm. sheer strength behind Briya. Um, the, you know, um, it's, it's a close game uh, as you two eventually just like ditch the weapons and it just turns into like a grappling contest <laughs> as you are both trying to like throw each other to the ground. Um, even with, you know, you're made of steel and she's mm-hmm. made of flesh and bone, but it feels like you're going up against another Warforged. Damn. Because she is just so 
magically augmented. Um, at the last second, though, you do manage to trip her and bring her to the oh, ground. Damn. Uh, and earn a hard-fought victory. Um, she Robots can swim. She looks frustrated, but relents. He, he offers a hand. Um, and she, she takes it uh, in your as her muscles bulging as she, uh, as she uh, you know, c- pulls up to the, uh, you know, bring, helps you, you help her bring her, uh, herself up yeah. to your fe- her feet. And um, if, if a Warforged could breathe heavily, I yeah, suppose. For he sure. Really, he doesn't really do that. For sure. But he kind of looks and, and, uh, and he kind of looks back to everyone else and then looks back to her and <laughs> sticks to the wrong kinda, applause. He kind of. <laughs> Face palms very mildly at stick, <laughs> and, then, and then looks back. Wow! And goes, so I really learned a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I expect to see you use all of it in our next fight. Oh, stick. for sure. <laughs> you, you see, Rena like sitting up at the top, giving Puck a gold. <laughs> nice. That's funny. Nice. You bet against beer pot. <laughs> Really I had that in my head. Damn, wow, that's, you guys that's were funny. Like, <laughs> All right. You um, use techniques that I've not seen anyone use before. You've given me much to. You've given me much to think about. I left many openings. Mm. I just followed my instincts, my training. That's good. You're a skilled fighter. I've never fought a warforged before. You sure fight like one. I will take that as a compliment. <coughs> it was. We were forged for war, you were made for it. it would seem. And we all find our way. Uh, he turns and looks at everyone else. So, you all learned something? Uh, they're, they're, all, they're all kind of... You like, bet. I mean, they, they, it looks like some you know, kind of weren't paying attention. Some were um, and appear to yeah, be kind of shocked at the proceeds of like watching basically two... Fucking titans <laughs> uh, fight with each other, um, and then uh, have the audacity to say, "So, what did we learn today, yeah, class?" Um, uh, They're like, "Don't fuck with Beerbot or Brya." <laughs> Lesson <laughs> learned. Like, we learned Lesson something. Learned. We learned something today. Well, you know, don't what? mess with the big warforged. Don't mess with the big lady. Got it. Well, locked sure in. glad they were on our side. He 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 thinks for a moment and he turns to her and goes, "Do you drink? Have you ever?" I was told not to drink alcohol. Mm. Would you like to? Is that an order? She looks confused. He 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 looks at her and he goes. No, don't do it. I suppose my order is for you to decide. Oh no! You're gonna break her. <laughs> she's already, she's yeah, already, no, she's no, already all tired no, out. Yeah, she is a little tired out. Yeah. Everybody's like, scatter! Um, <laughs> she says, do you drink? <laughs> do you even need to? Do you remember? Do you get thirsty? I do not. Yes, but he does. <laughs> I, <laughs> I do not, but... Sometimes after a battle, a cool drink is nice. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <sighs> I shall try one cool drink. Water. <laughs> <laughs> With a lemon. Wonderful. Can I water uh, a shot no, of tequila? <laughs> no, he would, he, would, he would go and find something that is not the shitty stuff we probably serve everyone else. <laughs> okay. <laughs> whatever, whatever a decent sure. thing is. Um, she doesn't seem to like it that That's much, um, but she drinks it. Um, cool. She says, we should spar again. Next time, I will gain the upper hand. <laughs> I have learned much from this battle with you. You leave your left flank open a lot. <laughs> you should amend that. That is my shield side. Well, they have her side. Mara, make a note of that, please. <laughs> Noted. Thank you. <laughs> if I start leaving it open in battle, please tell me. Understood. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, <laughs> have yeah, have you want to talk about a Spartan super soldier? This guy's got a Cortana in his head. I <laughs> no, mean. it's like it's, it's Jarvis. <laughs> oh yeah, Come it on. is Jarvis, isn't it? Um, <laughs> <laughs> when 
when I when That's I the really <laughs> shitty one. <laughs> when I lower my oh, I shield, Halo, raise it for yeah. me. Oh yeah. yeah, not the actual like virtual assistant of the same name. <laughs> 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 Bro's got serious. He's laughing? got the, he's got Clippy in. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bro's it looks like, like you want to murder some enemies. Mara's Mara's like that's not where you put a semicolon. <laughs> yeah, actually. Uh, do you need some assistance? Um. All right. Hi, I'm Mara. <laughs> Hi, your virtual assistant. It would seem that you've adjusted this page too far to the left. <laughs> Zarephus. Mm -hmm. It's dark. Are we also gonna go talk to? Um, I mean, uh, do you drink? Do you drink the? <laughs> probably not. The boo boo juice. Probably not. <laughs> no, probably not right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's just not yet. Um, I'll save it. You're thinking about it as, <laughs> as you're, um, you just sort of, um, uh, as 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 you're lying awake in the in the middle of the night, sort of staring at the ceiling, and um, you watch as like, under the door. Something flies in. It's like a little piece of paper um, that appears to like f fly on like an updraft over to you and lands on your chest. Grabs it. Mm -hmm. Written on the paper is text that you have not seen in a long time. This is um, Orkalunan script, uh, and it says. It says, meet us behind the butchers. We need to talk. Elcora. Come alone. That says, P.S., come alone. XOXO. <laughs> <laughs> like... um, it wouldn't say P.S., it would say, we need to talk. Come alone. He behind the sits butchers. Up, uh, and uh, he kind of looks at it again. Um, and then he like flips it over and he looks at it. Uh, and then he yes. turns it. Um, and then he gets up and he goes outside the door and he kind of looks to make sure like nobody's just like there. Um, but not, he's not like, like no, sneaking for sure. around. He's just kind of like looking um, and then he would go. For sure. You're able to sneak out the back. Um, you, you know, lay low, head into Dask territory. Um, head towards the butchers. Everything appears to be shut down for the night. There are some, you know, um, some people, you know, coming through, but for the most part, it's kind of dead on this side of town. Um, as you head behind the butchers and you, uh, you don't see anybody there. But uh, as you arrive um, a moment later, you hear a voice say, I'll be honest, I didn't think you'd show. Son of Kadav. <laughs> um, what do I owe the pleasure? Uh, as Elcora, the the Dask lieutenant that you guys met the other day, um, walks in. This this you know tiefling woman, red skin like yours. These horns that kind of curl behind her head and end under her ears. Her face adorned and her ears adorned with various piercings. Um, with her are about five other tieflings. Oh wow! All of them <laughs> are ones that you recognize from before when you ran with Dask. Mm -hmm. He, he. They don't appear. I mean, they, they don't appear aggressive. They do have. They do have all their weapons and right. stuff. Right. I think even still, the, um, he steps back a bit, mm -hmm. um, and like he's without the group, he's by himself. So he, yeah. he he's he's intimidated. Mm -hmm. He's scared. Yeah. And as he steps back, he has his hand on his weapon, but like he's not like ready to fire. No, for it's sure. sort of just like there. For sure. And he says, I "Finally, catch your attention." Um, the others put hands on their infernal firearms as well, uh, or on their mm -hmm. arcane firearms as well. And, uh, but Elcora just stands there with her staff. And um, she says, be at peace, Zarephus. If we wanted you dead, you would be dead already. I feel like you tried. Yes, we did. And it seems we failed. <clears throat> you crawled out of the hole that the watch threw you in. And now you're back. You displayed more cunning than we anticipated. Tell me, do you remember why we were all sent to the east? I didn't realize so many of us were. Well, it is a much coveted thing, the promise of flame. You were sent by your parents in House Kadav 
I was sent by mine and House Dregu. All of us, scions of the great four houses, sent east to find this artifact for the glory of the domain. So you've uh, made up then, started uh, your own business here in, in Sharn and Dask? As far as we can tell, Dask does not realize our true purpose here, and we are more than willing to play along with the charade of this alliance. We just wanted to make, sh I just wanted to make sure that you were still aware of your purpose here. Is my purpose being dead? No. Your purpose is to find the promise of flame. There's no point in all of us struggling against each other, trying to kill each other to find this thing, when all of us could work together and bring it back home so that we can leave this horrible place full of these wretched people. Ah, that's some shit. You've all been here looking for it, right? Why do you think I'm gonna make a difference? I came to you looking for answers. <laughs> Unless you've made some wild new discoveries of some kind, I'd love to be enlightened. Um, Okora reaches into uh, her robe and pulls something out. She said, we found this. And um, it appears to be some sort of Fernian charge okay. of unknown design. At least design that you don't really recognize as being modern day artifice or even giant level artifice. This is something different. And it, it, you, 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 you're familiar with Fernian auras. This mm -hmm. burns with that sort of energy. Um, she says, we believe this to be a component of the promise of flame. Some connection to it, some connection to the flames of Fernia. There's nothing else that would be here. There are no manifest zones that we know of. No portal, portals to other planes. Where'd you find it? We found it in the caverns beneath the cogs, deep in Old Shard, when we were able to get away. But we were not able to progress any further. There are wards and guards that uh, prevent any further exploration down there. We? All of you? Yes. While you were in prison. <laughs> Not the newest one here. I, I didn't realize we had a coalition. Nobody well, told me. Times change. And uh, this goal is paramount. And frankly, we are all sick of being in this horrid eastern land. <laughs> we wish to return home. All right. And we would like you to come with us, because you don't belong here either. We're better than all these people. I'd love to. Continue ingratiating yourself with the Storm Tower Six. Do as you please. I'm not giving you orders. I will. I don't take orders from you. <laughs> this is fun, though. Let's play a little game. Yeah. The rest of you, me, keep aligning yourself with Dask. It'll work out. I'm sure. Everything will come to a head at some point. And when it does, don't expect us to hold back. I wouldn't expect the same of you either. Um, does she have the thing? She does, and okay. she tosses it to you. Yeah, and he 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 was gonna go like take it, but like he mm -hmm. he just catches it, um, and he said, and he looks down, and he says. Let's see who's left to die next. <laughs> Hopefully none of us. We belong at home in the domain. When we have the promise, we can leave all these Easterners to rot in this cesspool that they've created for themselves. Right. Oh, you know who I am. And you know us now. Good night, Azarephus. It was, Enjoy so. playing with that trinket. Uh, he'll make his way back to the storm tower. Mm -hmm. um, this particular uh, component is um, a magic item that you are able to attach to your arcane firearm. Whoa, cool. Uh, it is called, hold on, let me pull up the stats for Pain it. Charm, it's above me. <laughs> <laughs> no. Wow! 
and put it on your Crocs. <laughs> yeah, it's a Croc nice. charm. Uh, it's like a little fire. Fernie and Croc charm. Yeah, the Fernie and Croc charm. <laughs> it's all the rage. Mm -hmm. Literally. Hide it's back. hot. It is hot. It's it's flying off the shelves. Wow. Um, Can I have it? For my Crocs? What was that you would wear Crocs, wouldn't you? It's definitely stick with that. <laughs> he does. He would have all the colors. Oh, yeah. Um, okay, I, I just, just every it shade of blue. Uh, what it what it basically <laughs> is is um, I've turned this little cross. component of what uh, Elcora believes to be a piece of the uh, or some sort of magical <laughs> item connected to the promise of flame. Cool. Um, it is uh, the, the equivalent of the wand of rolling flames. Cool. Um, basically, you can cast flaming sphere, and in addition to casting the spell, the ground around the flaming sphere also catches on fire. Cool. So kind of just amplifies that spell. I think he's like outside the storm tower and yeah. he does like attach it at this point where it's mm -hmm. sort of like, it's not like a tinkering thing. It just magically looks like, just like attaches itself mm -hmm. to it. Um, then it like burns with like the, the, the cinders and the sigils on it. Um, and he uh, kind of like drops his hands. It's like, kind of like confirmation to him. Um, and he just like punches his fist into the wall mm -hmm. um, and like into the alleyway. He's just like, ah! And he storms his way into the storm tower um, uh, looking upwards. Um, is, is Severin here? Yeah, he's probably leaning against the banister by now. Cool. He walks over and he throws his hand like up oh. against the wall and he says, "Hey, I've had a really fucking bad day." Um, I can tell. You want to give me some orders? <laughs> it's not necessarily the stages of grief. It's the <laughs> stages of over processing. And then... Look, I know it went down at the tank gala, okay? You know? Out here? No, not at... No, no, no! I'm gonna pull you over. Oh, my goodness! My, my, my. Poo-wee, okay. Well, we're gonna fade to black on that moment. Uh, leave Hell that up yeah. to your fan fictions and imagination. <laughs> <laughs> It's like a different game. Hey, yo. <laughs> um, whew, okay. Let's go, dude. That. I'm gonna go kill things now. This <laughs> is gonna be epic. <laughs> 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 wow. Oh, man. Sorry, I just wanna sit in that. For oh, minute. wow. All right, all right, all right. All right. All right. <clears throat> Do you hear that? Um, that patron named Jordan <laughs> no. earlier? Oh. <laughs> No, no, Somebody said, no. does Jordan give... Free no, no, it's nuts. No. How much does Jordan charge for mustache rides? Anyway. Give him to my wife for free. Hey, hey yo! yo! <laughs> my man. <laughs> Good God. <laughs> wow. All right. Um, anyways, Dungeons <laughs> and Dragons. Um, or Pathfinder, I guess, in this case. Yeah. Um, the oh. next day comes. I'll say over the course of this time, about three days has passed. Um, so oh, the, the day of the heist was, I believe, the... The fourth. The fourth, yeah, so it's the seventh today. Seventh of Olaroon, 998 YK for my favorite date writer downers. Um, <laughs> but which one? Uh, <laughs> no comment. Um, you could but, have just uh, said me. That would have been funny. <laughs> yeah, Jacob. Yeah, Jacob, what, <laughs> Jacob, what day is it? I'm my own favorite. I don't even know what year it is. Not, not a therapist. Because I write down the date. <laughs> I don't um, think a therapist knows that. A therapist writes down the date on every wall. I don't know, it's fucking... He has a calendar from three <laughs> years ago fucking, in his room. Isn't it soul? He goes outside and he looks up. I don't know. Can't even say. Yeah. <laughs> it's from Brooklyn um, Nine Nine. You guys, uh, you guys all wake up uh, at the at the storm tower or otherwise, and um, you know make your day there and ready for work. Um, I mean, I'm gonna say the night before was this whole Azarephus and uh, and and Seth thing. Um, so I don't know if you all walk out of the same room or whatever, but oh, Beerbot's already probably well. Beerbot's on Beerbot's on guard. Briya, As always. Briya can't find Severin, so she's with you. Um, I think he has no choice. Oh yeah, yeah. He's like, yeah. I, I'm stuck. Yep. Well, go out the window. Huh? The, window? Go no. out the window? No! <laughs> I, Azarephus has zero shame. <laughs> he's all, he's like almost proud. He like walks out and he's just like, oh, 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 <laughs> The door slams open oh. and everyone in the storm tower looks over at you. you and like, what the fuck? Why did you slam the door open? <laughs> Good morning. Azarephus? <clears throat> you seem happier than usual in the morning. <laughs> Are you not Do I? Yeah, you're you're normally you're dragging yourself out of 
Yeah, I, I, I don't like waking up. Yeah, <clears throat> that's what I mean. Yeah. Uh, Usually drunk by now. Do you sleep? No. We've had this. Oh, that's right. You just have that chair. Yeah. yeah. yeah that's, right. <laughs> that's right. Yeah, I've been yeah. sitting here all night. Royce right here? An insight. Where? Mm-hmm. Royce, get an insight. What? Insight? <laughs> insight? Yeah. A therapist? Yeah, he's just, he's behind the bar, like, sipping on a coffee. Um, what are you, sorry, what exactly are you inciting? Like, which statement? Um, it just seems. Or, or just, like, are you trying to get a read into his behavior? Yeah, it's very fishy. Okay. I'll roll, fishy. I'll roll the perception check for you. What's your, I guess what's your, um, what would that be? A, that would D, be... a, a DC is set. Is yeah, like it's a plus DC skill, right? Deception, I think. Uh, it'd be, uh, I, I, my deception is plus eight. Okay, so eight, 18 DC. And I'm rolling. Oh, I already rolled for okay. you. Yeah, um, you don't roll here. What? Oh, okay. Um, I didn't say anything. <laughs> I think that's how DCs are set. I, I believe so too. Um, uh, it's 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 really close, but um, yeah, uh, I don't know, Roy. You you've you've you know you've seen people who've gotten some before. <laughs> and they wake up the next day. Yeah, he looks over at Roy. And he's just like, oh, did you make coffee? And he walks over. Yeah, you like, want a cup? Yeah, that'd be great. Were you up? Hmm. A long night. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and then at that point, he kind of catches on to Roy, and he kind of looks at him, he's like... Yeah, it was kind of <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, did he just cheers? He's like, nice! <laughs> <laughs> oh, and and then Roy's gonna say, so how was she? The big lady. <laughs> oh, he puts his hand on his shoulder, he says, Roy, I wish. <laughs> I wish. But, but, but. What did you do to stick? This I like this list. This is, this is good. Not stick. Oh, I wouldn't turn down the offer. <coughs> I feel like that wouldn't be very fun. Probably no, not. I don't think so either. I think you could, there's not, not physically bare butt, more like a, like a, it's you. It's just your personality. I don't understand. He has hands. He's just, I just, he's just like, he's just like a missionary. Like, it that's can't just, be Brenna. <laughs> that's his only thing. Right? That what? would be like a kid. Yeah, no, I didn't. I'm, no. I'm much older than a kid. Thank you very much. This is an elimination here. It's just, wow. Just Severin. Whoa. How did you not gather that, sir? No, I, sir. <laughs> I imagine that, you know, it existed as a possibility far back in my brain. I just didn't, like, of all the people, I didn't go there. I wouldn't have gone there. I wouldn't have gone there. I wouldn't have gone, I wouldn't have gone there. I they have the, like, bickering sexual tension. So, like, that's what's going on. All right. I don't the, know, like, yeah, how was um, it? The, 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 the love, they <laughs> each other. <laughs> oh, wait, actually, the actually, the wait, wait, actually, actually, this does totally change everything if Severed is here. I think he had to gather his clothes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so if like, like not here, where is then his tone everything. is much differently. And he's like, he's like, come on, come on. Then he, he's like, yeah, yeah nice. Uh, to be honest, <clears throat> I thought I was going to have to do a lot more work. <clears throat> During or before? I'm not going or into after. the detail, Rena. All right, after. you sleep with Severin if you want to. And you can get all the details you want. <laughs> everyone, you say that and everyone. Just... Yeah, everyone <laughs> in the fucking storm tower, all of your goons. Like, <laughs> oh. Or like... Like, is he still like upstairs? Did, or? I think one of them is like, like did he just invite us all to sleep with Severin? And what? just hears that. <laughs> yeah, comes out the door. Well, then you should sleep with Severin. <laughs> cool, chillin'. Yeah, he's like at the stairs. just like, this is my life now. All right, what's all the talking today? I gotta piss. <laughs> <laughs> morning. Hi, Severin. Good morning, I Severin. Would what you like do? a cup of coffee? Sure. It's good coffee. There's nothing wrong with it. I'm just gonna... <laughs> I watched him make it. He didn't put anything in it. Okay, cool. As Eric was already <laughs> drank some of it, too. And he did. What? what? I don't know. You know you guys can just act normally? I don't think. Jesus is Eric. <laughs> <laughs> what did I do? Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Why should we go? <laughs> I'm assuming comments have already been. Everyone I, knows I oh, everything. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Your partner was not just, very quiet about it. I'm sure Newsy's already it, telling I, everyone. I just thought that oh. Zerfus seemed happier than usual. Wow. I noticed he's person. wearing your belt. Is that a fucking witch? 
Come on, stick. <laughs> it's a good belt. <laughs> Damn it. It's not yours. Oh, jeez. Yeah, hey. I know. <laughs> hey, 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 at least it's not his hoodie. So. Uh, it wasn't hoodie, exactly hoodie. what I meant when I said we all had to start trusting each other, Sev. But you know what? <laughs> Fucking touche. <laughs> Uh, all right. Look, Roy, I, I mean, <laughs> the door's always open. Uh, I think I could change your, change your world. Okay. I think you're a little too okay. spicy for me. So, <laughs> so comparison to manhole. Ilsa. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> no. What? Ray right, said so is Zerifus is a manhole. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, non derogatory. Yeah, okay. So, respectfully. <laughs> respectfully. <laughs> <laughs> Sticks up your flesh, shaven. I am. Pick up the bell. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 as you're all, you know, t- uh, taking in this moment and <laughs> laughing with each other, and you know, you're a little embarrassed, Severin, but it's whatever. Um, the door to the storm tower slams open oh. as um, one of your uh, soldiers, you recognize him uh, as, a, as a shifter by the name of Kiros, is standing in the doorway panting with two arrows sticking out of his back. Oh, and um, he, as he announces into the tavern, he says, Dask's attacking the crooked cat! Oh, shit. shit. <clears throat> All right, runs uh, over. Okay. Well, time Why to go. can't we have one morning where we, we just are laughing and not having to? Oh, no, that part's already I'd much rather prefer Come this. On. Let's go kill some <laughs> fucking Dask agents. Uh, so question. Yeah. Um, I was gonna <clears throat> is Briya coming with you guys? Yeah. Let the girl yeah. fight. Yeah. Let the girl Let her fight. fight. Let her fight. Jacob, go find a mini for well, Briya. Okay, it's not even I, a... It's I not even will a, ask. Briya, do you want to come with? Here, I got one. Is that an order? That is not an order. That <laughs> is, is, there a, is, that is a question. Is, it's an order. You're fighting. <laughs> no, I'm Briar, you can I'm try asking. the new stuff we've learned. Come Understood. On. Okay. I got I got a mini. The other Warforged. I was going to say, is, is it, it a Motro? <laughs> I got you a little... Got you, I got yeah. some minis. I got some minis for, for Colton today. Yeah. We can use the other Warforged mini for, for yeah. a Where did I put the map? Ah, there it is. Also, that is a really cool <laughs> weapon. What the <laughs> hell? It's like a, it's like axe, like a, on a chain axe. Yeah, it's Dude, really cool. So cool. Chain axe? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. It's, yeah, it's, it's, it's axe on dumb. a fucking chain. <laughs> All right, Craig, you want to help me out with this? Uh, yeah. Do you want to keep it right here? Craig, uh, just, just wherever it's best in view and uh, accessible. I would everyone. prefer it not be right there. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. Is that okay? <clears throat> no. Jack Reach. Jack Reach. This way? That, that too, right? <laughs> you said you were left. Guys, hang on, hang on, hang on. What? Cool. There we go. Cool. You guys can place yourselves all in the street. Oh, awesome. Awesome. Um, so this might look familiar. Um, okay. It is a little familiar. Mini. Yeah. What is this? Oh, shiny oh, mana. So dual this, hand axes is, is me. Is uh, chain axe is uh, Brian. Yeah, I think this is actually going to be Brian, just for the my, sake of... Uh, perfect. Clarity. Um, you can hold that. What, what are Dom and Amazing? Jack I don't know what that is. Um, so, mm. you guys... Uh, oh. oh, I don't know my mic. Well, oh. Alan Richson now. Mm. Yeah. He was awesome. Uh, so you guys uh, get your gear together as quickly as possible, and hello, I'm right here, uh, and uh, <laughs> run over to the crooked cat with Briya in yeah. tow, as um, some of your other, uh, you know, guards at the storm tower are taking up positions to defend it in the knee, in the in the case that Dask attacks there too. Mm-hmm. Um, your uh, people at other stations have been notified. Um, the crooked cat is on the edge of your guys' territory, kind of near Dask territory as well. So this is one of the nearest places that they could possibly strike if they were ever to make a move against you guys. And uh, as you run through, you can see that it looks like a fire has started in the crooked cat. Oh, shit. Um, as uh, you hear, you, you look and you see the bodies of some of your soldiers. As um, you hear the cackling of gnolls from inside the building. <laughs> um, and uh, it looks like there are actually um, a few, there uh, appears to be some orcs outside that, um, that notice your approach, um, and they sort of give a call back uh, at, um, to some <coughs> figures inside. And uh, we're going to roll initiative here, guys. Let's do this. Uh, could I be a little bit closer to the front? Yeah, why is Rena in front? No, I don't know. I just put her there. You guys can put yourselves <laughs> you in You know, she could be a order. tank now. 
Yeah, that's true. She drank Among Us potion. I, I drank the Among Us potion. Is she a tank? No. Where? Probably not, no. Roy, why are you in front? I don't know. I just put kind of put I almost there. certainly wouldn't be. I only have 25. <laughs> okay. <laughs> have 20, everyone would, would be, be like, oh, moderating their steps. Oh, okay. You're like, well, no, like everyone, Brian, pick me up. <laughs> yeah. Seems like it's not an order. <laughs> I mean, I guess most this. people have 25. <laughs> I mean, on those broad shoulders of we yours. All, we all have 25. I think yeah. 25 is the base. Uh, mm-hmm. I have, I have, uh, I used to have 30. I have 30, because I took the pre-sentiment. Sorry, D&D that. Punishes yeah. little people. Yeah. <laughs> you got small feet. People. I have thirty because I took long live Pathfinder. Little legs. <laughs> okay, I was wrong. Yeah, I should have said that. Sorry. <laughs> what is my initiative? How do you okay. Do Perception. Perception. Oh, Perception. That's right. Perception. Look, I relearn this game every time I, I wish play they it. Oh, there <laughs> right. Perception. Well, especially if you don't play for like two months. <laughs> Let me go get those cards. Bah. Bah. Oh, yeah, get the memes. Bah. Bah. Memes. Plus memes. Memes. What do you say? <laughs> uh, probably. Craig, can you guide me? Can you stand up real quick? Uh, yeah. oh. oh, I really should have sent Jack the Barney uh. meme. <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't well, think I wanna, so. I want to see Jack stand up. I want to see Jack stand up now. This is what I want. Oh, okay. Uh-oh. There we go. How's that? Whole hole. Left? How's that? How's that? <laughs> Sorry? Question, John. Mm-hmm. This oh, no. says activate cast a spell. Does a cantrip cast as, count as a spell? Or um, are you going to have the wand? Yes. On the so, no, to, ac- to activate Great. the wand is, I think it's just like an interact action to cast the spell that's in the wand or something. I, I'm not really 100% sure. Does activate, activate cast a spell? Oh, I, th- I think you would take the cast a spell action. Okay. So it, that, ah, you know, that makes sense. Okay. Um, and you would take sense. however many actions mirror image costs. Okay. Cool. Um, I believe just this is how that would work. Oh, I see what you're I saying. I was Drake. reading that wrong. Yeah. yeah how did they? It looks like it's off to the left of. But it's not. He's like centered. That's weird. <coughs> oh, you um, need my initiative too, huh? Mm-hmm. I think I'm going to use my uh, coin. Twenty-seven. Hold hold on just a sec. You you're yep. vibing. Um. Okay. That's. Uh, twenty-seven beer bot. Yeah, that's sir. crazy. Pathfinder um, numbers. Pathfinder numbers. Mm-hmm. Oh, now you're small, Jack. That's okay. Um, <laughs> I'll come back. I promise. <laughs> 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 hey, who wants to control Briya? Because uh, I don't want to. I'll do it. Beer bot. All right. I need a stat block, though. I, I'll send it to you now. So we... Don't be confused by the name. Uh, just, just roll with it. It's a goblin ogre gotcha. lord. Uh, it's actually an ogre hurler, but. Oh. So funny. <laughs> <laughs> he looks very funny. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, it's your, just head, your eyes. It's just your head right <laughs> above the uh, the thing that says uh, your name. That's me. I'm Jack. What's funny is I just realized, looking through the spells I have now, um, the only uh, damaging spell I have is Telekinetic Projectile. Oh my god, nice. <laughs> That's the only thing I have. More, more buffs and banes. Uh, so Beerbot, I, I mean, is definitely going first with a 27. Do I need to roll uh, her initiative? Yeah. Yes. Beerbot, gonna go shower now. <laughs> play, play with these, my god. It's a ball of yarn, a teddy bear, and a yo-yo emoji. <laughs> But it's it's so funny that it's a message. Right, yeah, no, it is a funny. It's your meme. Just it's a funny. Emoji. It is a funny. Um, uh, anyone roll lower than 27? Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay, oh, yes. I bet everybody rolled well, 20, lower than 27. Um, uh, what? Yeah. Rhea rolled a 22. 22? Okay. Uh, what would you roll? Uh, 20. 20? 15. 15. I rolled an 8. <laughs> I, rolled a 16. I rolled a 6. Um, and then Briar rolled a <laughs> 22. Azarifus? 16. Oh, very close to me. Mm-hmm. Stick? 18. 18. You fuckers. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. I to talk All right. To um, Dirty boy. 20. 30, 20? You got it. I'm trying to find a meme. Pathfinder numbers. Yeah. Did you get Dirty 20? Yeah. All right. Um, it's a real so. filthy fucking 
<laughs> real estate. Yeah, real so fast next up is, is uh, <laughs> Severin. It's someone that car salesman up. slaps Kuko. Run. Run. And then next is Roy. Roy. Mary Margaret churns butter real slow with her ankles out. Jebediah. Mary's about to catch this blessing. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> That's a uh, Severin and a uh, Zarephus love night. Mm -hmm. um, next know. is Stick. Hello. Which, say, uh, call it the gift of flame. If you're ever sad, just remember the world is 4.543 billion years old, and you somehow managed to exist at the same time as spicy potato soft talk. <laughs> <laughs> this is personalized. This is personalized content. This is the algorithm mm -hmm. at work. I do love that damn taco. It's I feel like Stick great. is telling himself. You're always on that damn taco. Zarephus. <laughs> I was like, what the? Oh, whoa! <laughs> it's German. Bro's got a dumpy. <laughs> Show Colton again? Show Colton again. I saw it. <laughs> Show, Show Colton again. <laughs> Show Colton again. Show Colton again. Show Colton again. Show Colton again. Show Alright, man, I gotta stare at that for the rest of this combat. Let's wrap this up quick, you guys. <laughs> Last but certainly not least, Rena. Um, D and D, but make it by. I swing both ways violently with an axe. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Oh jeez, I can't play that game of like I'll give whoever makes me laugh five. Because every time, because I laugh every time. They're all very funny. Um, all right. So it's technically yes. I guess, but I don't want to give you all plus five. Yeah, it's like saying it just all shifts over just by uh, five. And then, and then he also shifts else. all the Jack enemies to his own meme also, and all the enemies shift. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Um, I should yeah make a meme for each enemy. Stupidest thing ever. So everyone just every, everyone just gets just pumped up by five. <laughs> Jack looks at his own meme no, and yeah, laughs. No, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, that's funny. Um, so top of the round. Uh, top of the round is Beerbot. Okay. Uh, <coughs> I'm remember how to play this. As these orcs okay. shout back in Goblin. Does anybody speak Goblin? Do I speak uh, Goblin? Speak Roy. I believe Roy I believe Roy does. speaks I Goblin. Speak I feel goblin? like nobody else does. Look, I don't even know where my languages are. Do I speak? I Do I speak? You speak. You speak. speak. Can no. I speak good? Um, it's, it's under <laughs> details. Uh, I have well. no languages to look at. Yeah, I know. Me, me too, so <laughs> I don't think I, I don't even speak what? common. Oh, I totally speak goblin. You do? Uh, no. <laughs> I just haven't chose my languages. Oh. Where do you are speak goblin now? I feel like... You can if you want. I feel like this happened because my character sheet reset goblin. very early goblin? on. Okay. Anyone well, who speaks and goblin... Orcish. Uh, hey. Anyone too. who speaks goblin would know that these orcs are calling back in Goblin, uh, the Storm Tower 6 is coming. And then okay. Roy will just say as a free action in Goblin, the fucking yeah we are. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, Your body, it's your turn. Uh, my movement is 30. Five, five, 10, 15, 20. Did you ever figure out what your crit spit specializations were? I did. Crit spits? Oh, I'll, I'll look it up for you. It's, it's, it's up. okay. I, I'm not raging this turn, so I can sure. look it up after. Okay. Sounds good. Uh, yeah, I will. Oh my god. What? Uh, In the chat. Azarephus was goblin not too long ago. <laughs> <laughs> I, mind, I, will I don't think he was doing much speaking. But <laughs> so, <laughs> so funnily enough, I, I do speak goblin. Oh, sweet. So, right, and you would also know that there, there's, there's no way I couldn't react to that. <laughs> I'm, uh, I, I will rage, actually. Uh -huh. <laughs> I will okay, rage. And then as, as, <laughs> as, as uh, Roy says that, it kind of makes it obvious. And he kind of looks over to uh, to uh, Bria, and then back at the orcs, and he just points. And as he charges, he just goes hostiles. <laughs> nice. Understood. And I'll sudden charge. Sweet. To Ooh. get within range here, and uh, so rage was my first action. Then I stride twice and can make an attack with sudden charge. So Ooh. I'm gonna attack this guy. Great. That is yeah, so make an attack awesome. roll. <sighs> Good to have your tank back. Then. Yeah, but really though. <laughs> I mean, you just got so much. You got so much movement. It's great. Is it just the two of them that we know so far? Or do we know so far? More? I think. Um, well, Beerbot would have kind of a view in there, and I'll tell him what he sees after he oh boy. resolves his attack. Oh, what is my bonus? Now? Everything went up. My went up text expert and my shit, and so that's a four <laughs> now. What did you say? <laughs> I think. Oh, to expert. I I thought twenty one. I thought you said something else. Uh, uh, twenty one does hit. Okay. Roll for damage. Uh. Oh, and then I have the striking rune, that's why. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you deal some extra damage. Oh, and then right. it's. So many dice. So. I don't want to rage.
raging, I do that bonus. Okay, so it's five, nine, eleven damage. Twelve, because of the plus one to the item. Sorry, twelve damage. Twelve damage, okay. Yeah. Two. Um, we'll call that Orc Warrior one. I'm gonna check you said, sorry, sure. 12 damage? Yeah, I'm going to check and make sure that my rage damage hasn't gone up either. I don't know if that's a thing that happens. Okay. That orc is bloody. Um, but that's not something mm. I need to necessarily know at this exact moment. Um, it doesn't say that it goes up. Okay, that's fine. Then that, yeah, that's that's Beerbot's turn. Uh, okay. Um, Next up, <coughs> so Beerbot, as you run up, and you do your sudden charge and you clock this uh, orc in the mm -hmm. face. You see inside um, a fire does appear to have broken out behind the bar at, uh, um, at the uh, Crooked Cat. See the coffee maker. <gasps> really, though? Inside are quite a few gnolls. Oh. Oh, wow. I can hear that. Ooh, that's nice. Yeah. Gnolls and shifters. Uh, so, we've got some gnolls. And shifters. Like back here mm -hmm. with bows. Um, there appear to be some like right here. And. Oh boy. Then there appears gnolls. to be um, a, a gnoll in the center here <laughs> that uh, is appears to be like uh, some sort of commanding officer. Uh, there is um, another orc. Sitting right here, um, Jacob. Do you have any more like werewolf minis? Uh, They're not like actually werewolves, but or just anything similar. Um, yeah, I think just, so. I, I meant to look earlier, but I forgot. Thank you. Um, just anything that looks kind of beastly or whatever. Um, as these are shifters, there's a lot of guys here. Um, mm -hmm. uh, oh, actually, the shifters aren't here. They're not here yet. No, not here yet. It's showing my hand a little bit, but um, that's fine. And then um, there's there's no shifters. Mm -hmm. Not at all. Yeah, we're fine. And then, um, as you look, as you um, get there, beer bot, <coughs> you stop, and you as you clock them, and then um, you uh, actually, I'll save that. I'll save that. Never mind. No. Oh, all right. No. Is there someone that I see? No. You just see all of these guys in there, and it looks like they're they're uh, it, they have like. They, it looks like they were like stoking on this fire, but now that they've heard that you guys are coming, they've picked up their weapons and they're getting ready to Gotcha. Um, it looks like, uh, I will say, what you notice is that the gnolls in particular, they don't look like your average Dask goons. These, these ones are wearing better armor, they have better weapons. Hmm. All right. Okay. The other ones, like the orcs, and the, um, the orcs appear to just sort of be like Dask goons. Gotcha. Okay. So the gnolls, gnolls are spooky. Dangerous. The gnolls are a little spooky. All right. Yeah. yeah. A question for you, mm -hmm. uh, for uh, for uh, Bria. She has an ability called hurl cobalt. Yeah, yeah. Um, there are no cobalts to hurl, unfortunately. Cobalt. That's However, does it have to be a cobalt at the event that. Can what? it be a Roy? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, sure. Yes. <laughs> Why you want some extra movement? Oh jeez. I mean, sure. That's funny. I'll allow it. Um, wow. But Roy does take up the thing. I mean, do yeah, to do, hurl Roy at your I own risk, I, I guess. I am going to do that. Um, <laughs> Jordan, you just this made no kind of reaction. Uh, this will do. I just need these two. Okay. Thank you so much. Um, Can you, I guess, I guess, I mean, just move her up to the... Uh, it's not Briah's turn. Oh, it's not? No, it is oh, not. Sorry. It is the Knoll Sergeant's turn. Ooh. Um, the Knoll is uh, going to... <coughs> right, I guess uh, I don't see the other initiatives nope. on there, huh? Uh, right. No, the Knoll... Um, pulls out a, um, uh, or the knoll has a, a, a short bow uh, in its hands, and it is going to uh, fire at you twice. All right. Uh, AC 24. Yep. That is a miss. That is a 26, so that will hit. That will hit. Uh, and it's 1d6 plus 4. Uh, five points of damage, okay. uh, piercing damage as an arrow sticks into you. And um, then. Just the tip? Just the tip. I heard. Just the tip. Got me in the tit. <laughs> oh, I, that, 
that, that, that's different as well. <laughs> oh, I thought, I thought that's I, what you I, said. I, I heard just the tip. Oh. You and tent? you're hearing tent? Just the tent. No, no. I, I, heard, I, I heard what you heard. Okay. Okay. <laughs> but also tent. 10, 15, 20, 20. Just the tent. Okay. Um, it's just going to attempt one more shot at you, Durban. Uh, actually, what it's going to do is it's going to... Um, it's gonna it's gonna move five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, and just move over here. Okay. Um, next up is Brian. Okay. Question. Yes. Are there any entrances on this side? Um. There was a back way, <sighs> but. There is a back way. There's a back door back there. I would say that, that there is also one. There's also one on this side. That's a good question. I didn't draw that in, but um, I don't have markers. But there's one here, and there's one back there. Okay. All right, can the battlefield is changing as uh, we go. Can you move her up? The map's the... updating. Yep. She's going to go ahead and attack. Can she move any further? Huh? Can she move any further? I mean, she can. Do you need to be there? Yeah. All right, just put her on the opposite side of the... Yeah. Thank you. And I think she'll fight the other one, then. So the two of us are taking on the two. Um, with an attack, she's going to use... Uh, we'll say just for the sake of this that she has her fist and she has her spear as well. Perfect. Technically, uh, an ogre is a large creature. Right. But, uh, I, li- I like. I like. The, I like she, the. Fist. She's medium, but you know. Right. Okay, fist I mean, sounds good. Six. Six ten. You, you're yeah. getting near. I'm gonna move your camera. Uh, right uh, Thirty. <laughs> sorry. Thirty uh, hits. Is that a crit? Uh-huh. Yes, it is on the orc. Yeah. <laughs> so, tiny. Right, so remind me how crits work. I roll double um, the die. Roll the die, double the damage. Roll the die, double the damage. Mm-hmm. That's right. The only time you'll Pretty cool. Double the die is for a particular. That's Ecomies. not great, but that's okay. Uh, I mean, it's a crit. Eleven. It's eleven uh, bludgeoning plus grab. Is it the same ogre that you or orc that you hit? No, no it's, it's the other one. It's a different one. Okay. To find yeah. a meme um, it, even though I saw it like a day ago. Okay, so that one, how much you said 11? Uh, 11 plus grab. Okay. And grab is effectively uh, grappled. Got it. Nice. Um, yeah, you're held in place, giving you flat footed and immobilized. Got it. Whew. So he's flat footed and immobilized. <laughs> Anything else on Brian's uh, turn? That's it. <laughs> um, it was two moves, and then the attack, when that attack hits, you can, she automatically grabs. Right okay. so. <laughs> um, next up is <laughs> Sev and Roy. You guys are acting at the same time. Hey, well, I'm just at 100. Uh, <laughs> I checked my heart rate. It's like at 102. Oh, my as God. Soon as, as soon as you calm down. I bet you mine was 120 when, I, when <laughs> we were doing that, that bit. Hey, my heart rate. Right. You know what? I will. Normally, Go ahead. Take your like turn. Like 100. So. What is mine right now? It's not a competition. Huh? <laughs> I said it's not no. a competition. No, it's not good. My, no, we're I know. The Mine's time. the same I, way. I know. We're going the same Where's area. Where's the... Yeah, yeah I know. Stupidly the door's here? Right. Yeah. I have no idea. I was going to ask Jack. Hmm? The door? The door is right back here. So it's like it's th- that space. Yeah. So basically, what this is up here, this is like a like an upper landing. These are the stairs that lead up yeah, there, yeah. Okay. Um, and that's a that's a back door in. It would basically go through the cupboard under the stairs. Say hi to Harry, and then no. um, the um, and then you'd be in the main floor. It's twenty five. Well, my speed is twenty five. We're, uh, we're all, all twenty five. I am yeah. asking you because you're just helping me count. That's it. Yeah. So. And I was back over there, so I've used all three of my movements yeah. to um, just get to there. Yeah. yeah, got it. All right, you get there, open the door, um, and you see as well. The, you see the yeah, the fire. It's, this is a, a little rush of, of heat as you see the fire crackling behind them. What is it? So that's his first uh, free movement. Twenty-five <coughs> is action. One action. Oh, you're chill. Ten, fifteen. Second action. Uh, action number two. Action number two. That's our commander. Yes, but you can't see them because they're currently on the stairs. The stairs are the stairs are solid. You can't see through them. I'm sorry. I was thinking we're going up. No, you're going into the main floor. The main floor is just this area down here with the tables and stuff. Can he see the spell? Yeah, you can see that. We'll shoot at that man. Okay, great. Um, Wow, you're strong. Nope. No. No. Sorry. No. 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 Oh. So that, it, it hit. I this just, is like a passageway under, like underneath this the stair stairs. unit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So imagine that there's the stairs there, and then on the wall underneath the stairs is another exit. Gotcha. Just double checking my. How many balls are there? Four. And you guys the went the wrong way for what I was going to do, but I'm still going to do it, and so you just guys don't get it. Thirty. <laughs> Thirty is a critical hit. 
So wait, even with can their I armor. understand now too, those stairs go down? Those stairs go, these, these stairs, stairs go up. so this is the main floor. Do you, yeah. I, I, it was a while ago, but this is the same, basically yeah. the same map that got we it, used when it. you guys first fought in the Crooked mm -hmm, Cat, mm -hmm. but I've added a little more street here. Cool. Um, so these stairs, they go, go up the this way, yeah. this is a landing, and then you can access Perfect. this entire upper area. Oh too. Yeah. Jesus oh, geez, Christ. sorry, so potato soft taco. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, it's gonna be Stick's new name. Potato soft, soft taco? taco? Spicy potato soft taco, yeah. Stick is a little spicy. Yep. Sorry. Um, I have just forgotten how kites work, so. Uh, sorry. You just. It's, yeah. yeah. Um, it's because. It's, it's because you have fatal. So oh, much. Yeah. yeah. Um, <coughs> I'm right. Wow. Um, that's types two. <coughs> Uh, 47 damage. Oh my god. Um, that null is dead. Ooh. What did you, how much damage did you just do? 47. 47? Yeah. Quit. Mm -hmm. I think that's the most damage anybody's ever done on something. Right, well, I'm not sure. I'm it's a like, lot. I don't know I, either. I, I've, done, I, I, I've done close that's to crazy. that. That's crazy. I don't know which one. I don't know, I don't know which one the most is, but that is a lot. That, that null got eviscerated. <laughs> yeah, that null got blasted. And then I started blasting, so that was free movement, movement, Shoot, <coughs> third action, um, reload. Got it. Roy? Uh, Roy already went, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Um, meanwhile, oh, you could what I was going to tell you before, Beerbot, but it was more advantageous for me to tell you now. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> because you're not looking in the direction that this thing is at. Um, I need Beerbot, Briah, Azarephus, Renna, and Stick mm. um, to oh. tell me what oh. your, what are your will DCs? So it's 10 plus your will save. 20. 21. 21. 21. Oh, it's DC. My will DC, so it's 10, 10 plus, plus my your will. will. Uh, so By the way, zero, actually, five, that'll be, two, I was literally about to say, um, 19. I think Puck is probably not in the arm right now. So Puck is out? Puck is out right now. Puck What's is Puck's? Puck is, free. Puck, Puck is probably like Puck is literally Puck fly? like flying oh, next to sure. like, like <laughs> running for sure. in the air. For sure. um, it's <laughs> also 21. 21, got it. Okay, so it's a 21, 21, 19. 19, Briah's 20. is 18. 20, 18, and then what's yours? 21. 21? Puck is on a Ford Bronco Yo. going down the highway. <laughs> okay. You all hear echoing through the alleyway right behind uh -oh. your body. Uh -oh. And it's loud enough that you three can hear it from where you're standing. Oh, is this snorting and this clomping of hooves uh -oh. as um, you are all uh, stricken with terror as you realize there's a minotaur right behind the beer bot. Oh, fuck. Um, nice. All of you are demoralized. I, oh, you I all see. failed. A, you Ooh, all failed the, the same. So, so uh, you demoralized. So you take. Um, you are you are frightened one, which means that. Uh, Let's see. Uh, you take a minus two status penalty to perception and skill checks. You can't use actions with the concentrate trait unless they're related to. Oh, sorry, that's fascinated. I'm sorry. <laughs> Frightened is uh, take a status penalty equal to the value to all checks and DCs. Okay. At the end of your turn, the value decreases by one. So you have a minus one. To uh, you have a minus one to pretty much everything. everything. Um, Including attack rolls, or it yeah. says Was it this says a magic checks thing? and no, this is a this gotcha. is just an ability that minotaurs have. Gotcha. Um, it's called a uh, hunted fear. Mm. Okay, so and it's it just like says checks and uh, it says checks and checks and balances. And saves, it says checks and DCs. Oh, no, so, okay. not so I don't know so if attacks apply, but your no, DCs. Do I don't think it like is. Spells. And it's like right into this alley. Yep, and okay. then okay. Um, it's standing behind. Is there like? Is, do you want to put him there? Do we know he's? Oh there yeah, now? no, I'm going to. Okay, cool. Um, hey. Then uh, <laughs> I am going buddy? to. So that's his first action. Then for his second action, he's going to use his powerful charge. Uh -oh. As the Minotaur strikes right twice, the then makes a horn strike. Oh, I can hear um, the he's going right into you, sound. Beerbot. As, oh, as, you all, as you all recognize, Car Bloodhorn, one of the Dask Lieutenants that you met the other day, uh -oh. slams into Beerbot. Uh -oh. uh -oh. uh, so, this is a horn attack. Horn attack. Um, that is a 24 to hit. Meets it, beats it. Okay. Um, really? Actually, does my AC go down by two? Because my AC is technically a DC. We're okay. Yeah. Uh, Maybe. That? I don't know. Let's it's keep it at 24 for now. That's what a little complicated for me. Huh? Um, it, it's what it is. <laughs> oh. Over the desk, Lieutenant? No. Cool. Thank you. Yeah. Um, beer bot. Oh, yeah. You We're take. Smart. 
uh, 21 points of damage as Car Blood Orc, bam, just rams his head right into your back. You kind of, uh, it takes everything in you not to just get bowled over by this strike. Um, uh, as, as this Minotaur is standing right behind you. Um, that's all of his actions that he can do. Stick, it is your turn. So it's 68. Um, is Stick stuck? Is Stick stuck? Yeah. Yep. Um, you said some of our buddies have uh, perished, right? Yeah, there's some dead oh. friends around. Um, how many and where? Um, nice. That's a good question. Roll 1d4. Recycling. Four. Oh, hey. Sweet. Reduce, there's, reuse. there's four. Reduce, reuse. Um, reduce, reduce, reduce. I'll leave it up to you to get the minis for it. But. Yeah. Um, it's, I believe I can only I love this do it. It's, it's really cool. Mm-hmm. Um, hmm. What do you guys think this guy's sorry. so say it is? Probably <laughs> pretty good. Um, I'm just gonna summon a zombie. Um, okay. And then just one. Yeah, I, I should have. I can only summon one at a time. Oh, it's just gotcha. the level that I can summon gets better. Oh. Yeah. Um, so you just summon a, a regular zombie. Yes, I think so. Okay. Um, you're not helping. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I get told. Um, <laughs> let's see. Okay, now I have a stat block. Let me. Great. Um, so is there maybe like one like right here? Sure. Oh, um, let me get us. Let me get. Cool. Us. Cool. Cool. Oh, we just like grab the undead over it, you know? drawer. Oh, all right. <laughs> yeah, just zombies. <laughs> zombie. Zombie. Living dead girl. All <laughs> <laughs> um, somebody should cast fly, and then we'll all go. Yeah, just casually. Can you take <laughs> me higher? <laughs> Jordan, nobody knows. Nobody uh, here understands how much Jordan and I have polluted our group chat. <laughs> With every with everybody with just Creed, <laughs> I so intentionally ignore, ignore it. And yep. I'm so glad we've moved. Like the the meme has evolved from higher to that other song. Oh yeah, 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 <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. Like, well, like I need to stand up or else my rights are going to be taken away from me. Oh, there we were. Yeah, it was, yeah. <laughs> we already did it. Okay, you're sitting uh, down. I'm going to be standing up and sitting down. So that's fine. That's nice fine. You're just sitting more than you're standing, so Got it's it. okay. We'll get you a booster seat. Hey, why don't you skip? You just really got it. Okay. Um, <laughs> it is now the Knolls' turns. Um, the Knolls. Mm-hmm. I mean, that Knoll saw what he did to his <laughs> friend. No, he um, didn't. He's like, oh, he's like, fuck, fuck I gotta yeah. get the fuck out of here. Yeah, I think that's the right um, answer. Just blood splattered on this uh, other. Maybe knoll. on him. Well, that's why I'm saying it's in the way. Uh, <laughs> the problem, yeah, it's it's. It's a Knoll though, so it's more. Uh, yeah. Dust and petrification. As um, oh, true. Yeah. He is going to. Yeah. Uh, he's gonna he probably would have liked the blood, but dust mm, probably goes. Sorry, what? Uh, does a twenty hit your AC? No. Okay, he misses that shot. Um, and he is going <coughs> to. Um, he's going to use two actions mm. to run upstairs. Um, yeah. Uh, so uh, did you move? Just move. Uh, move him guy? fifty feet to get up. The I stairs. did. Uh, yeah. I did a quick check. Mm-hmm. Um, anytime you roll a dice, it is considered a check, and oh, your a- and your mm-hmm. AC is a DC. So you basically it. have a minus two to everything Got it. right now. Understood. Mm-hmm. Understood. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, he's going to stand there. Sorry, he's going to there and end his turn. Yes. The other two gnolls. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, There's three gnolls. Oh, you, well, the one with the axe is the sergeant, and the sergeant already went. Got it. Um, so these two. So those two still have to go, yes. Um, move them out onto the street. Um, have one uh, flank with... Um, What's their speed? 50? Uh, their speed is 25. Um, have them uh, like sort of uh, get on the sides of Briah and um, and Beerbot. Yep. yep, right there. Okay. Perfect. After that um, turn, I'm good. So How many moves did they Was that just one move to get I think it's there? two. Two moves? Okay. Yeah. That's fine. Because of the diagonals. Yeah. Or they had to go through a window. 25, 30. Yeah, it's exactly 30 for both of them Got it. to get there. That's fine. Or they That's had good. To, they had the Kool-Aid man through the door. Then uh, they're both going to make battle axe attacks against uh, Beerbot, one against Beerbot, and one against Briah. Mm-hmm. So Beerbot, really cool. that is a 22 to hit you. Misses. Yep. Okay, and then for Briah, that is a uh, 19. 
I think that misses. God, you guys are fucking surrounded right now. No, that yeah. hits her. Mm-hmm. All right, Briah <laughs> takes two. Uh, five <laughs> points of slashing damage. I rolled kind of low. Okay. <laughs> it looks like. Gotcha. I'm tracking her. No, no, no. You're good. I got gotcha. you. All right. Uh, oh, I've got it. If uh, what? I'm tracking her health. No, I know. Too, so. Okay. I'm, I got you. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Stick, did you figure yeah, out? Yeah, I'm good. Doing? Okay, sweet. Um, uh, some of my zombie. That's my three my three things. And then he's gonna he's gonna hit this Stone guy three timer. times. Hit hit him three times? Yes. Okay. Can he hit him from all the way over there? Uh he's a zombie brute. He has a re- oh, reach Oh, he's a big boy. Oh. Yes. He goes, got it, got it. I can make bigger boys now. That's sweet. The yes. zombie brutes are what he's you guys like, fought in like against fun. the emerald claw in uh Ooh. in the garden. I'm learning. Hell yeah. Yeah. No. Oh. <laughs> Tell your grandma That's a crit. It off. That's a crit? Yeah. yeah. Oh nice. Um, right. That I know a crit doesn't mean it's automatic. Is it? Is it a natural twenty? Yes. Uh, then that's a crit. Okay. It, cool, cool, cool. It's a crit. Um, it what it does is it moves your success up. By your one. success right. up. By yeah, because you could technically still fail, I guess, with a yes. crit, uh, with a crit, but yeah. and that turned into a, it's not an automatic a, success, but yeah. it is a degree a, of a success. D- degree. Of the other success. one's a uh, a dirty twenty, and then a twelve. Uh, those last two will miss. Okay. Jesus. <laughs> He's a beefy boy. He is a beefy boy. Got a big AC. That's good, that's good. Uh, Zarephus, you're on deck, or if you want to start doing your zone, Rena, then, uh, oh, then you're... Sure. My three actions. Um, I'm going to uh, stride, Did and then I'm going to... Did skip do- Roy? Didn't you move? No, you moved up. He was seven, didn't you? Oh, oh, it's okay. still the same Renekal. Yeah, so yeah. yeah, we, yeah, we, yeah, we, yeah. yeah. we, we haven't had our turn like, Jesus Christ. Um, it's uh, just just long stride, and then I'm going to do my... people. Yes. My focus spell, my dimensional assault. So uh, what that lets me, Ooh. so 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, this lets me go 10 feet. So oh. Azarephus runs forward, and then he literally like leaps into like a cloud of like smoke, oh. and then pff, appears here teleporting. Oh. He gets an attack, and then um, I'm going to use my last action to attack as well. Got it. Um, you so. with that null. Sorry? What? Not that null. The null that's, which one, where, where, who are you I'm attacking, attacking this null right yeah. here. Um, so just two 14. melee attacks. Damage. Yeah. Nothing fancy, but next turn I can do, I can be more fancy. Mm. Um, How fancy? Mm, mm, mm. Somewhat. Um, Eighteen. Decently fancy. Uh, against the null, mm-hmm. we'll miss. Ooh, What's no. your roll? Uh, Fourteen. You said? Fourteen. Yeah. Got it. Bludgeoning then what's if it the matters modifier at all? on the second um, one? Oh, plus three. It doesn't, but that's good to know. Okay. <laughs> Twenty-one. Twenty-one will hit. Okay, that's not a whole lot of damage, but it's okay. okay. Uh, <laughs> Excuse me. It's, uh, Jesus. It's five damage. Five damage to the null? Five slashing damage, yes. Okay. All right. Two, we'll call that one. Uh, so null one got vaporized. Um, <laughs> null two will be the one that uh, Azarephus is probably going to vaporize, or Severin's going to vaporize next. And then <laughs> null three will be by Beerbot, and null four will be by Brian. Sure. So you said five? Yeah, that's okay. it. Okay, sounds good. Um, Rena? Okay. Move me 25 feet forwards. Yep, right there, exactly. And then I am going to cast um, Infectious Enthusiasm. Okay, who are you targeting? Well, with so that? it targets yeah, what does that my. Do? It, well, okay, I'll just read it. Yeah. Um, with Enchanted Gusca, in, blah, 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 Gusto, you encourage yourself to get things done and share your motivation with your allies. You gain a plus one status bonus to your choice of attack rolls, will saves, or charisma based skill checks. I'm going to say attack rolls. Sweet. Um, during the spell's duration, um, an ally who observed you casting the spell and was within 30 feet when you did so can take a single action, which has a concentration trait, to gain the same bonus you chose until the start of its oh, next turn. Oh, very cool. Ooh. How long does that last? It's, it's one round. It's one round. So it'll last until when Rena's does next the, turn. When does the, uh, when does the frighten end? Uh, at the start of your next turn. So at the start of my turn, it goes away? Yeah, at the start of your next turn, you okay. won't be frightened. So anymore. you, okay. you, oh, sorry, so you go up two, your, technically. At the end of, of your end. turn. So at the, it'll be at the end of your turn, sorry. So what, is the tur- what does this do? So you're you're no longer frightened. Oh. So um, you're no longer frightened, because your turn mm-hmm. ended. Question. Mm-hmm. Yes. Is the Null's AC 21? Yeah. I missed then. I oh, no, the Null's AC is not 21, it's 20. Oh, then I still hit Yeah, it. sorry. Yeah. I forgot to add my No, 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 you're good. It's 20. what do we get? You can take us an action during your turn, mm-hmm. with the concentrate, whatever, to 
gain the same effect that I gave myself. Which is a plus, which is a one, plus to one to attack, attack rolls. rolls. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, yeah. Can my zombie take that? Um, I mean, technically, I can if, if the zombie was within 30 feet of Renna, oh, I don't know if zombies can like, concentrate, that's a good question. Oh yeah, so it's only yes. it has because, yeah. if, you're frightened, so cool. if you're frightened, you can't concentrate, Hang but you're no longer frightened, so. It's a cantrip. That's very neat. What is that called? Infectious enthusiasm. No, that's awesome. That's so perfect. that's why I, I stuck like myself it. in the Let's middle, go, too. Woo! I stuck myself in the middle so then everyone can... That's so good. Okay. Love that. That's why you guys ran running away was like, oh, well. It doesn't <laughs> say zombies. zombies can't concentrate. They just they can't use reactions. Well, huh? I would rather have taken right. that <laughs> that's right. zombie yes. like, that yeah. zombie's very common. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> 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 the zombie's like, yeah. He's thinking real hard. Yeah, thinking <laughs> real hard. <laughs> the zombie's really slow, but he can be like... Wait. That's how he attacks. Yeah. Um, and that is all through mine. Oh, yeah. Concentrated? yeah, he has to concentrate really hard on his fist. Mm -hmm. <laughs> all right. Oh, I closed my yes. freaking zombie spell. I'm still laughing about Amaro's melee attack. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Step out of your, of your gun and hey, spell damage. Yeah, I did a damage. <laughs> One damage. Uh, charging from behind car um, are three shifters. Three shifters that appear to have sh have already shifted and have grown long tusks out of their maws uh -oh. as they are going to charge uh, a Xerophis. Fuck. They're going to charge, they're oh, gonna charge a we got lots of guys. zombie. We got lots of guys. And this is uh, right, they're also going to charge... Um, well, it's getting kind of crowded over here. They're going to charge yeah. their guys. Or charge Brian, actually. How many? Uh, how much oh, no. movement did they have to use to get there? Two strides. Okay. okay. It's part of. It's part of their. It's part of their. Um, it's one of their time. abilities. Um, for this stat block I'm using is um, <laughs> you can. Uh, it's spend two. It's uh, the, the the it strides twice and Strategy. then makes a melee strike, and as long as they move uh, at least twenty oh. feet, which they did. Yeah. Um, I know that time. ability. I yeah, have. It's a little bit like sudden charge. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, so some tusk attacks. Um, so beer, beer bomb, or sorry, you're not getting attacked. Beer bomb. Azarephus, I'm going to roll against you first. Go ahead. Uh, that is a 20. No. Okay. Try again. Because of Rana, that would hit. But you cast that spell, so my AC went back up to 21. No, your thing just... You, you just lost your fright and you because you're trying to so. <laughs> but yeah. I, I, like, so. I like that other idea better, though. Sure. Um, but sticks, you're wrong. Stick, your zombies <laughs> getting attacked. No, um, you can shoot better is what it is. That is a 27. Uh, well, yeah, that'll do. Is it a crit? That, that, it's 10 plus, right? 10 plus. Yeah. Yes, it's okay. a crit. It's a critical hit. Yeah, it's zombie, zombie, no. Though. He's just a zombie. Come on, zombie. Zombie, ah. no. zombie has, like, triple my hit points. <laughs> <laughs> it's not triple. It, it's, it's, du it's double, not triple. But. Oh, 20? Um, 14 Hush. points of, of uh, piercing damage from the tusk. Alrighty. And then Briya. Um, that is, oh, that's a 30 against that Briya. That also crit her. Ow! Brian's 20 saying, points wow. of piercing damage to Briah. Wow. It's like you took that personally. Um, yeah. Like you got hurt. Yeah. As uh, these three shifters I'm have uh, <laughs> I'm followed their <laughs> followed their commander in a frenzy. Um, huh. It is now the orcs' turns. I mean, those two she's orcs. Gonna, <laughs> she's gonna die. They're, they're getting clapped on right now. Um, <laughs> <laughs> the orcs. Um, like, hold the door. I mean, the one of the orcs is gonna. Um, uh, yeah, is gonna just throw. Uh, I don't know. Two javel, or actually, you can't. I don't know. I don't even think he can throw back there. I think he'll he'll move. He'll shift back here. 10, 15, 20, 25. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> and, hello. And, um, and he's gonna first throw a javelin at Sev. Uh -huh. uh -oh. um, I don't like damage. That is a nineteen. No. Okay. He misses. <laughs> no. He'll throw another javelin. <laughs> Absolutely not. That is not a nineteen. So no. Actually, never mind. It is a nineteen. No. Okay. Yeah. He just chucks two javelins, and you just watch them go by. Um, and then the other two orcs. Um, I mean, they're just gonna attack Beerbot and Briah uh, at this point with uh, three neck splitter attacks. Huh. Oh, what? Uh, it's a thing they have. It's called an, or an orc attack. neck splitter. It's pretty dope. Okay. Um, it's like in Roadhouse where Patrick Swayze just like rips <laughs> people's throats out. Uh -huh. That's pretty it's a great cool. move. Uh, so Beerbot will do the attack against you first. 17 probably misses. Um, let's see. Second it. attack Maybe gains a circumstance bonus. I don't, I don't know. Damn. Ladies Watching have second to the car. I don't think I can... Um, 15's probably going to miss you as well. Chainsaw Man? Yeah, all three miss you against you. And then against Briah. Which one? You watch Chainsaw Man? Yeah. Oh, 16 yeah. probably yes. misses. Uh, second one, Five miss. Minutes. Third one, uh, de definitely a miss. Uh, so you, <laughs> these poor orcs, they're not effective at all. Um, as, uh, as as they're doing their best, but uh, 
just cannot hit you guys. Um, we are back to the top of initiative to you, Beerbot. Okay. Round Kill two him, begin. Ding, ding. I'm going to <laughs> use uh, use swipe, which is my fourth level feature. It lets me make an attack against two creatures that are within five feet of me. Very nice. Uh, nice. I make one attack at the normal circumstance. It counts as two attacks, but it's it's it a sing uses, it's a single attack. It's a single attack, or, oh, and, and I don't take the minus five. Oh, mm. sweet. So, so it basically lets me attack two targets. With for a single die action? Roll. Yeah. Nice. Uh, it's two actions. Oh. But I don't take the minus. Oh, you don't take the multiple ah. attack. Exactly. Penalty. That's exactly. very nice. Um, and uh, Who are you targeting? the you chaff really needs to die, so I think these orcs are going to hopefully be the done. The chaff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure, target the orcs. Uh, I agree, though. You kind of oh, just clear cool. out your surroundings. Be a 23. De definitely hits both of them. Okay. And honestly, you might, you might kill him with this. <laughs> Not going to lie. Okay, good. These 13, boys aren't very beefy. 13 plus 6, 19 damage. Uh, to both, both of them? Yeah. Yeah, they're both dead. You, nice. you just sweep your arm across and talk, talk, talk just crack their skull. Talk, talk about uh, next splitters. Yeah, for real. Yeah. <laughs> okay. They're gone. Off. They're gone. Get rid of them. I don't know which one's in. Uh, uh, the, the two by the door. The two in the front at the door. Yeah, those nice. ones. Take them. Thank you nice. so much. Okay. Uh, and then I do have a third attack. So this, <laughs> I do have a third attack. This third attack does take the uh, attack penalty, but it takes the penalty as if I've already made two attacks. two attacks. Oh, I see. So you get the full penalty. Exactly. Understood. So was a full penalty minus ten. Minus ten. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to attack uh, one of the gnolls. Got it. That's my the, best. Probably the one right next to you. The one that right next to me. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that'll still be even with all the negatives. Uh, an eighteen. Uh, that'll miss. Gonna hit. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. No, you're fine. Moles have um, a have a twenty AC. Okay. And now Briar. We're in that no, special now, uh, now it is, is uh, now turn. it is the Null yeah. Sergeant's turn. That's right. That um, has got to go. I'm trying. The you're, you're good. You're good. You blew one of them up. Let's see. What's the sergeant gonna do? Um. The sergeant will oh, that's cool. burn. Minotaur scares me. Yeah, Why are you so frightened? Uh, the sergeant's gonna. The sergeant doesn't quite have an angle, so the sergeant's gonna. Um, let's see. So yeah, sergeant's gonna stride. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. Step back into view with the. Can you? Calm down, please. <laughs> Thank you. Um, step back into view with the short bow, and uh, he's going to um, he's going to shoot another shot at you, Beerbot. Um, two shots, to be exact, with the with the composite short bow. Nice. He's back up to twenty-four. Uh, I rolled a thirty-two with a natural twenty. Ooh, that's so that'll be a critical hit. Yes. <laughs> um. <laughs> okay, that's funny. Um. <laughs> Plus this. Okay. Um, you take 13 points of piercing damage. Okay. Mm -hmm. Second attack. Um, will miss. That is only a uh, that is only a 17. That will miss. So uh, you got one crit on you, um, and then the 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 other one miss, and the sergeant ends his turn. Uh, Briya, then seven Royer on deck. Twenty-five. Uh, thirty. Thirty-five. Forty-five. Nice. I don't know if these guys have fucking. Uh, what is it? The disengage attack. What that's called? An opportunity attack. Yeah. There's only one way to find out. To find out. Uh, at least the little bit I know. All right, so there's <laughs> I, I don't think she would either, yeah. unless she was in like grave danger. But <laughs> not, not yet. <laughs> well, Next turn, maybe. Okay, gotcha. All right. Uh, it. You said that guy's the Null Sergeant. Does he seem like he's the guy in charge, or does um, it the Minotaur's the guy in charge? You get the sense that the Minotaur seems to be Carb seems to be the one leading this raid. Okay. Um, but uh, the the Null is definitely an officer within this group. So I mean, the gnolls seem to look to 
um, this sergeant to take their commands. All right, let's try something. Uh, no, that that one Noel's got to go. All right, the Noel next to her is getting three attacks. Got it. Whew. What are you using? Fist. Uh, y yes. <laughs> Brian just bam, bam. <laughs> so sick. Uh, first one would be uh, twenty-seven hit, and then the second one takes a minus five, correct? Yes. Uh, um, well, it, it would say on the on the stat, I think. Because it'll, oh, it'll show like. Oh, I see. It'll show like. that's cool. It'll show like that, and then it'll so show the, the next, next increment, one, and then it'll so show the next the increment. The second attack would be a 23. Hits. No, a 25, sorry. It still hits. And then third attack. <laughs> an 8. Okay, okay, yeah, that'll miss. But the first two hit. Uh, so it's. Uh. 31 bludgeoning. Oh round. my god! That Noel is dead! Okay. <laughs> that Noel is dead. fucking gone. That's what the yeah, that Noel just got just got its rib cage shattered. That's awesome. Um, as Briya just literally tears into him. Whew. Um she is uh she she's <laughs> she's a little angry now. Um it is uh seven Roy's turn. I was I was considering doing a five foot step and going for the sergeant, but Roy I not to. runs into the room, mm -hmm. pulls two grenades from his chest, no. and he goes bah, and throws them at this <laughs> Very guy. Glad Got it. Nice, nice. Um, well, uh, which grenades are you using? I am using um, alchemist fire. No, um, or fire. <laughs> well, can't yeah, get much moderate. Worse, right? You know what? It's already had fire. Exactly. Yeah, it can't get much worse. Fire. Um, yeah, it can. Oh, oh I'm no. gonna. Hi. Can we use our hero points? You can. Well, you you guys you guys have inspiration coins now, so just you can. It's not I, 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 I didn't put them out. Yeah. But yeah. There you go. Coin figuratively flipped. Okay, that's a. Uh, I usually use a hero point thing to hits. mark it. Do you get your coin back if you get crit? Yes. You get your coin back. Twenty-two, and I get my coin back. No, I, mean, I was okay. talking to Colton. And a um, twice. A dirty twenty. Both hit. Okay. You're going for that one orc. Uh, yes. Understood. Yes, yeah, so both of those hit. I would like to do math that fast sometimes. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Okay. 17 initial fire damage. Okay. And then another 8 splash fire damage. Ooh. So 25. And then there will be... Um, a total of six persistent fire damage. Uh, that's cool. He's actually dead. <laughs> you, killed him. you killed him. The the, persist the splash damage got him. Cool. Nice. Uh, as that orc just falls to the ground in a burning heap. I was permanently waiting to see. That is 40 feet. Oh. <laughs> yes. Um, uh -huh. There you go. So two turns. Um, two actions to stride. Yes. Got it. Touch of corruption. Okay. Oh, uh, you want to tell everyone about your new Aberrant melting. Dragon Mark spell? Uh -oh. I'm going to try. Uh, one, th one thing. It's a DC uh, 22. Uh, uh, what sort of save? A fortitude. Fortitude. Mm -hmm. You got it. Um, it's just come up behind basic. the sky. It's the Sarge yeah. Um, touch of corruption is. Good question. Where is it? You said a fortitude. Uh -huh. Yep. That is a nineteen. Um, is it? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. She's okay. A, she, she, she's it's a twenty. Uh, oh jeez. So yeah, nineteen. It's just okay. Yeah. Right so it's a failure. Sorry. I was takes full damage. Hello. Oh. Um. I still don't know. White, what it might look like, um, but essentially, Sev sheathes his sword, reaches out with his prosthetic, and mm -hmm. um, that same red and black starts um, coursing through. Mm -hmm. uh, what is he, an orc? Um, That's a gnoll. A gnoll. That's cool. Um, you know, it's almost like petrification mm. in a sense. That's awesome. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and it's. Uh, you infuse target with negative energy. If the target is living, it deals 3d6 it negative, negative damage. On a failed save, damage. target mm -hmm. takes a negative, or sorry, a minus two status penalty to AC for one round. Okay, understood. So, yeah. Go ahead and roll that damage. Yeah. Um, is that uh, a, a baby Marcy? I heard? Yeah. yeah. Just getting ready for bed. Um, there's a baby. It's just nine damage. Nine? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh. But also a minus two to AC mm -hmm. for a round. Yep. So nine brings it down to, okay, and uh, oh no, that's not how that works. 
Uh, there we go. <laughs> Sorry, I just forgot how math works. And I think Sam would say Same. to the Knoll, he'd be like, you don't stand down, it'll get worse. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> um. Sorry, I just need to check one thing real quick. Um, make a five, a DC five flat check for me. For what? Aberrant feedback. Yeah, I was gonna say. I need to I've do been that. forgetting to do it these last few Seven. times. Seven. It's okay. okay. I've been rolling. No, you're good. <laughs> I, I trust you. I just forget to ask for it. Yeah. Okay. Um, you, you can feel your mark, the the surge of power, that pain coming through mm -hmm. you. Um, you can sense that you're going to have another nightmare tonight. Um, oh, but yeah. you don't feel drained, at yeah. the very least. So there's that. Um, it is now uh, Car Bloodhorn's turn. Um, um, uh, Car looks at you, Mirabot, and says, Nice trick. I can do it, too. As he's going to do his axe swipe against you and Briar. Um, so that's... Uh, Two attacks against, or that's one attack against each of you, with his I great axe. So good. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, that's a natural one. Ooh, um, damn, so he brags damn. and then he misses, <laughs> um, pretty spectacularly. Um, as uh, it just sort of like he hits you and it just like the axe just sort of like scrapes Bounces off your off. armor and just completely <laughs> misses Brya. <laughs> I imagine it's he swings and he brings up his shield, and and he's like. Covering my left flank. Oh, there you go. That's it. That's it. You cover the left. That's it. That's exactly it. Oh my god. He's on the left. Wow. Are you not Get out of me here. Mara doesn't go on your left. Yeah. Wow. Oh wow. Um. Then um. He's not happy about that. Um. He's gonna make um. He's gonna make one more great X attack against you. Good luck. Does he um, also take the cool penalties? That'd be kind of nice. Oh, yes, he does. Oh, he does. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Just make sure there was a rule. He's, um, he's thingy at you. 22. Fuck, almost. That misses. No, it's okay. Just Whoa. barely misses again. Um, stick. Come on, stick. Stick. Oh, stick. You always stick. manage to stick. get out of the stick. get out of the firing zone, don't you? Yeah, yeah. That zombie needs to not be in the firing zone, though. If you can. Or have it that. will be in the firing. Am, am I in the firing zone? Well, if Hi it's either you or a zombie, <laughs> it's a sacrifice that he's willing to take. <laughs> so, if I want to save the zombie, then you are. <laughs> the zombie has fifty-six hit points. The zombie oh, has more the zombie, health than I do. The zombie right will be fine. Yeah. The zombie can be extra crispy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> these these two are, Put some are my allies, on right? It, you know. It's a uh, yeah. Yes. yeah it's, those um, are, those that's Briya and uh, Beerbot. Okay. Mm -hmm. Put some and the Zerfus is in oh, there yeah, too. Oh yeah, I, I see him. I see okay. him. He's gonna be fine. He's, those two are the allies. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, no, Zerfus isn't an ally. Zerfus exists. <laughs> this constant state of. Hmm. Is he good? Yeah, my yeah, my my. Whenever we go into combat, like Baldur's Gate three, it's, like it's, yellow. it's green. Every, theirs is red. Mine's yellow. At yeah. All times. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's this building? Oh my Stick. god! That is an abandoned tenement oh, building. Okay. I was gonna there's a door there if you want to go inside. Nah. Um, Are you gonna bring it down? <laughs> no, I'm just gonna cast a spell right here. Oh. Okay. Um, which which, which right spell might that be? A uh, sudden blight. Oh, okay. um, I'd like to know what the voice. It's kind of just like blight. Okay. Um, but sudden. It's gonna. It's gonna. <laughs> sunny blight. <laughs> it's like a desert where it's like sudden. Oh. I don't think it. I heard sun and blight. Mm. Sun and blight. <laughs> mm -hmm. it's, it's it's gonna, my sun cracked. Blighted. Everything like cracks. It's gonna a little hit bit. these three guys. I think it also might hit my zombie, but it doesn't matter. So he's that not hits uh, the the minotaur and the two shifters. Yes. Gotcha. Ooh. I need to make um, basic fortitude saves. Okay. Um, and then I'll take some damage. Is it negative um, damage? Uh, yes. Car Bloodhorn rolled a 25. Okay, he'll succeed. Then uh, the um, shifters. Would it heal? Um, we'll roll a. That's cool if it does. Um, it's just not effective. I think um, it they might will heal. only roll a 16. <laughs> Okay, fail. I'll, I'll roll. Oh, that's that's one of them. I'll roll for the other ones. Okay. That is a um, twenty-six for that other. Okay, shifter. he'll succeed. Let me see what happens if he succeeds. So one of the shifters fails. Car and the um, and the other shifter succeed. 
I'll let you pick which shifter fails. That's weird. Negative matter. damage does not heal undead, but negative energy does. Got it. Touch of corruption heals undead. Uh, <clears throat> if you're undead, it gives the AC or a attack. Half of they succeed. Mm-hmm. Uh, if it's a basic save, I think they do. If they succeed, they, 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 they just they take, take half? Yes. Yeah. If they okay. critical, critically succeed, they then take they no take damage. Okay. Um, I'm going to do so yeah, ba- basic um, failure is, uh, or sorry, success is you take half the list of damage. None of these people are affected by disease, but. No, oh, no, no rabies. So no minus two circumstance penalty. They don't have rabies? One of them rolled bad enough. Anyway. Well, no. They're well, From a sudden point of view. They might already <laughs> have it. Um, that's 15 negative damage. Oof, okay, then... so. Um. Which, uh, which shifter are you going to go for? The one... Just the one that's cl- closer to where I cast it, so this okay. guy okay. is the one Sounds that good. failed. That'll be, that'll be shifter one. Uh, shifter one. So that one takes 15, you said? Yes. Right, there's three fucking shifters there, too. Yes, there's a lot of things in that group. Okay. Um, anything else on your turn, Stick? Um, my zombie's going to yeah. beat the... The rest of the life out of um, this guy. <laughs> For sure. Uh, Go ahead. Is it going to get the plus Hell one? Yeah, yeah. Is it going to concentrate? He goes, he goes, yay. <laughs> wow. Um, Love that for him. He uses one, one action, is, though, as a thing. So. Uh, oh, it uses an action. Well, then maybe it won't, because yeah. it only gets two actions. That's why. Yeah, that's. Slow. J- just in um, case. One's, so a, like, one's a 21. 21 plus, hits. And then the other one is no. a 13. 13 will miss. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Hey Jack, what level is this wand of rolling flames? Uh, level two. Thank you. Uh, or sorry, yeah, it's the it's the it's the level six uh, item. It's the one that casts the level two Thank flaming you. sphere. Yeah. Eleven bludgeoning damage. Eleven bludgeoning damage. Yes. <clears throat> All right. You had the opportunity to say, wouldn't you like to know whether? <laughs> I, 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 but I have to answer the question on the GM. How could um, you? That shifter is bloodied. I promise you, Jack, you don't. Uh, okay, well, <laughs> I just like to be helpful. Um, yeah, you next are. is uh, the Knolls. The Knolls. Um, the Knolls. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, hold on. I think I. Oh, no, I didn't skip the sergeant because the sergeant goes before seven. Okay. Now I'm getting confused about the order. <laughs> uh, so the Knolls. That one at the, up at the top is just going to fire three shots down at you, Severin. Okay. Two. Uh, uh, 22. Yep. Oh, come on. Load the page. Thank you so much. Uh, that is a natural 20 Oops. for 30. <laughs> I yeah. Oh. I am. Uh, not a crit. Yeah. Well, no, it goes up oh, by it's one. It's a natural crit, 20. So yes, it's so a crit, goes up by one, so it is not a crit. crit. Um, yeah. It's only four piercing damage, only. though. Oh, sorry, not only. It's actually eight piercing damage, because <gasps> short bows are deadly. Oh. So I add nice. an extra d10 at the end. Um, oh. And then two more shots. Mm-hmm. Two shots this time. Uh, oh my god, it's not a 20, but it's a 19 on the die. Uh, 24. Yes. Two. Okay. Last shot. Um, that is a 14. Nope. Yeah. So you take two arrows to the back, just like uh, Kiros did. That oh. one no. guy I just made up. Oh, how's he doing? <laughs> nice. <laughs> um, I, he stayed back at the storm tower to get some medical attention. Really? But, uh, I, that's good. That's he died. a good idea. Uh, oh. <laughs> got, yeah. They, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Medically um, attended. And then the other two gnolls, I mean, they're by... Uh, Briah and Birba. I mean, one of them is dead. The other Noel yeah, is going dead. to. Um, we teach Briah medical aid. He finds. Um, he finds uh, Beerbot kind of scary. Um, he's going to step away from Beerbot onto onto the porch. Oh. Ah, take that. <laughs> Took him down. Takes okay. with him. Um, oh, step away from Beerbot and look at Azarephus and is going to okay. attack twice with a battle axe. Looking okay. Um, Twelve to hit. Nope. Second attack. Twenty-one. Uh, yeah. Oh, sorry, not twenty-one. Twenty. That misses. Okay. Oh. Then he's gonna make a jaws attack for the last one. Make jaws. 15. That misses. All right. Uh, okay. Um, and uh, that's it for the gnolls because the other ones are dead. Zerfus. Okay. So changes. Uh, that knoll just really had to fucking move there, but that's mm-hmm, okay. I'm still mm-hmm. gonna hit three of them. Uh, Zerfus is gonna Tactics. turn. Uh, yeah, so we'll actually get to do some things. So yeah. the first thing he's gonna do is um, uh, uh, he he's this knoll starts what like trying to bite him. Yeah, um, it's, it's <laughs> swiping at you with a battle action. I'm gonna, do, to bite I'm you. gonna spend two actions to spell strike. Spell strike lets me uh, do an attack and cast a spell. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> but luckily I don't have to make an attack on the second spell, so I'm not gonna get the negative from Sweet. it. So I'm gonna do an attack on the knoll here. 
Uh, that's going to be a... Mm -hmm. Flip my coin. Uh, sure. And uh, natural one misses, right? Yes. Yeah, all right. So he just misses, but then he he turns around and he uh, takes his arcane firearm and he pulls back one of the um, one of the mechanisms on the top um, the, and the barrel magically spins into this sort of like wide frame um, as he takes it, charges it, and boosh, this explosion of flame and do burning hands heightened uh, here at these guys. And you make uh, against the, the Minotaur and the two shifters? It's the Minotaur and the two shifters. Understood. <clears throat> Oh, so the shifters. Uh, no, I didn't need to actually because of how that works. Oh, sweet. Um, so you, you said reflex. Mm. Yes. Um, one rolled a twenty-two. Okay. The other Half. rolled um, a natural twenty. Uh, all right. And Half. then Carr rolled a. Okay. Critically succeeds. So I'll take mm. damage. Um, they take, f they take half damage on success, right? Yeah, if it's a critical success, they might take degrees. Oh, for um, critical success, they take no yeah. damage. Mm -hmm. um, and Carr only rolled a 17. Okay, so he fails. So, okay, so he'll take full damage. Uh, me, but the, the two shifter, one shifter takes uh, half damage, the other one takes none. What was that save? It was a reflex. Reflex. Okay, dodgy. What level are you casting Burning Hands at? Um, second. Second level, sweet. Uh, it's, uh, why did I count that twice? 16 fire damage okay. to the one that failed. So six car takes 16, so that's... God, what is he at now? Math. What 10, is he at? Five. Yeah, what, what is, is he at? at? That's a good question. He's not bloodied yet, if that's what you're asking. to the one that, that rolled, and then none to the other one. Okay. Um, which and one Which one do you think succeeded? And which one uh, the one in the back. Probably. That makes sense to me. Took cover that one. That body. one... Uh, uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, and so can you cast two spells in a turn? Is that a thing? Is that not a rule in this as game? As I don't actions. know. I think as long as well, you have then, uh, actions. Well, then as long as I have actions, then I'm going to cast um, uh, my sorry. other second level slot, which is... Uh, Correct me if we're wrong, I guess. Uh, well, it doesn't do anything right now, but it's Scorching Blast. Um, oh, so, nice. Um, the, the gun <laughs> fires off, and then there's smoke emitting from it, and then he literally like, pulls it back and mm. uh, puts in, it begins to charge again as uh, flame begins to build up into it. As I'm, uh, it basically, I have to spend an action to start Scorching Blast, and then on my next turn, I can be like... <laughs> that's sick. It, so that's that's super sick. Yeah. Um, All right. That's it. Did you put your gun on vibrate? <laughs> God, <laughs> that was last night. No, that, yeah, I was just saying, that was last night. It's his gun. Yeah, it's his gun. Oh my God, gun. the gun. Jesus hey, Christ, y'all are crazy. Hey, yo. uh, I'm not judging, but jeez. Are you uh, casting uh, Hitachi? Um, <laughs> I am going to go ahead and like, flip my worry, wand at I'll our save you. big <laughs> man, our friend, Shit, sorry. and cast Enfeeble. Enfeeble? Ooh. He needs to make a... Uh, four, two, three, Great spell. Oh, please. Casting weak basic on the or. Knees. Yep. Hmm? Oh. Basic or. I think basic. It doesn't say It should else. say at the It'll top, say. like, what sort of save it is. Defense um, fortune. Oh. It's just not a basic. It's um, a saber uh, suck. Sweet. No, um, well, well no, 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 there, there are degrees of success. Oh, okay. Unfortunately, I rolled a 34 on that fortitude oh, save. Ah, ah, I rolled the highest okay. I can roll without rolling a natural so 20. That is just okay. a basic failure, That's probably. A basic. But, <laughs> yeah, 34 is a basic failure. Nothing okay. happens. <laughs> All right, uh, anything else on your turn? Um, oh, yeah, I was going to do this at the start of my turn. Sorry. Oh, yeah, yeah, go ahead. Um, it was a free action anyways. To oh, to concentrate? or No, to... Um, Warm hat? Huh? Oh. Nothing. Sorry, carry on. To uh, do what? What was it called? It's called um, Patron's Puppet. Oh yes, Patron's Puppet. So remind um, me what that does. Passing free like action too. trigger. Your turn begins uh. at, at your unspoken plea. Your patron temporarily assumes control over your familiar. Oh, that's right. You command your familiar, allowing it to take its normal actions this turn. Your command does not have the auditory or concentrate traits. Your patron simply moves it, its agent directly. Oh, okay. I'm so does that mean that I basically take I'm going to say you or? are in control oh, of Puck. I don't even know what Puck does. Um, I just like I'm a bad person to put in, put in control of Puck. Puck like, gets on uh, you have the, legs you have the link to my character sheet and Puck is in that. <laughs> You're right. I do have the link to your character sheet. I, I forgot about that. Yes, um, I think you yesterday. What? Yes, you did. I'm pl I, I need to play the game by the rules. I'm sorry. I goofed. What happened? Oh. So, um, uh -oh. Scorching Blast lasts until the end of my turn, so that's uh, stupid. So, so, uh, so you didn't cast Scorching Blast? Uh, I didn't cast Scorching Blast. Also, my uh, I, I, I thought I was standing here, so I wasn't. So, uh, Instead of that action, what I'll have done is redone my turn to be like step oh, here, step back, scorching glass. Yeah. That's it. Okay, <clears throat> awesome. Thank you so much for catching that. Um, okay, path builder. And anger him. Yeah. 
I have to. Oh, where you is, have to where is Puck listed? It's really weird. It's under just pets. like this. Under pets? Yes. Of course it is. Why? Yes. <laughs> where else would it be? Where else would it be? Um, <laughs> so. It's so he doesn't so, see the blood and guts. He spits So Puck can do tattoo transformation. Uh, fly can use two limbs of its limbs as if they were hands to manipulate accent. You can do this. There's a fourth <laughs> one that isn't selected. Um, um, I can't. S okay, so I. Okay, I don't know. Just. Um, have you casted or sustained a hex at all? I don't think so because I don't okay. have seen any of them say it's a hex. Okay. So. Can puck attack? Or I don't think it can. I don't it's think so familiar, it can. Right? Not well, really. I don't really know. Unless I have a. I don't really know what puck's going to well, do then. <laughs> I kind of want it to have attack. You can. There should be like an attack thing in that fourth slot. Oh, you can yeah. Do that. There should be like. Uh, what would that be? Oh, oh hi. Hello, hello, baby. Um. For some reason, I can't see that. Oh, that's strange. I I I, I can because it's slightly different for me. I don't know. Oh wait, edit pet. No. Goes the other way. Um. No. It should be a, like a like a clause or something like that. Clause? I don't see anything like that. No. Um, look, look, look for it, and then I'll, yeah. I'll just move on for now, and then we can you know retroactively go back. Yeah. To that. Um, okay, so the shifters are gonna go now. Um, Zarephus, um, mm -hmm. they're gonna do um, two claw attacks and a tusk against you. Um, first one's a thirty. To hit? Yeah, I'll do it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'll do it. Is that a crit? That is not a crit. Okay, got it. It's got to be 10 above? Yeah. Yes. 10 above? <laughs> Close. Was it, was it 9? Uh, no, it's got to get a 31 to hit me. Oh. To, cr mm. to crit me. To crit uh, me. So that is. Oh, that's the. I rolled the wrong die. I'm so sorry. <gasps> He's about um, to yeah. That is um, 10 piercing damage. Ew. Sorry, I don't know why it's kind of sound like Jennifer Coolidge. <laughs> 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 no. Um, second claw attack. That is uh, that is only a seventeen. Uh, no, it missed. And then the toss. You say I want a hot dog. Uh, that is a twenty. Oh, hot dog, the, the twenty doesn't hit either. No, it does All not. Right, because so you just take oh, that. You just take whew, that one. Uh, the other shifter is going to attack your zombie stick. Okay. Uh, so he's going to. I think he'll. No. Oh no, he's within range. He can get there. Um, so he'll attack your uh, zombie. He's going to go three tusks. Okay. Um, that's cocked. What he does, he does this. Nope, that's a miss. That is. AC um, only 15. AC's only 15? Yes. Oh, then that was a hit because it, it was 3 plus 12. So yeah. Ah. So 15 exactly. I mean, yeah. I take it back. Um, <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, uh, the other Never one missed because it's a 14. Uh, and then the last one is a 4. <laughs> so it, only one hit. Okay. With the tusks. Uh, that is. Ta ta ta. Um, 12 piercing damage to the zombie. Okay. Then the last shifter is. Um, by Brian Beerbot. Um, Beerbot's gonna do a tusk at you. Yep. That is not gonna hit. Um, okay. And then um, it's gonna do two claws at Brya. Um, Sixteen probably nope. misses. I see nineteen. Yeah. Oh. No. Nice. Don't don't hit Brya at all. Uh, okay. And then it's the orcs. The orcs are all dead. Uh, back to the top. <laughs> it is Beerbot. All right. Cool. Well, Beerbot. You know. Okay, so. Oh. Okay. Have you figured it out? There is none. Okay. However, I did just have a dumb thought. I don't think this is how this necessarily works, but I mean, I'm here for it. Let's let's hear it. Yeah, it, it, it can grab oh. stuff. Puck can grab stuff. Okay. <laughs> it's the idea that it just grabs a knife. Okay. You know what? Yeah. I think here's like, what I here's okay. Here, I'll take Puck's turn right now. Puck, do whatever you. Puck is gonna be want. this guy. Puck's okay. gonna be like um, me his brother. Puck cat. is gonna <laughs> grabbing crane. Um. <laughs> um <laughs> Puck is gonna fly up to the top of the of, of twenty five mm -hmm. feet to near the near the top like the okay. top of the, yep. this awning of the of the of the of the cat. Yep. He's gonna pick up a roof shingle and he's oh. gonna throw it down at one of the ah! shifters. <laughs> yes. so, you know, I'll say this is an improvised weapon Just, attack. Uh, um, I rolled that too. <laughs> I'm sorry, Puck. You Ding. missed, buddy. But Puck's up here for now, okay. so Puck is on the awning right now. Okay. Um, we just see a shingle fall over. Yeah, what the like, fuck? Puck's throwing down shingles. Uh, Literally picking uh, them up. And three attacks on the Minotaur. Got it. Wait, when did Puck get thumbs? Uh, it's like six. It's Twenty-six. Yeah. To hit the Minotaur? Oh, yeah. I believe that hits. Yes, it does. I believe it hits. Second attack. Yeah. Yeah. Third attack. What was crit? 
Ooh. 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 What's the total? Uh, is it minus ten? It's gonna be. It's gonna be minus ten. You know. <coughs> it would be a twenty-five total. Still hits. So that's a crit. <laughs> oh. Nice. Okay, so two hits and a crit. No, you just had one hit. Sorry, and a crit. because you went two eight. hits. One is a crit. Oh, got it. Got it. Yeah. Sorry, because the first was a hit. Yes, yeah, second was second one was ah. Uh. <laughs> yeah. You didn't even tell us. And I quote. <laughs> and I quote. Uh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's ten. Why is my fun? water bottle on the cat? What the table? It's uh, not. Well, that's there. been there the whole time. Yeah, I, I thought it was. I thought it was Jordan's. It was like right here, and I was like, "This must be Colton's. I'll put it more in his space." <laughs> <laughs> well, in case of the mysterious water bottle. It's my. It's mine. Surprise. Well, there you go. What if we discerned all of hits or misses just by noises? Yeah. Mm. Eh, or eh. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 You have to like persuade the DM. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Yippee. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Yippee. Yay. <laughs> People are like, are you playing like Mario Party? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. Jack, when I hit, I'll go. Wow. And if I miss, I'll go. <laughs> That's what happened uh, the Minotaur fucking. <laughs> 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 40, damage. 40 damage. 40 damage. 40. Oh my god. Still didn't top me. Is he bloody now? I, I think it's Zerif. No, <laughs> <laughs> yeah! I'm I was going to say. Is that, is that I, the crit I, uh, and the hit combined? Yeah, yeah. Got it. As soon as I do have started brawling. Something. Let me check yeah. what brawling is. Car is not I doing hot. Do uh, let me check through what brawling is because I think brawling is my. Uh, oh, yeah, you get your crit specialization, crit specialization too. Yeah. Brawling, Pathfinder, Dewey. I, I need to confirm what that does. I can, I can also. Uh, target must here. succeed a fortitude save against my class DC or be slowed one until the end oh of my, my turn. Oh god. That's crazy. Uh, what, what, is is your, my, what is your class DC? Uh, oh, okay, cool. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, we are learning. Uh, it's probably going to be 21 if you have the same class. key. Well, the Pathfinder 2, where you, um, you have a. You so have it'll a, be 10 plus 5. Plus your your um your I don't know if it's key ability or score or whatever. Con. Oh, key class DC score is, is always okay. ten plus proficiency plus key stat. So my key stat is strength. My strength is plus four, so fourteen. So nineteen. Nineteen. <coughs> yeah. Um, and this are you trained save? in it? Trained in strength? No, in your spell save or in your class save. Ah. Uh, Most likely, so it'll be twenty-one. Sure. Because okay. mine's the same thing. Okay, I'll roll That's it. So 21? Yeah, and this 21. is a fortitude save? Uh, 21 fortitude. I was going to say, it wasn't a Pathfinder where you'll have an ability that casts a spell, <laughs> and that spell will that affect is a 20. the condition. Oh, he, he fails. fails. He slowed one. He has slowed one. And you'll go to that condition, and that it'll say that condition will say, inflicts this condition. And then you'll go to that condition, to and that condition so, will uh, have another rule, and it's like, wh- how he, many pages? He, he's like, mm-hmm. he's like, I can do that too. Beerbot mm-hmm. blocks it from happening, mm-hmm. and then he just turns and just swings, just wham, wham, across yeah. the face. Nice. Um, yeah, you, uh, you, you cave a portion of his face in. Uh, he's still alive, <laughs> but uh, he is pretty rough. Um, it is. Uh, is that your turn? That is Beerbot's turn. That was okay. the attack. Cool. The, the Null Sergeant's turn. Um, um, I don't know who's bloodied. Okay. The no, the the Minotaur. Is yeah. it Minotaur is quite bloody. Yes. Yeah. Um, the uh, the Null Sergeant starting to see that maybe this isn't going too well. Uh-huh. Um, maybe. Gonna, I... gonna use an action. Uh huh. Um, to. I mean, I can't do anything about that. Uh, is gonna. Uh, Maybe. I, 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 can you? Does, does, I don't have. A okay, got it. Good to know. Um, <laughs> is going to do um, a. Is gonna do a, a bark orders. Um, <laughs> does he, bark, bark, bark. All allies. All allies who. Um, let's see. Uh, any allies who hear and understand this order can use a reaction to step. So. Um, he can't step, but uh, the shifter can step this way. Uh, He's going to take his action to go... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, car Retreat. is going to step this way. Um, shifter's stepping this way. Step shifter's stepping this way. Shifter's stepping this way. Um, Doesn't change anything for the zombie. Not really. Um, like, uh, only so much that... Uh, 
that uh, um, that these guys can do. Um, <laughs> no, I. Uh, then um, kinda, uh, kinda I mean, it's just gonna go. T- uh, that 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 one at the top of the stairs mm-hmm. will take a step towards the stairs. Um, and then um, two scimitar attacks against Yusa. Okay. Twenty-two. Um, nope, that's a twenty. <laughs> nope. But, no, I rolled a, a like a five. I think I rolled two fives. I rolled, wow. five, I rolled a nineteen and a thirteen or fourteen. Oh. Yeah, this isn't going too well for old uh, for old Noel here. Um, All right, um, Briar's turn. Uh, Second verse, same as the first. Let's try to kill this fucking fifth Minotaur. Minotaur, yeah. All right. I think Briar sees opportunity. She sees that that he's weakened (laughs) and seems to be looking to try to get the fuck out. So it would seem. So, all right, first attack. Uh, Dirty twenty. Oh, that will miss. Fuck. Second attack. Not good. Can I use my coin for her? No. Okay. Rise an NPC. Well, we'll she doesn't get a attack. What's the worst that could happen? Uh, Not much we bring in here. 22? 22 hits exactly. <laughs> You're looking at mine? That's good. That's what I wanted. All right. Seven yeah, no, plus seven. eight, 15 <laughs> damage. He had exactly 15 Are you points. serious? I'm, I'm not kidding. <laughs> Hell yeah. So... so I guess so, how does Briar want to do whoa. this? <laughs> so so Beerbot. I mean this I, this could be a Briar Beerbot combo move. I was gonna say so so Beerbot kind of he's like what does he say he says like I can do that too. Beerbot blocks it mm-hmm. and then and then kind of swings through and like smashes it smashes him mm-hmm. and as he's kind of dazed he's listening to that order and kind of moving and he moves right into her swing hitting the same spot but on the opposite side of his oh. head and just caving in Is she in punching him? Oh yes. my god. And yeah. so they've effectively caved in both sides. Yeah, and as, uh, crazy. as the mighty car blood horn <laughs> falls. Like right on the horns. Yeah, just... Dang, you guys. That's crazy. That's that so awesome. Impressive. And you're right, he was definitely going to try and get away. Um, uh, so fun boy. fact, if he horns. didn't die there, he would have been grappled. <laughs> That's because true, he would have been yeah. grabbed. So that You're was right. <laughs> You're right. I needed Dang. one to hit. No. <laughs> just one of Dask's heavy lieutenants. Mm. Yeah. That's nuts. Well, nothing Don't else sends a message st- that way. Stop Yippee. fucking with us. <laughs> stick. Oh, our message stick? is not. Oh, sorry, not stick. I lied. No, I'm a big fat liar. Uh, seven Roy. I'm seven Roy. so confused. Roy, did you want to. Um, Jack, if I make it to here, yeah. and I can with movement. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> You want to hit that guy at the Can top I? of the stairs? Yeah. yeah. Cool. Why not? Um, how far away from me? Does he have cover? What's going on? Um, I'll say, I don't know. I'll give him like a plus one to AC because of the angle. But other than that. Okay. Um, Kobe. Yeah. <laughs> Kobe. <laughs> That's a Talentin word yeah. for a uh, catch. <laughs> it's, uh, it means nothing but net. <laughs> That's 29 on the first uh, one. That definitely hits. stupid that that reminds me of Attack on Titan. Kobe? Kobe? No, catch. Oh. oh. Mm. And that's How 11. Uh, that last one will miss, unfortunately. Um, so the last one is still going to generate four splash damage. Okay. So and then... Takes four damage. Fourteen total, okay, uh, and then three ongoing damage or Got persistent it. damage. Ongoing makes just much. He sense. is bloodied. <laughs> ongoing means persistent. Uh, uh, yeah, the second one just uh, sort of shatters against the banister, uh, but the the first one does hit. Um, Seth, make a melee attack. Okay. Uh, uh, so it has a negative two to its AC. Uh, That's right. Yeah. So that is a. What? How does math work for a moment? 19 to hit? 19 will miss. Whew. Whoa. Yeah. Hi, uh, AC. Yeah. Uh, step back and then shoot. Okay. Bang. Sorry. Uh, math. 31. <laughs> 31 is a critical hit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Dang, that's crazy. Cool. Did you apply your multiple attack penalty? Okay. I rolled a 19. Oh, wow. No, okay, that's why the <laughs> math it. was hard. Mm-hmm. I rolled almost max again. Mm. Oh, jeez. So. Kashta uh, has barely taken any damage at this point. Yeah, might take all the damage now. Might. 
Might pull a freaking car blood horn and just immediately murder her. <laughs> uh, 41 damage. Oh my god. Nice. Um, and because he has critical specialization Very bloodied. with his gun. Oh, nice. Uh -oh. Um, sorry, let me he actually, uh, if they're bloodied, they actually just die. <laughs> That's one hell of a specialization. Uh, it has to succeed at a fortitude save against your class DC, which is 21, okay. or be stunned one. Oh, mm. that's almost as wow. bad. Natural 20. Oh, oh wow. 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 Close. And that's it. Okay. Um, would be Kara's turn, but he's dead. He's um, dead. Stick, now it's your turn. Yay. What? What? How do they react? Uh, they, they are very surprised. Were they like, time to go? Yeah, they're like, time to get the fuck out of here. <laughs> no survivors. No, oh no, no witnesses. <laughs> no, we want witnesses. We want them to go back no and witnesses. be like, they share the story. No, <laughs> there only needs to be one witness. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Bro. Is this Puck or Rudda? <laughs> yes. The Lady in Shadows. There's the Lady in Shadows. Like, there must only be one. It's that scene from Mulan. Or that guy's like, exactly. That's, that's exactly what I'm thinking. That's how many people does it take to share a message? One. One. Pew. Um, how about this badass? I mean, that was that, that goes kind of hard. Yeah, that's, that's pretty crazy. <laughs> it does. Let's get down to business. Okay, goes I gotta hard. be honest. I did, we have a we have a little toy for Marcy. It's, it's like a box that plays stories and songs and stuff. Mm -hmm. They have like little things and you can put on the top of it. And this can make a fortitude tick. We've been listening yeah. to a lot of Mulan yep. lately. Uh, I like that bone shaker on him. That's a shifter. It's a, it's a good one. Oh, it's great. I just hear it every Fortitude? <laughs> yeah. 25. Uh, 25. Oh, shit. Okay. Um, you guys, um, half damage. Okay, uh, we'll take half damage. Half damage, okay. Uh, I'll get that for you right now as soon as I can read where it is. Okay. Yeah, you're good. Is it? Is this the same guy you targeted with your blight? No, this guy. Ah, the guy over there. Got yeah. it. Got it. Got it. So number um, three, the one that hasn't been hit yet. Um, eight, already halved. Okay. And um, he can either choose to fall prone, or I can move him five feet. Mm. Is the bone shaky? <laughs> <one? Bones fun>. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> move him five feet. Yeah. Weep. Literally. <laughs> <laughs> even on a even on a success, you can move him. Um. Yes. Wow. Hmm. Uh, it just goes down. If he critically fails, I can move twenty five. If he oh yeah. wow. Okay. Yeah. Damn, that's, that's cool. crazy. He's that's vibrating awesome. so much, it kind of just moves him over. <laughs> <Yeah>. That's crazy. And <laughs> my zombie's gonna. Um, you vibrate his bones. Hit. Which one of these looks is the worst? Really off? The um, the so. one in front of Azarephus. So this guy? It's, it's, yeah. it's a skeleton okay, he's trying gonna to get out. Okay. It's trying to hatch. Only one is five feet. Huh? Did he move five feet? Has he, he, has he has a reach of ten. Oh, wow. Um, that dirty 20? Arms. Long arms. Uh, dirty 20 no. will hit. Actually, okay. one arm. Um, then she just has another arm on top of it. Yeah. He just no. takes <laughs> off his other arm. And yeah. goes uh, <laughs> 11. 11? Okay. Yeah. He can only attack once. Got this it. Round, uh, he's, he's still up, but uh, he's on hands. his last leg. Oh no! Um, that didn't work. Why you it's the Knoll's oh, turns. Um, <laughs> there's just two of them <laughs> left at this point. Um, Stress barking. I mean, this Knoll's gonna just take his chances Stress and book it. Um, I, do you have an attacks of opportunity? No. Okay, I don't think Briah does either. Someday. So this one's just gonna uh, five, Let me ten. check. Where would I find that? Uh, it'd be on. It'd be. <laughs> it'd be. It'd be, it'd be like that sometimes. Yeah. Uh, if you look at the feet. section where it says like AC, fortitude, reflex, will, yeah. HP, right below HP would be where its reactions are. Uh, no reactions. Got it. Okay. So this knoll is going to stride. Just stay there. Somewhere. I'm down. Um, uh, would just stride three times. So move 75 feet just running down the street. 75 feet. I think. Uh, 75? Just at the edge of the oh, map. No. Got it. Um, Funnily enough, I think Beerbot can catch up to that. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> then hear, hear that behind. The, that one up there does the same thing. Just move 75 feet trying to uh, uh, get Please out no. of there. Well, well that's he a wall. Like, they phase through the wall? <laughs> He's up the stairs. He's at the top of the stairs. 5, 10. He's at the top of the stairs. He has to, he has go, to go down, down, the, down stairs. the stairs. Yeah. Oh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 35. Uh, 40, 50. You know what? He would probably take 55. the back door. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. 
So where's the bank? No, 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 no matter what, he still has to go down the stairs. No matter what's down the stairs. So here, I'll, I'll well, do it. Can he go do this it. way? No. Uh, I, I mean, I guess he could, but, but why would he? Uh, he'd go 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, uh, 35, 40, 45, 50. 55. Goes, excuse me, pardon me. Uh, 65, 70, 75. So he has, he's not quite out yet, but I don't okay. know. He took a very but backwards route to get there. Yeah, yeah so he's headed out the back right, door. Right. Um, <laughs> yeah, he right. literally left the surface. Right My turn? Yeah. He could have jumped. Okay. Um, uh, oh boy, they're fun. starting to yeah. run. They're starting to get out of here. There's still three oh, of them right there. He's in range. Mm -hmm. I can throw three at him. <laughs> <laughs> so Xerophis, uh, uh Really seal the deal room. on the cricket yeah. deck. Xerophis <laughs> <laughs> takes his arcane firearm. Um, and that new sort of like either. gem that's in it now, he uh, he it like begins to like spin. Um, I feel like the entire gun almost like there's bits that uh, that like extend from it. The barrel gets longer, and he points it upwards um, as it fires, almost like a mortar. Mm -hmm. uh, and then I'm taking some inspiration from Gwen. Hell yeah! Um, and then uh, uh, striking downwards is this flaming sphere. It's going to go here. Got it. Um, this entire area is now difficult to raid. And it's also um, on fire, I believe. Uh, it's also on fire. Yeah. Um, this guy needs to make a, de uh, a f reflex save. Yeah, Jordan. Having 17. Um, and Gwen. He fails. Gwen. Okay. And uh, takes. Him to sleep. Um, <laughs> he just. Gwen uh, hits like a freight train because he's a sharpshooter. Uh, 13 fire mm -hmm. damage. Okay. Um, as that hits him. And then uh, uh, I don't know if it's in his space, but I think it pushes him. <laughs> It lands on top. Each creature must make the save when you sustain the spell each turn is when I can move it, but... Um, I feel like he would get pushed away from it. Okay, well... There. Um, that's there. Everything within that. It's also now on fire. Got it. Um, and as Xerophis does that, um, he uh, there's just like fire surrounding everything. He's just like, <laughs> there's no escape. Um, <laughs> then I've got one more action, and that action needs <sighs> to... Ponder. Ponder? <laughs> Um, Ponder the yeah. shoot. Yeah. Uh, Gloat. All the shoot? faceless goons no. that just um, think things about Severin's cast. Hey, yo. Ooh. Yeah, we'll go, uh, we'll go 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Okay. That's it. All right. My turn? Rena, yeah, Rena. <laughs> All right, I'm My going... Turn. Are you, gonna, are you gonna patron's puppet again? Are there any I bugs? I will patron's around? puppet. <laughs> okay, Puck's gonna throw another shingle um, <laughs> down at the uh, shifters. Like, oh, come um, on, I'm trying to sleep. <laughs> I'm uh, that's an 18, which is gonna miss. But how many actions does Puck have? Does Puck have three actions? I think it's the same as. Dang. Yeah. Miss. <laughs> I'm sorry, Puck. That's fine. The, the multiple I, attack I, penalty is brutal. I kind of have a. I, I, I kind of find it just fun to have yeah, you do sure. whatever the hell you, just, you want. Just flinging shingles down. Um, started to run out. Yeah. I am going to move 25 feet towards Beerbot. Okay. I don't know where that puts me. Five, uh, 10, 15, 20. It put me right next to Beerbot. I can't really reach way over there. Thank you, Jake. Just right. Yep, right there. Um, I will then do the thing I, that is my signature that I haven't done all game. <laughs> Time to start throwing some shit. Hey. Hey. One of the shingles I'm oh, gonna throw, I'm gonna throw that. Shingles. Maybe, maybe like it's coming down and then oh, I send yeah. it. Shoo, that's cool. Like it, it's obviously not gonna hit something and then it. Who are you targeting? Um. That knoll at the end of the street. Uh, I can't do. That. <laughs> oh, I can't bummer. do that close that, uh, that far. It has to be within thirty feet of me. Um. <laughs> I'll do. I'll do the shifter that just got fireballed. Okay. I mean, flaming spear. Well, it's a ball of fire. I do have fireball. Yeah, you do have fireball. I just got some fucking warforged. That's and a cock, in my technically, but you can. If it's cocked, you can reroll it. Well, we'll get him resistance. I trust you. <laughs> no. No, no, it's the opposite. Oh. oh. It went from. It was cocked, but it was mostly on three, and then I re rolled it for it, and it went to natural twenty. Nice, so sick. I love that. All right, roll, uh, roll, some, uh, roll the damage, some. double it. You yeah, that's some. against the shift of the fireball. Shingles, yeah. you lose okay. your shingles. Um, oh, you don't roll double the dice. You just, you just. No, no, no I get four d six. Understood. <laughs> that is crazy. I forgot. Thirty damage. Time. Thirty. He's dead. Clock him. Oh, with the shingle. Nice. Just, with the shingle, the shingle just takes yeah. off his head. For real. Nice. At such velocity. Amazing. There you go. That's my turn. Okay. I did something. Good lord. <laughs> uh, shifters are going to go. Okay. Um, they are going to do uh, the same thing. Fire? Um, oh, hold on. I'm so sorry. Shift. These shifters have an ability. 
called Ferocity. So if they're reduced to one hit point, if they're reduced to zero hit points, um, they can use their reaction Ooh. to remain at one, but their wounded value increases by one. That's cool. Mm-hmm. That's so, cool. so he is so still alive. alive. All right. Still alive. Still alive, but he's wounded one. Undead fortitude, but worse. <laughs> It's like half orca. He has a shingle. It's a little bit like half orca. He has a shingle yeah. like stuck, stuck in his, his neck. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, Jesus. Uh, okay, yeah, the shifters are going to get the fuck out of there. Uh, they're all going to stride 75 feet following that knoll. Difficult they're going to go this way? Yeah. Okay. So, uh, one Actually, fire damage. One will. <laughs> I think some of them might try to go down the alley. They're going to try and like split up and scatter. Okay, so so I don't know. Send one down after that knoll and send 10, the other one. 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, that 40, 45, 50, 50, 55, Yeah, 60. because he walked through the fire and the flames, like Dragon Force. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> All right, he took the one fire. Uh, and then this one is going to go this way. Um, He's going to die if yep. he goes this way. Yeah, they'll scatter in different directions. Okay, yeah. so scatter. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. 30, 35, 40, 45. Oh, uh, yeah, so he's going to disappear in the alleyway. That way. man he survived. He would have turned around and died. <laughs> 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 uh, that that bugbear shifter uh, also will go. Um, you know what? Yeah, they'll, uh, he'll go He'll go down and then into that alleyway back there. Yeah, okay. That um, one with one hit point. Well, mm-hmm. that one can live. Can I see him? There's two. <laughs> um, the orcs are dead. The shifters are gone. Well, the, well there's one shifter left. Uh, back to the top, Beerbot. Mm. There's a really fun video where a guy 15, makes 20, like, 20, 30, songs 5, at the 10, wedding 15, processional. 20, 20, 20, 20. Oh, yeah. And he did, Sudden charge. Uh, through the fire in the flames. Well, that's awesome. That's really fun. Well, <coughs> oh, my God. The one with the one hit point. Sudden charge. No, that's not the one with one. Um, <laughs> I'm going to attack yeah, one of them. One. No, oh, no, it's not. Each one's going to get one, 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 one attack. Sudden charge is two actions, two strides, and an attack, and then I get another Understood. Understood. So first one, 22. Hit. Second one. Is that against the knoll or the Uh, We'll say the knoll. Uh, okay. Second one is plus uh, nine, eighteen against the shifter. Uh, that'll miss. Okay, that's fine. Twelve plus eight, uh, twenty damage to the null. Twenty damage. That null's still up. <laughs> I don't think that null's taken any damage actually. Um, <laughs> oh no, no, I think it has. Which null is this? The one that ran the flames. <laughs> that no, one didn't it didn't. No, it didn't. Yeah. Through the fire and the fire. No, that one didn't take damage because the other one took damage from Roy's mom. Yeah, okay, yeah. yeah. So that's the right knoll. It's still up. I heard from Roy's mom. mom. Hey, yo, <laughs> where is she at? And then we both good question. <laughs> that is a good question. Find but out another day, perhaps. Um, Why anything did you else like you know something? something. Um, <laughs> okay. Were you in prison with Roy's mom? <laughs> I was in prison with Roy's mom. Little sergeant's gonna She's go uh, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. 10, 15, 20, 25. Uh, would this be 35? Yep. Yeah. 40, 45, 50, 55. Okay. Um, 60, 65, 70, 75. Nice. So, I mean, th- getting the heck out of there. Um, Oh my goodness. Briar. Is that, is that, is that no I, I got it written down. No, no worries, you're good, you're good, you're good. Is that no bloody? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Cool. Uh, the Null Sergeant is very bloody. Uh, throwing 20? Okay. Oh, I'm sorry, are you talking about this Null right here? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that one's bloody too. <laughs> Brian charges in. She can't, she can't do much more than throw a spear, but okay. she's going to. All right. Nice. Plus nine to the... Attack. Remember, she like runs <laughs> past, oh, and picks up the freaking spear, hit. and the... F- yeah, that, does that, to- that, that is a that's not a crit, but it does hit. It does hit one d six plus eight piercing. Ten. Uh, nine piercing. <laughs> he had nine hit points. Oh, <laughs> what is going on, Brian? She's so good at that. <laughs> oh. That's the she, she, at at what she She's does. good at finishing off your kills. Yeah. Teamwork. Well, nice. yeah. teamwork. <laughs> the two of you are going to be like battle buddies. <laughs> um, You're welcome. No one has, has right. said Severn made yeah, a well. good choice. No, I think you did. <laughs> <laughs> I think you did. I, uh, Severn I Roy. I was sitting over in the corner like, please, Severn, please, do this. Go, <laughs> go <laughs> free. And then and then we saw the individual. And I went, you have to press the button. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's a big mummy. This is 50 yeah. feet. In, in the yes. Yes. Before, you, before you even said, I was like, Reloading please. strike. Um, Whiskers is like, no, my table. Yes. Or is um, Whiskers 15? alive? That's what I'm afraid of. Ten? I think he's yeah. dead. Yeah. No. no, I'm sure he's around himself. 30. Whiskers Not a crit, but it does hit. Not a crit? Yeah. <laughs> Whiskers is like... 18 to hit? 
<laughs> my shop. Um, I we'll also miss. Uh, they well, they will boast, both still take do eight, uh, splash, eight splash damage. Oh my god, he's barely up. <laughs> oh man. Um, yeah. So for the sergeant, um, AC twenty one. So it's not a crit. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I one have one off. more action. Yeah. You know, level fifteen. And it, even if I miss, it'll take another. Cut. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh, 16 to hit doesn't. <laughs> it misses, uh, but he still takes four. Yeah, as he still immolates in the hallway there. <laughs> <laughs> Eight damage. Mm-hmm. Still up. Oh. Still not dead? No, still no, 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 sorry. I was talking about the, the Null Sergeant. Okay. Oh, okay. But this that was dead. Super dead. Yeah, yeah. Well, I am out <laughs> of moderate. Um, so that was Seven Roy. Car's dead. Stick. Yeah, I fucked that guy in particular. Me. Yeah. yeah. You well, got well, anything you want to do? You got some? You can also just choose. Just four not to do anything. Can I start getting water to put the fucking. Mm-hmm. Yeah, sure. The flaming sphere out? Crooked cat? <laughs> yeah, oh, sure. Yeah. sure. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Cool. I'll say you I can run into that. the crooked cat and start trying to put out the fire. Yeah. You could probably that could just be your get, turn like, for sure. Litter. Litter? Start yeah. Throwing clay on. Huh? Um, Call forth the cats. The gnolls turns. Uh, all the gnolls are dead. Um, Zerifus. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm going to start doing the same as that guy runs out. Um, I don't use an action to continue concentrating on this, so Got it's it. gone. Um, gone. But wherever our fire is, I'm going to go over to it, and I kind of want to flavor my um, my my eat fire Hell reaction, yeah. Yeah. where basically you have water, and a Zerifus is going to go over and literally just be like, <laughs> and he's just like he's just <laughs> inhaling all of it. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> and then just turning it into For smoke sure. as he For goes sure. over. Yeah, yeah. For sure, that's yeah. awesome. <laughs> The zombies You're throwing water to <laughs> um, Like turns into a ship and flies through the radio. Yeah. <laughs> Red line. Um, Red and, Okay, uh, Renna? Um, you also going to help put out the fire? Nah. <laughs> You're like, I choose well, violence. I, mean, I choose violence, but <laughs> let's see if I can even do violence. How much is 25 feet towards the shifter that's running away? Okay. 30, no, uh, too far. It's fine. Then I will try a, and help. Okay. The, wait, actually. Oh. So you have three actions. Move another, and then take most it. spells take two. Yeah, most uh, spells take two. So that's that's the, that's the issue with with <laughs> with me is like all my spells take two. It's every spell strike. Damn. Yeah. I mean, it well, two, spell strike takes two, but I can I can basically put an attack in there at the same time. Um. Which is cool. Attack. It is cool. It is cool. <laughs> Throw a dagger or something. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> and then behind the dagger, <laughs> flaming spear. <laughs> oh my god! The sun just. <laughs> <laughs> the angry sun of the moon. Oh god. <laughs> I feel like sticks. Like, well, no, I'm just like in the middle of the quad. No, I know. Yeah. And I work on Saturday. No, I work tomorrow too. <laughs> We're good. We're wrapping up. We're wrapping up. Could I have use warp step? Yeah. Which is two actions, increases my movement to thirty feet, and yep. immediately strikes twice. Yep. So move me another thirty-five. Okay. Um, I'm gonna throw my corset. Hell knife. yeah! Go for it. <laughs> corset knife. Yeah. It has a ten foot throne. <laughs> oh my god. Kill. That's exactly enough. That's exactly okay. enough. Kill. 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 Eh. Uh that is a twenty-one to hit. Kill. That hits. <laughs> kill. It does very little damage. Well, but yeah. it might have very little health. It's okay. I don't know. <laughs> I think the shifter might take your course and knife with him. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> go knife, go! Oh. Come on. Big, hey. big money. One! <laughs> One? All right. Give him a parting gift. No, my corset knife. It, it does stick into his back as he runs away. I'm faster than the shifter is. Uh, the shifters? I have a speed of 30. I mean, you could probably catch up to these the, to that guy. Um, but, uh, yeah, it's only a speed of 25 feet. So. so you're faster than the shifter, technically. So you could probably... It would yeah. take forever for me to catch up to him, though. Cause eh, not really. Well, I would have to stride three oh, constantly, yeah, so like yeah. I would never well, actually I have mean, an action to attack. Yeah. Um, it is the shifter's turn. Uh, the shifter's going to run off the map. Um, and no, my uh, knife. Then, <laughs> Beerbot. Oh, I want my you knife. Gonna, you're not going to give chase. The Null Sergeant is also no. going to run off the map. He would. 
Okay. Uh, Birbot would just kind of turn towards so Bria and be like, I think depending on here. how far the commander could go, though. That's the most it's random thing. Uh, it, it's a maze of alleys back okay. there, so she, she basically disappears. The most random thing angle. ever is to be like, <laughs> I feel like Severin would, like, oh. <laughs> would attempt to pursue the commander. Okay. Um, but that could even just happen like off screen, so to speak. Sure. Um, we can, but if uh, we, we can, can't. We can resolve that maybe next time. But. Um, Okay, As anyway. a, then he wouldn't then. It's more of like, to kill him off screen, but it's fine. Oh, I would rather this knoll not get killed That's off screen. fine. Then um, come back. Because uh, this knoll is somebody. Okay. Just like yeah, Car Bloodhorn sure, sure. was somebody. Got so uh, Wasn't sure. The um, fact that that shifter gets back to Dask with a corset knife through them. <laughs> like, our guy came back with two arrows, and they come back, and they're like, something... <laughs> what the fuck? Ow. One um, has a shingle. As um, as, yeah, as you guys as you guys get back into the no, um, in the neck into yeah, yeah, the yeah. into the crooked cat, um, trying to put out this fire, mm -hmm. um, scrawled in blood on the floor oh. are the words "We know Storm Tower Six. Uh, we know. What do they what? know? No, oh, that Dark Brotherhood? God Bro, damn! Like, what yeah. do they know? You, you that did, we... You killed one of their own and then they landed evidence oh. of evidence <laughs> for a job? That's true! You did what? Like, planted evidence three days ago? I thought we were trying not to antagonize other factions. Mm. It's gonna happen anyways. They antagonized us first. Uh, you missed the part where sorry. they came in and, like, soft threatened us. It was really fun. Yeah. It was a way to throw Jurasco and any dragon marked houses off our set. We needed to get Fillion. We needed to get Basilisk Coil. This was a favor for Tartanin. Yeah. And that was the easiest way. So, good thing is, 12 and aren't on us. Bad thing is, Dask knows. Well, and you know, at the time, we sort of thought they were responsible for Aram. And turn of stone. Kind of. They are and they aren't. But tainted. The guy knew he was selling tainted stuff. They are going to be our enemy anyways. Right. Hey. Oh, fuck. Where's Whiskers? And that's where we're going to end tonight. So. <laughs> Ooh. Whiskers. That was so much fun, Jack. That was great. Thank, Thank you. you. That was Thank great. So My night. <laughs> yeah, sorry. <laughs> Um, well, you have. We'll another one. Yeah. I will forget next session. Gonna, There's probably a little moment, like straight out before they even we'll get back in there, where uh, Beerbot would uh, turn turn towards Bria because all the other ones are everywhere. And mm -hmm. she, she's injured, right? Yeah. Yeah. I have. Would you heal her? I have a medicine kit Sweet. and can cool. do that. Um, so. Thanks everybody for joining for tonight's game. Woo! Uh, we will see you guys tomorrow for some more spell jammer. Spell jammer. Yeah. Uh, Ooh. Spell jammer. Red light. Red light. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was oh, that's how I meant to introduce myself one of these times. It was like, hi, my name is Jack. Uh, I'm also known as the guy who does the red line in the red <laughs> line. <laughs> Left Anyways. to die. All right. Uh, we'll I see heard, you guys I heard tomorrow. you singing something else earlier. I, I don't know about that. Yeah. But uh, if, I, if, I did, some tunes, if I did sing some tunes, they'd be pretty cool. Yeah. They'd be pretty cool mm. tunes. Mm. Would they be? It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. I would say they're pretty uh, decent. Right. That's so dumb. Uh, That's so dumb. Take us out. 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 Take us out